Yo, thanks for coming in, guys. I'll be, I'll be set up in just a few minutes here. All right, what's going on, everybody? Uh, we're just about ready to get started. Um, the server just reset, so I'm trying to sneak in before we have to wait in the queue. Uh, I think the plan for tonight is probably going to be, you know, mostly DayZ, but we might do like half DayZ, half Tarkov. Um, obviously, we did get that new Tarkov update, and I played it quite a bit last stream. Um, I definitely didn't mean to sound too complainy. I think I'm just so addicted and loving DayZ right now that I was kind of pointing out like every little problem that still bugs me about Tarkov, you know? Um, but I don't know, truthfully, I'm gonna think a lot about it. Maybe I'd have some fun just, like, doing some really slow scav runs on the big maps, just, like, creeping around, you know, trying to find some loots, making money. Then on the other hand, it's like, you know, do I really give a shit about doing all the, the questing and the hideout progression? Maybe we just want to do, like, this immersive, like, survival mode, where we, like, start Tarkov each day with, like, nothing in our stash, and we try to play it like DayZ, you know, uh, where we're just trying to, like, gear up, survive, get into some intense PvP, like... I don't know. I'm not really in the, the mindset for Tarkov right now. That's why we're starting with DayZ. Um, if we have a good day of DayZ, let's stick with it. But if we have like a stupid death because we got a hand bug, then, you know, let's let's jump back over um, and try some more Tarkov. The thing is, like, I used to love the game so much and be so addicted to it. But when you take like a big break, it definitely feels weird, you know, getting back into like the sensitivity changing, depending on your gear, and getting back into like the clunky inertia movement, which feels nice, but... You know, sometimes you feel like you're on ice skates, other times you feel kind of, like, bulky and slow. So, anyways, you know, just take some time to get used to. Um, but I think it's kind of fun to start with Daisy, so we can get kind of warmed up, get into an adventure, um, and then make that decision later on. So, um, are we going to continue the character? Oh, so what's up, dude? No, I don't think we have any characters to continue. Um, you might have missed last stream, but we did continue that character, and uh, he ended up getting killed last stream. So, we're going to start totally fresh tonight. Um, let me just move my... Move all this audio equipment around a little bit. But dudes, thank you so much for coming in earlier. We got Natus, uh, Royal, Simple, uh, Sale Gaming. What's up, guys? Natus, or I already got you. We got Bacon, Pablo, Slow Turtle, um, Jaguar. It's awesome to see all these names flowing in. What's up, Dabsy? I didn't even realize it was Friday night. I thought it was Saturday or uh, Thursday night. Um, do you guys have any plans for the 4th? I was thinking about maybe doing something tomorrow night with some friends since it's the 4th of July, but I'm not really sure. It might be better to just stay in and play some games. We'll see. Um, yo, Bobby, what's going on, dude? I'm not sure what you meant by that. Uh, we got Broads, Latex, Beaver, uh, Pretty, what's up, dude? We got Tagana, um, Captain as well. Thanks for that three months sub. We got Little Red Riding. Thanks for the 14 months. Um, thanks for all the great stream smoke. We appreciate you. Dude, I appreciate you as well. And, um, yo, Tunnel Snakes. Thanks for the massive resub. It's good to see you in here tonight, man. 
Hope you guys are off to a decent weekend. Um, just got done watching the Tomorrow War. Ooh, without any spoilers, how is that movie? I was thinking about watching it, but obviously you see like one review and somebody says, oh, it's fucking bad, don't watch it, but some people probably like it. I need to find some like just nonsense action movies to watch while I'm trying to fall asleep. Um, yo, Machiavelli, 54 months. That's got to be the longest sub we're going to have, dude. Um, 54 long months of great entertainment. Thanks, Smoke. Hope you're, do hope you're enjoying Canada. <laughs> Thank you so much for the support, dude. You know, believe it or not, I've only been to Canada like twice. Or maybe once or twice. I want to go there again, though. Um, dude, Nermosi, thanks for all the bits. Uh, finally able to catch a stream. Work's been crazy. You missed the streams. Can't wait for tonight's shenanigans. Oh, dude, I'm feeling some shenanigans. I feel like lately we've just been super geared up in Daisy. You know, let's try to start small and, like, you know, go through the whole progression from nothing to everything. I think maybe the last two characters we started the stream with geared or something. Um, but yeah, we do have like four stashes down south in Esker. We gotta try to get back to one of those barrels and finish the DMR. Um, so we're probably gonna try to find that body piece tonight. Um, but yo, Amber, thanks for all the bits. What's up, Extition? Or Christian, that must be what it is. Um, we got Cyber as well, thanks for the gifted subs. Holy shit, Jmesh with the five gifted subs as well. Thanks for hooking everybody up, dude. Jmesh04 with the five gifts. Um, we got Taz as well, thanks for the 19 months. What's going on, Max? Uh, we got Belzy in here as well, Serbius. Uh, Brightest Lights, what's up? Hope you guys like the emotes. Uh, we do have the animated emotes in the works. So if you guys have any cool ideas for animations, let me know. Um, and Jay says, love the streams, can't wait to keep seeing more. Dude, thanks for the support with the 7 months, man. We got Audio, uh, Slick Nick, Paste. Thanks for the support, just got done moving. Haven't been able to sit down and catch a stream in over a month. Hope everything's going well. Aw, oh, shit. Hopefully we can have a fun one tonight, dude. Everything's been really, really good. Um, we went through a phase of having, you know, Nemolsk, and now we got this new Essiker map. So it's fun. It's kind of like a work in progress. It's a modded map. Um, but that's probably the coolest part. It's like we might just get a new update that extends the airfield or adds a few more, like, spawn towns. Um, and it's kind of fun that we can have a say in the development of the map by, like, playing it and giving live feedback and stuff. So, yeah, I've been enjoying it, man. Um, what's up, Malinka? We got Fitz. Thanks for the two month sub, dude. Oh shit, actually, uh, <clears throat> we are number one in the queue. I was a little bit too late joining after the server restart, but it's all good. We'll get in once the next person leaves. Let me just make sure that our position is sealed here. Um, dude, it's legit. Tarkov is having some growing pains and Daisy's in a really good place right now. Oh yeah, man. I mean, I'm glad you see it that way too. I know we got a lot of people in the same mindset, so... I never want to sound too one-sided. Both Daisy and Tarkov are amazing. You know, we just got to focus on which one might be in a better spot for us. Um, and really, the longer break we take from Tarkov, the better. Because eventually it's going to get, you know, this is kind of a small update. It's eventually going to get a really big update. So, eh, we'll see how much we play tonight. Um, yo, Nugget, thanks for the 22 months. Um, Helk as well, she says, uh, hope you get into some raids. I tried tonight, three raids, waited over 10 minutes. Oh, Helk, if you're still listening, um, did you go into your launcher? take it off of auto select and hand select or manually select the servers one by one and um, just select the ones that you have a good connection to I swear everybody that does that has like five minutes or less or at least I was having pretty quick um, I was having pretty quick matches we have jackpot we got ginger snaps thanks for all the resubs guys we're just waiting in queue right now oh glass did you notice something <laughs> Uh, Pink, is it good or bad? Uh, the Devil All the Time is a great movie that I think you'd enjoy. You know, I think I've seen that. I gotta look into it. Is that one on Netflix? Yo, Good Carpet, thanks for the 10 gifted subs, bro. That's insane, man. Check and see if you guys are getting hooked up with the gifted subs from Carpets. Uh, we got Tim, Black Cat, Revo, uh, Medium, what's up guys? Jada, what's up? I hope you've been enjoying the streams, dude. We got Bevels, thanks for the 10 months. Alright, guys. This is what we're looking at. Let's just chill for a few and wait till we get in. Um, Loons as well, thanks for the 9. We got Punk Rock, thanks for the 20 month sub. What's going on, True? Uh, yes, Man Over Mars is doing the animated emotes. And I think Man Over Mars is also taking like a few more commissions coming up. Um, so yeah, I'm going to try to do as much artwork through Mars as possible. Uh, we'll get some more emotes, animated emotes, and then probably... 
I don't know, maybe like Twitch banners and YouTube stuff as well from him. Um, and then maybe the merchandise that a few people have wanted. Maybe like a basic hoodie or t-shirt or something, you know. Um, Bo Main, what's up, dude? Been loving Daisy lately. Really enjoying the Deer Isle map. Gotta love a main map in Daisy. Oh, I keep forgetting that we have a modded map based off a of main. I keep forgetting that's where Deer Isle is based. Damn. Yeah, I gotta play that map soon. Maybe after the next update, or maybe... I think it just got, like, a new island added to it, right? It's probably worth checking out. Um, you have Dread, what's up, dude? Thanks for all the streams. It's made such a better... Made you such a better Daisy player. Oh, that's awesome. You can take something and apply it, man. Um, Slavonia. Yeah, Livonia would be nice, Dave. I just don't want to do, like, a low-pop Livonia on a Friday night. I think, like, early... Some random weekday. We just gotta jump in there and try to convince a bunch of people to play Livonia, you know? Uh, but I swear, before we made the Day 1 Livonia server, the map was pretty much dead. I think Daisy Core and a few other servers hosted it. But I swear that we kind of brought Livonia back to life in a sense, just for like our little circle of people. And then once Namals came out, it kind of overshadowed it and it just took its place. So, the cycle could eventually continue if a handful of us people or streamers or community members just jump into Livonia and stick with it. And try to show everybody that you can have a good time still. So, yeah, I don't really want to do it this weekend, man, but we got to make a day for it soon. I guess I'm partly responsible for uh, being able to reach out and, like, just tell people, hey, you know, give the server a shot, give the map a shot. Um, B.O. Brand, what's up, dude? We got Turtle. Um, Glass, thanks for that 28 months. Uh, yeah, or, uh, is it Ayala? Thanks for that three gifts. Uh, we got a gift this up going out to William. Thank you so much, dude. Um, we got Nasty Nick. Thanks for that eight-month sub. You haven't, you give it a try. Oh, definitely do that with your launcher, Hulk. Yeah, before you even open the game. Hmm. How was the class reunion? Haven't seen the last few streams. Oh, dude, it was so good to reconnect with all my old buddies from high school. It was like the main group of us guys, and then, like, you know, some of my buddies dated this other group of girls, and, like, we were all good friends, and it was, like, the perfect group. Like, all of us that used to hang out and stuff on the weekends, they were all at the reunion, so it was perfect, dude. It was a really good weekend, and I think I'm going to see them again for that, uh, I think it's like the McGregor fight, that big UFC event. I think a few more of them are coming back, so it was a good time, man. I'm definitely reconnected with some people. Um, yo, Bayoup, thanks for giving that sub to Black. You want to get back in Itarga, but for some reason I just don't feel like it. Yeah, I was thinking a lot about it last night, man, and I don't really care to, uh, like, I know what happens when we play a lot of Tarkov. We really don't have any purpose for the hideout or the trades or the questing like we really just don't you know once you get your vendors up to level four so it's like i almost think that i if i'm gonna play tarkov i need to crack into that like survival hardcore mode that these people are doing like i know deadly slob does it um because i think that might be the only way for me to enjoy the game is doing that like really hardcore you just like have nothing you have access to nothing you're just getting wrecked but once you get like a nice build it feels so good and then it, it feels so bad to lose it like I don't know. Until they change the progression, I might just have to play that way, so. It'll be fun, though. It just feels weird, you know. I'd rather just play DayZ, I guess. Um, clonk time. Yeah, I think Mars is going to make an animated uh, clonk emote just to see what it looks like. Oh, shit. Okay, we just got back in. Alright, let's see where we spawned in. Obviously we died last time, so this is going to be a fresh character for us to start with. Oh damn, we got some nighttime. I guess we'll try to get this out of the way. My stream deck's been really, really weird lately. It's like, uh, the hotkeys are super delayed with the music. It's kind of, it's too bad. It's only a few seconds, though. So. Hmm. Damn, I don't know if I've ever spawned here. Nothing but zero to air runs. Yeah, that's probably how we have to do it for Tarkov. Is like, I think at the end of the night, it'd be kind of fun to just sell like everything. Except for one loadout. Just gear up with all your best stuff, sell everything else. And then, in the beginning of the day, it's kind of like this. Like, you look at your Tarkov stash, you have nothing. Um... And then, one, you know, you build up during the raid, you find all your stuff in raid from kills. And, uh, yeah, once you lose it, it's like fucking Daisy, you know? You got nothing. Oh shit, that's nice chaos. Let's go the other way. 
think there's a road sign all the way down here that'll probably tell us where we're at. Yo, ugly. Thanks for the three months, dude. Gauzy, thanks for the fifty dollar donation. What? Dude, fifty bones. Big respect. Uh, for all that you've done with the servers and the commitment to the game over the years. Love watching your old VODs back in the times like 0 0.63. Uh, before 2020, I hadn't played it since the mod. Crazy to see how far it's come. Dude, that's so awesome that you're back from the old mod days, man. And uh, thank you so much for saying that, dude. Thanks for being part of the community. Seriously, all you guys are helping, uh, you know, helping us fill up the servers and helping us spread the good word about DayZ. So, thank you, dude. Uh, we got Shu with the resub as well. Been following you for years. Just started subscribing. Love the streams. Dude, thank you so much, man. And we got Zoe as well. Thanks for the tier 3, uh, 54 months. Zoe, thanks for everything, dude. Thanks for being the biggest supporter here. Um, I hope you're having a good weekend, dude. We got Meggy and uh, Steely Boy. Thanks for the big resubs as well. Alright, so this guy, this has to be a road sign here, right? Yo, what's up, Sleepy? Ooh, okay, here we go. We got some good options. We can go to the new area that's next to Tuke. Oh, there's a fucking guy back there. We can go to the new area next to Tuke, or we can go to Novigrad. I think we should probably do Novigrad, because it's like a little mini city. But I'm sure some of you guys haven't seen the new spawn town, Pekchu. We got a few houses down there, too. I think this guy's AFK. What the fuck? Hello. Hey. Oh, there's two of you. I don't know this guy. Hello. Alright. Hey, um, did you just check out uh, Took? Did you loot down the street? Yeah, we're we're coming from Talk or whatever. Oh, somebody was shooting an SKS. Was that you guys? No, that's this direction. I, you might have been going towards Bond still or something to the military base. It was pretty. All right. It was out there though in the field. Only. Hey, no worries. You think you'd knock this guy with that sledge so I get his apple? Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, what? Sure. This guy. Dish. Dish. Thanks, sir. Take it easy, boys. These guys are chill. Fuck. <laughs> I'm gonna go this way. They're going the other. Wait a minute. So what is down here? These are the new houses. But then what's beyond the new houses? Lug and Essaker. Eh. I don't know. If we're going for shenanigans, we should probably go the other way. Should probably go back to Tuk and just get started small. Uh, Ramo, I'm glad you know this. Oh fuck, I'm getting called a bitch by somebody. Fuck me. Oh shit, it's the guy that we jacked. <laughs> I didn't do shit to that guy. Come here, you dumb. Yo, I didn't do that to you, man. They went the other way. Trust me, those fucking guys have sledgehammers. They went the other way. Yo, yo, fuck you, dude. Oh Jesus Christ. You shouldn't have been AFK, dude. Can't be, can't be going AFK in the streets, man. They took your fucking apple. Come on, come on, come on. Just knock me out, pretty. No, 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 no. I know what you want to do. You want to spawn somewhere else. Go fuck yourself. Go find a knife. Your mom. I'm gonna find your mom in my house. I'm sure you will. Bitch. I'm sure you will. That's all you know in English, right? Mom jokes. I'm gonna fuck your mm -hmm. mom. That's what I thought. Yep. Later yep. Wife. Good one. Yep. And your sister and your young sister with five years old. Keep going, dude. Keep going. I wanna hear some more. That's not enough. No, I can't hear. He just wants to respawn. I don't really want to give it to him. We could make his ass limp, though. Yeah, he probably just died in like a gunfight, and now he just wants to respawn back down there with his buddies.
I almost prefer when they say shit. Like, keep going, dude. Save, uh, save the next guy the trouble. Hello. Say it to me instead of the next guy. This is Elmo. Ooh. Too slow, dude. Oh, I can let the zombie kill you. You suck. It's your mom, bitch. <laughs> That's all he knows how to say is your mom. Oh shit, we need the new fucking 1.13 zombies. I can't block these ones. Time up. Nah, once they're unconscious, they can just hit the respawn button. You can't really prevent them from getting a new spawn. Should have done is tried to find. I think there's like a couple of hunting spots around here. Maybe we get a knife. Oh, that's right. I already took his apple. I don't know why I'm looking for his apple. Probably best if I wear this. Ooh, I should have come up here sooner. We got a piece. No bullets though. Yo, dude, bugger dude. Thanks for someone for a full year. That was a stick. And thanks for giving out the five subs as well, bugger. Um, we got Darth RPO. Uh, Mambit, thanks for the big resub for almost three years, dude. We got Flacco with the new sub. Um, and Terrible, dude. Thanks for the tier three resub as well. Thank you so much, guys. I think there was some more food in here. Fuck. These guys are tanks. I could give you guys a little bit of gamma if it's too dark, but let me try to find a glow stick. Um, DJ, yeah, you haven't played Days in a while, so you can put a bullet in the chamber, but if you find a fresh pistol that's spawned on the ground, it'll never have one bullet in the chamber. However, it could have a magazine, and if you get so lucky that the you know it spawns with a mag with bullets, then yeah, you could find that. It's actually weird. Sometimes I'll find the pistol with a mag in the ground, and it'll already have the bullet in the chamber. Other times you have to chamber it by pressing R. Yeah, a lot of people have been complaining that the Twitch notifications aren't getting set on on time. Probably gonna spawn around here. Ooh. Now we need something to open those with. You never get the notifications from Twitch. Yeah, I wouldn't even rely on the Twitch notifications. Like either um join the Discord 
and turn on the alerts just for like the uh what the hell is it called the announcements tab or just follow me on twitter dude this room is so good i just spawned a new thing of rice and we got two things of lunch meat Yo, Space Jam, thanks for that three months, dude. Anything new to talk over? Just playing for the hell of it. Anyways, thanks for the badass content. Oh, it's a brand new wipe. The main, no matter what, the main thing is just the first, like, month after a wipe. That's when everybody's working their way up. It's kind of fun to fight each other. Um, but other than that, yeah, so Factory got expanded a little bit, and there's a new boss on Factory. And they've made some tweaks to encourage, like, friendly scavs and stuff. Which we'll talk about that later. I like what they're doing with the whole scav karma system. But, I don't know, man. I trust, like, some people to obey, and I think the rest are just going to shoot everybody on sight. You know, whether they're too new to understand who's who, or they're just too experienced and they just want to kill people. Like, you know, some some of my best runs ever are random team-ups, but some of my other best runs are when I'm a scav, and I am killing, like, other player scavs without a penalty. So, I don't know, man. It's kind of a, it's a good and bad system, I guess, with the whole karma. We'll have to see how it works for them. Okay, how do I get to Tuke from here? Let's try to get to that new spawn town. I'm um, keen to see how you do it so well. Never got to see how you start out in DayZ once you're, and then uh, get stacked up. Oh yeah, cool man. I mean, probably the best time to watch is when someone's a freshie, if you're trying to learn. Really just gotta figure out where loot spawns. Like this modded map, it's got all these really cool like custom loot spawns. Like, this table's knocked over, and loot can spawn right there. And then you could come in here and be like, you know, there might be a box of ammo literally like half stuck inside of that um, sack. So you just gotta know where shit can spawn, really. Just gotta check all around. And obviously knowing the maps, you can travel efficiently, right? Yo, what's up, Mandy? I'm trying to let about an hour pass to see, like, natural uh, comments about stuff changing. <laughs> but so many people are trying to get it out of me. Are you just now getting the Twitch notification? This is the right way. Uh, Nikita already said the system is fucked and will be overhauled. Oh, okay, cool. <laughs> step in the right direction, though. That's probably what this... Like, to sum up the current talk of update, it's like, step in the right direction. It's not going to wow you if you're a long-time player, but if you're, if you're still enjoying it a lot, it's a good update for sure, so... Oh, uh, you got my bro hooked. He just got a uh, Daisy on sale. Oh, I should be talking about that. Is Daisy still on sale right now? Is it like a 40% off? Yeah, I should probably put something like that in the title. It's on sale for 40% until the 8th. Oh, dude, that's really good. Yeah, yeah. Tell your friends about the Steam sale. And yo, Cinnamon. What's up, dude? Uh, thanks for giving out that sub to Caleb. We got Darth as well with the two months. Uh, Drunken, thanks for the 19 months. Is it Space? Thanks for using the Prime again, dude. Okay, I see something up there. Maybe a few houses. Oh, it's not really doing an ad for Bohemia. It's all about some people have been watching my stream probably wanting to buy the game. It's always weird because some days you just start assuming that like everybody knows about DayZ and everybody already owns it. But it's so cool lately that I'll have these new people coming in trying
trying to learn the game or that maybe they don't own the game yet, but they're thinking about buying it on Xbox or something. So, uh, yeah, I just want to let everybody know the, the game's on sale, really. Maybe even, like, buy a gift to send to somebody on Steam, you know? Yo, what's up, Jay? Thanks, man. Yeah, all you guys that are telling me the audio sounds great. I'm secretly smiling over here. I just didn't want to say too much because I want to, like... I wanted all the people to come in and be like, wait a minute, something sounds different. And I didn't know if they were going to say, like, really good or exactly the same or much worse or anything, you know. But, uh, yeah, I'm glad the audio sounds good. We are testing out some new, new stuff, new settings. My only, the, probably the next test is going to see, like, how does the uh, volume match up against the game sounds? We gotta practice that next. Alright, let's go up to Tuke. The quickest way to get to the newest spawn town is through Tuke. I haven't actually spawned in the new town yet, unfortunately. Alright, so we gotta get some 9 mil, and we gotta get an AK-74 at some point. We're all up here in Tuke, so we gotta get this map updated, but on the far left side of Tuke is this place called Pakshu. And that's kinda where we're heading. Close to the mic. Nah, I've always been about a fist away from my mic. Fist length away. And actually, like... You know, I don't want to breathe into the mic. I don't want you guys to hear me typing on my keyboard and all that stuff. So it might be a, a work in progress over the next few streams to get everything right. This is that fucking dude. These are those same two dudes that sledgehammered the first guy. But they were going the other way. I guess they came back. I'm definitely not trying to team up with them because they're super geared up. Whoa, what the f fucking... Did you guys see that? The zombie was invisible. Or am I just blind? Let me see if I can get this mic in the perfect position. Bear with me here. Oh shit, are these fucking dudes coming? I think some bad dudes are afoot. Sorry if you heard a bunch of crazy noises. Uh, well, no, subjected. I had the RE20 mic right before this, and now I have the SM7B. Yeah, they're both very good.
I gotta get to one of these water pumps before these guys show up again. Yeah, I'm pleased with it. I was surprised to see so many people use it. You know, lots of podcasts or people that are doing speeches and stuff. It's like one of the most common mics. Or maybe not common, but one of the like best mics. It's probably common, I just don't know if it's common for streaming. Oh, it's the number one live audio mic on the market. Okay, so it is probably up there for streaming as well. open these beans, I just don't want to. Uh, I came across a server in the community on console that says it's yours, is it fake or smoke approved? Nah, I don't have any approved console servers, man. It's one of those things where for the longest time, uh, day one has had copycats on PC, so I knew it was just a matter of time until we had copycats on console just using our name to get like a little bit of free, you know, just exposure. Players are going to be recognizing it and jump in maybe. If they like saw a streamer playing on day one, but um, I don't really know what to say about it. Like on one hand, I'm just like grinning, smiling, like ah oh, yeah, must be doing something right. But on the other hand, it's like should I reach out and be like yo, you know what the fuck? So I don't know. I gotta talk to the admin team and see what they think about something like that. But yeah, take a picture of it and send it to me, man. I'd love to see what it's called or what's all about. Because, like, some people I'd probably just be like, you know what, whatever. But then, depending on how they conduct themselves, then it might get a little ugly. Shoddy. Got no shells. Like, at the end of the day, you can't stop somebody from using words. But there are maybe a few things you can do if they're, like, real assholes. Always reach out to your reputation. Well, sometimes it's easy to know that they're a fake, and sometimes you can't really do much about it, you know? Oh, shit. Yep. Hello. Pump's over there, man. I'm sure he knows that. Oh, shit. What the hell? Fucking helmet on, dude. Oh, it's probably for the best. Unless we want a teammate. I don't know. Do we want a teammate? Probably not. Hmm. Didn't stop to take a drink. What a nice day. Not stopping loot. Okay, so we got some new houses down there. And then from there we can get to the new town. I think it's probably like southwest of us directly. Maybe south southwest. Or no, west southwest, right? <coughs> Try to rob them.
Yeah, I guess we haven't really checked the other side of the road yet. Yo, Def, thanks for that tier 3 48 months, man. Freaking 4 years subbing. Thank you very, very much. Uh, do you still have your stash and ask her with the building on parts? Um, I should. It is this server. We probably have like 3 or 4 full barrels stashed. Um, I want to say at least one of them has been found, but I have the parts spread out. So... Yeah, we gotta get down there tonight. I gotta see if it's still there. Dude, Iceman, thanks for the 5 gifted subs. That's huge, dude. We had Goker, um... A Rizzy, thanks for the resubs, and uh, Coney, it says five months a day. Um, here, let me get in here and chill for a sec. Um, <clears throat> thank you for the constant laughs, me and my twin are watching you after a short night downtown celebrating. Thanks for the amazing community, love the chat, and appreciate you, dude. Oh man, it's Miko's birthday tomorrow. Dude, happy, uh, happy early birthday to your brother, man. Thank you so much for supporting the stream. Hope you guys had a good night. Um, yo, Goyard, thanks for the new sub. April, thanks for the five gifted subs. Uh, do you still have your stash? Okay, I already got that. Yeah, so the stash has every single part except for the, the body piece. Um, so that's what we're looking for tonight. Like, I actually wanted to play some Namalsk tonight, but I figure I'm not going to swap over to Namalsk until we at least use this new DMR once. Until I at least build it or kill somebody and get it. Um, but again, April, thank you so much for all the gifts. Uh, you had a question about the mic. Oh, Guna, yeah, this one is the SM7B. I finally got it hooked up thanks to Gustav earlier today. Now I think when I look over at the second monitor, when I look at my chat, I'm kind of not, I'm not really facing my mic. So it's going to take me a few days to get the setup ready. Space for that. Winter DMR. Um, so there's a like a modded weapon pack called Morty's, and he has a bunch of different parts that you can put together to assemble either a five five six or a seven six two by five four gun. And it's basically a DMR. It's a uh, semi-auto Mosin that you can put any attachments on pretty much. You can put like a front grip on it, scope, suppressor, different types of butt stocks. So you know, back in like other video games or even Tarkov where you're putting guns together, it just it makes total sense to have some kind of build a gun in DayZ. You know, it's a survival game, you're finding stuff, you're progressing. Sounds like a gun you want to fuck with. Yeah, so the problem with those guns right now is the first shot is going to stun lock you with armor. And the gun can shoot so fast, you don't have time to get out of the stun lock. They're just going to destroy you. But that's I guess that's why it's a, the top gun or the best gun. So If you hit your shots, yeah. Well, if you hit one shot, <laughs> then you can probably hit the rest. Oh, there's no working cars on this server yet, but I think I think Esker could eventually have some cars. Shit, shit, shit. Best melee? Uh, I would say the pickaxe. I would say the sledge, but it weighs five kilos. Pickaxe only weighs one, and it's got arguably the best like headshot, the easiest headshot. Ah. 
Ooh, there we go. But you can easily settle for just like a splitting axe or a fire axe. In the new updates, I might be favoring something like this. It's basically like a knife with more range. Two hit power attack headshots. Or you just get a knife and it's like two power attacks and then one small attack headshots. Just chilling here for a sec. We need some 762. <laughs> What's going on, Liquid? I don't think we have enough people in Tuke to be opening up the store, unfortunately. Maybe next time that, like, Novigrad or Borosh is crazy. Oh, yo, there's somebody up there in that building. Maybe it's a zombie. Looks like a zombie with a huge backpack got trapped up there. Dead guy in the streets. Pakistan server? Uh, I don't think we're really sure yet. So one of the desert maps coming out is going to be like exclusive to one or two servers only and then eventually they're going to open it up or they're going to want other servers to host it. So that's kind of a question mark right now. Some people have different opinions on how that's going to go. But uh, the other map, um, Takistan, that's a possibility. I haven't really looked into it myself, but I think everybody's rooting for it, hoping that they're doing a good job with it. You know, I love Esker, but you could argue that it came out a little bit too early. I think Esker's early reputation might still be kind of stained for some people because they they didn't want to deal with the zombies going through doors. So I swear to God, like some people don't even play Esker because they just they just think that's still happening or some shit. They just they're just playing Namalsk or Trinaris or whatever. So I just hope that these other maps don't open it too early. Or you know, don't do some like pay to play thing too fu too long. You know. But we'll we'll see how it goes. Okay, yeah, obviously everybody's gonna be talking about it when it comes out. If it's good. It's gonna be hard to avoid if it's good. Ooh, nice food. flow of it all works out too. Like eventually we're going to get an update for Namalsk, we're going to get another update for Essaker, and we're going to get one or two of these desert maps. So hopefully they're spaced out very well and we're not sitting there like with two brand new maps or two brand new updates to play in like the exact same week. I guess that might be a little bit annoying. Dude, Speed, thanks for the 20 gifted subs, man. Speed Racer fucking hooking us up. Thanks for all the support, dude. That's 1,500 subs. 1500 gifts from this guy. Thank you so much, dude. That's a fucking insane amount of subs. The 
There's not too many people in this town. I think we gotta bounce. Let's go down to Maxim- or no, not Maximilian. Let's go down to the new spawn town and then Maximilian. Food. Yeah, I just noticed that there's something else in that police car that I gotta go check. Yeah, thank you so much, Speed. That's huge, man. What's going on, Spec? Uh, we got Rhino. NJ as well, thanks for the five months about to hit the hay. I guess plans change. Ah, you never know. You might fall asleep to Daisy or something crazy might happen. We'll see. Thanks for tuning in, dude. Uh, you think Namalska is the best survival experience? Yeah, it is. You know, you just gotta rotate them. Play one for a few months or play one one day or for a few hours, then swap it up. You know, it's definitely nice to keep things fresh. I agree that there's something special about Namalsk that eliminates some of the fuckery where people are just kind of like screwing around. You can't really screw around in Namalsk. You gotta take things a little bit more seriously. I know a lot of people are complaining though. Wait, I don't see a weapon repair kit. Where is it? A lot of people are complaining that Namalsk is nothing but kill on sight. But that's because it's a bit harder to survive, I guess. Oh, I think you were talking about that little box of ammo. It's all good. Alright, but we got three buckshot and then we got a box of ten rubbers just in case we run out. Alright, so they don't have pack shoe on the road signs yet, do they? Wait a minute, so somehow April is gifting a sub to speed, even though he's the one dropping the gift bombs. Gifting out subs without even having your sub. I appreciate it, dude. And dudette. Oh, is this locked? <laughs> Fuck it. Let's get that backpack without ruining it. No, sh no shortage of food in this map. Sometimes you can't get that battery out like that. Uh, pro, I don't know, man. Like that zombie down there, you'd think that he'd be aggroed on my gunshots right now. I'm not sure how it works. Maybe they look in your direction, and if they don't have line of sight, they just give up a little bit sooner. But yeah, I was a little disappointed the other day in the big city when somebody fired, like, the new super loud shotgun. And zombies, like, 30 meters away just immediately gave up on interest, so... I don't know. They don't seem to be as interested in, like, mid-range shots as they used to be. Could have something to do with performance, but the server feels really good right now. Or it could just be one of those, like, daisy things that's currently a little iffy, you know? Sometimes you have a horde of zombies on you. In, like, a mill base or a town. Other times you're wondering why there's only, like, two. I 
Oh, no, Huff, it's not. I was just changed my name a bunch when I used to play Halo. We would have, like, this little Halo team, and I used to change my name quite often until it finally landed on Smoke, and then I just stuck with it. Agro range is probably shorter inside of a building. Oh, yeah, that makes a little bit of sense. Gunshots inside of a building. Fuck, I'm super full right now. Alright, so these are new houses. I've only been here like once or twice. Let's see what we got. Yeah, Survivor, we checked out the new Tarp Cup patch a little bit last stream. I think we played it for, what, like seven hours or something? Maybe six hours? Uh, we might play a few hours of it tonight. We're definitely going to play a little bit more no matter what. What was your Halo 3 tag? Um, it was Smoke something. Probably whatever our team name was at the time. I used to be one of those dudes, man. One of those fucking Halo 2 and Halo 3, 4v4 competitive team dudes. <laughs> we had, I had the same group of buddies for so long, man. I remember this one, or I knew two of the guys. Um, like, I still know their real names and like where they're from and all this stuff. We had like the tightest little four-man Halo squad for the longest time. It was like the first time that I actually had some good like online gaming buddies, you know? But, um, I met them playing Halo 2 on Xbox Live. So, I feel like all of us have our little initial group of Xbox Live friends that, you know, stuck together through multiple games. Maybe not everybody, but, yeah. Yeah, KSI and STK shoot to kill. Remember the fucking STK Halo 2 team was, like, the most notorious when I was playing? Or, like, everybody was talking about how cool they were. Chucking. Yeah, I already got a shotty. There's a bunch of Delbrow shotties here. Might as well just shoot the zombies. A little bit of attention is not going to hurt. Oh! Put that away, dude. What are you doing? Did I drop my melee weapon or something? We swapped over to the hatchet and I dropped my other melee, that's why. Might be something good up there. Can't wait for Halo to disappear from the universe. Well, I feel like Halo has obviously fallen off, but now they're trying to make another comeback with a new one, having like free multiplayer. And, um, you know, when I went to the high school reunion, everyone was saying, yo, I can, you know, we can finally play together because Halo is going to be multi or uh, cross platform and. You know, I'm still on Xbox or on PC, so... I don't know. I'll probably check it out so I can play with them a little bit. But I doubt it's gonna... I doubt the addiction's gonna set in like it used to. <laughs> Halo Unlimited. What's the new Halo called? Halo Infinite? Hmm. 
Yo, what's up, party? Oh, they've been good, man. Actually, the last few Esker streams have been pretty action-packed, but I still haven't built this new, like, DMR build-a-gun. Yo, what's up, Prophet? Not sure if this is the right way, but we'll eventually end up in this new pack shoot place. I hope there's some people in the spawn town. I haven't spawned here before, so I'm a little worried it's not getting enough love. So that's why I kind of want to show it off. Oh yeah, PDX. My close buddies know what I do. My closest buddies know about the stream. Nah, Snub, you have to have Morty's, like a certain part of Morty's weapon pack to have the Build-A-Gun DMR. Yo, what's up, Jodas? So nice to come home from work and see the stream. Yo, thanks for all the bits, man. Uh, how many parts for the build again? So if you get the body piece and the barrel, those are the two main. Then you can actually use it. But then you can get buttstock, front grip, suppressor. Actually, I should probably take that. Um, bipod, various different optics. And, couple, yeah, a couple different magazines. And then depending on the server, you can actually swap barrels and like turn it from a 7.62 to a 5.56. But I think on this one it's only the Dorp, thanks for gifting that sub to MP. And uh, Michelangelo, thanks for gifting that sub to Profit. Shit, I probably should have stayed in the main road to get to this place. We'll see a dirt path eventually. Um, the suppressor is available, but it's not the DMR suppressor. Actually, the normal NATO suppressor goes on the gun. Like, the same one that would go on a 5.56 M4 uh, goes on the build gun. So, we got that in the stash. So, down that road... Damn, they don't actually list the paths. That's too bad about this map, is they don't list the dirt paths over here. Ooh, I see something. That's got to be it over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see some distant buildings. It's probably just down this tree line.
Might as well eat while we walk. I guess we don't really need the knife and the hatchet. Probably just one. Since we got a sharpened stone. Yo, what's up, Barbie? Yo, Furious, thanks for the 26, man. No worries. We got purple, thanks for the 4 months. Small, thanks for the 5. I think I already got you. It was Perp Queen that I missed. Thanks for the 17 month sub, dude. Yeah, I love seeing you on Daisy. Talk, I was nice, but Daisy feels like home. Yeah. You know, we'll get a good mix of both then eventually, man. I'm glad you enjoyed Daisy. Uh, do you think the armor got enough of a nerf? So, nobody really tests experimental, sadly, so who the fuck knows, right? But, uh, yeah, they nerfed the armor from, like, 300 HP down to 225. I think the shock absorption was 55% resistance, and now it's, like, 40%, so... It's heading in the right direction, but nobody's gonna know if it's enough until we get into a handful of gunfights. And have, like, you know, some really... silly outcomes, and... people absorbing three snipe shots in a row. Or maybe it'll feel good, you know? But I guess I, we should make it our mission to do at least one more test day and experimental. We almost need to like hire some people to go and loot experimental. Just get like five plate carriers, a bunch of guns, and just meet me in the spawn zone. We'll do a bunch of tests. Um, or you can actually have like host the server and have the admins like spawn in all the test stuff. And we could just sit there and grind it out. And just be like, alright, each, you know, this armor takes this many bullets, blah blah blah. Might want to do that as well. Okay, so this is the new spawn town pack shoe. Apparently it's not getting enough player spawns. Like, people aren't actually starting out here like they should very often. But let's see if we can find some people. Last time I was here there was like four dudes fully loaded. Or they all had guns at least. Hopefully I can get a compass here so we can get out. There's a water pump here, but I guess we could pop a pill and just drink out of the pond. But I saw that, man. I think it's heading in the right direction. Yeah, I know. Well, back to the armor thing. That might be the best way to do it. It's like the best helmet and the best armor can absorb one of the best bullet in the game. Maybe the armor can absorb two. But, uh, yeah, I think three is definitely too much. And I think the devs realize that, so... It's probably swapping from, like, two... Or three bullets to the chest down to two. And then the helmet might still be two, unfortunately. Like two, five, five, six shots of the head is probably a little bit too much if you ask me. In Daisy, it's not always easy to like snipe somebody right in the face mid combat if you're looking at each other or if you're sniping long range. I feel like for the most part, you should almost always be rewarded for a headshot. Shit. 
Let's get bullets for this. Yo, what's up, Grogu? Yeah, the, the plan until we get it done is to build the DMR. That's pretty much our daily goal. Yo, what's up, J-Man? And, uh, Rubber Duck, thanks for the 10 months sub. Next order, thanks for the 6. What are you doing? Quiet down, son. Chips, pate, bullets. I bet there's just not enough spawn points around here. I think everybody keeps spawning at like Novigrad and Borish still. It's alright though. I'm sure somebody will show up, especially if I keep shooting zombies. Not sure if I want to try to make a friend tonight or if we just want to go solo. I think if I'm going back to my stash and trying to like get to Heli Crashes down south, we should go solo. But we'll see who shows themselves. Um, I can't tell you exactly how many parts, man. Just remember there's only two essential parts of the DMR and then everything else is a bonus. But let's say like seven total. Body, barrel, butt, handguard, suppressor, scope, bipod. And then you got, you know, different things, like different types of optics, different types of butt, uh, butt stocks. You can finally hear my voice. Really? It was that bad for you before, Bad Lou? You couldn't hear very well with my old mic? You saw a player? Really? Was it a zombie or a player? Over this way? Oh shit, dead snake. Oh, he's running to the left. That's some rice. We gotta check all these boxes for the special loot. It sounds pristine. Yeah, we went from damage to pristine, I guess, in the audio department. Slightly damaged.
Damn, I'm starting to see, uh, we get a few complaints that there's a little bit too much food on this map. Maybe it's just me because I'm in an empty town, but damn, we're getting hooked up. There's no shortage of food. This rice is even 75%. I think my stomach was already full. Oh yeah, holy shit, dude, my white apple is already full. So we found two lunch meats. A full thing of jam, a full thing of rice, a full thing of beans. And then a few other things. I just worry it's making people play a little bit too casually. Yeah, I've never seen anybody fish on Esker. I mean, some people complain about not fishing and, and not hunting. I think it should be more of a thing. But in the back, it's always just like... You either risk your life to go into a town and loot, or you risk your life to go out in a field and fire like a loud hunting rifle, and then skin it, and then cook it, so... Yeah, there should be a little bit more need to fish and cook, or, uh, hunt, but, I don't know. No matter what, I don't think it should be 100% essential. It would be nice, though, like, if you find the fishing supplies or, or, uh, hunting rifle with a few bullets before you get enough food, it'd be nice if players went and did those things. But right now, they're just too confident that they can go and find enough food elsewhere. Somebody might be sneaking up on me, actually. Oh. Oh. He went into, like, slow motion on me. Actually done looting food. We have so much. Is that a guy? Oh! Oh shit! Oh, what the fuck? Yeah. Hey, What's up, dude? People? I got a helmet on. I'm just here to check out the new city, dude. I don't want any problems. Alright, dude. Can you hear me? Uh, you sound like you're underwater. You got a fish tank on your head or some shit? The fuck did you say to me? I don't know. I can't hear you. I'm just saying. You sound like muffled. I'm just, I don't want any problems. I'm sorry. I just want to just want to check out this place. Okay. Well... Hey, I'm gonna go over here, please. <laughs> Just don't shoot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you dirty bastard, I'm coming for you. Hey, hey, hey. Oh shit, dude. Oh, dude, dude, dude. Fuck. Get on the fucking shit. ground, dude. What are you on your fucking right. pockets? Okay. Get on the ground, dude. Alright. All right. I'm not, okay. I'm not, I'm not gonna fucking blast you. Okay, alright, alright. Turn around, turn around. Drop oh, all your shit. shit. Just drop your shit, I'm not gonna kill you. I'm not gonna <sighs> kill you. Relax, dude, relax. Okay. Alright, cool. Drop that axe, dude. Come on now. Okay, uh... Okay. There you go. What are you up to? I'm just checking out this new place over here. Fucking hell, you got some good shit, dude. You got two loaded guns, huh? Uh, Three loaded guns. Uh, four loaded guns. Fucking hell, you what? didn't even... Why aren't you walking around with your guns out, dude? I've been blasting loads over here. I mean, I've been... <laughs> I've been blasting my fucking, uh pistol on these zombies over here. 
Why don't you come uh, over with your the fucking way I play, dude. I'm a pretty friendly player. Right. Uh, I like okay. to interact and talk first, but we so see I if you're wanna if you're friendly. Somebody shoot at me. If you're friendly, you can't just walk into a fucking hot zone with your axe out, dude. You're gonna get blasted eventually. I thought this. I thought this was a. Sp I don't know. Somebody was saying this was a spawn zone. So. I yeah, yeah, but dude, people, out. people, people do as they wish, man. All right, look. Uh, I'm not gonna take your shit. Just fucking just get dressed. All right. Thanks. I'll take a couple of those. Uh, fucking. Fuck. Yeah. Fucking. Yeah. 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 Alright, dude, I just took a few you know, things. some people, some people what? play a certain way, you know, that's just the way I, I'm just pretty, I'm friendly dude. That's just me. No, you're good, man, you're good. Here. Take that food, brother. Thanks. Appreciate it. I love how he can, he can hear me, like, some people bitch when I'm wearing a helmet because they can't hear me, but he can, he's not complaining. Well, what are you up to? What's your name? Yeah, my name's Joe. I'm just checking out the new town too. Oh, cool. So you said Joe? Sorry, yeah, I can barely hear you, dude. What's your name? My name's Touch. Like this, like iPhone. Touch. Like iPad. Yeah, like that. Mhm. Mm nice to meet you, dude. Nice to meet. You. Yo, do you see anybody else around here? Thought I just heard something. You know any buddies? You need to go on Whisper? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. I'm by myself. Oh. What kind of shells you got loading that shoddy? What's that? That's something oh. about a shoddy. What kind of shells you got? Uh, sh slugs. I mean, rubber slugs. The ones that don't kill people. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go see what's up. Like the iPhone, the iTouch. So is there any like specific, have you found any like good loot here? Or is it all like little, like small tier shit? It, it's insanely good, man. So many fucking, so much food. Um, Last time I was here, there was plenty of guns. There's a lot of goodies, man. Here, take this blade. Alright. I have a hatchet already. What about the, uh, that broken... The usually, like, those broken buildings have some good shit. There's, I saw it from the distance. I saw a broken building, like, in the lake. Oh, yeah, yeah. Check that out. My friend said they found something in there. Like, this food is respawning as we're right next to it, so... What the fuck do you say? <laughs> I love when he's stripping down, he's like, Jesus, bro, alright, alright, got it. Dude, relax, man. I'll take it off. Alright, just don't, don't kill me. I definitely can't fuck this guy over. Oh, he's, shit. Seems genuine. Yo. What'd you get, dude? There's, um... Dude, there's a silencer with the... I mean, there's an MP5 with a silencer Whoa. on it. What the hell? What the fuck? This is awesome. This is like a little smuggler stash. Yeah. It's pretty dope. Oh, it's a piece for the building. Alright, well now I got like 70 guns on me. Shit. You need some bullets for that thing? Oh shit, dude, I can hear you through your helmet now. That's weird. Oh, it's because I dragged a new helmet onto it. All of a sudden. Yeah, what's up, dude? Oh, Here. What the hell? Take those for your gun. Oh shit, sweet. Thanks. You know, most people force me to take off the helmet. You just dealt with it. Strange. Oh yeah. You got good hearing, or uh, I mean, good hearing, huh? You can hear me told, fine? No, I told. No, when you're in the house, I said you sound like a you're in a fish tank. Yeah, you responded to everything. Are... You responded to everything perfectly. Oh well, yeah, I can hear you now. Yeah, I All can right, hear good. you good, good. You just sound muffled. Yeah, that's All a right, bug. Well, uh, isn't Lug close to here, or like um, on the west side, right? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta get to the closest town. Get out of here eventually. No, it's not because he's watching the stream. Um, he just... I just thought it was really good that he could understand me. Like, most people can't understand what you're saying. I was just trying to, like, pick his brain. No, so it's a bug. So if you have a helmet on, you drag another helmet on, it changes the muffle. So you can actually hear their voice. It's kind of like the... And they might have fixed it, but you used to be able to just take off your gas mask and put it back on, and then you'd have normal voice. And I thought that was an, an okay thing to do, because interaction is key. The muffle is just kind of like a little... bonus. Anything that hurts... like player interaction is... I don't give a shit if you delete that aspect of it, you know? Don't peaches. Alright, so I came from over that way, towards... uh... towards the, like, T intersection. I came from two. You come from Tuke? Is it Tuke? Yeah, I came from. I spawned at the T intersection. Went to Tuke. Is it Tuke or Tuck? I always call it Tuck. I used to say Tuck until. There. Until somebody fucking hounded me and corrected me. Oh shit. Yeah, well, I could. I was fucking walking around Tuck trying to find some food. I was like yellow food for a while and then finally found a few hotchkiss. <laughs> oh. And a can of peaches, and then I made my way here. You still hurting for food? Just, I'm so full, man. Just eat that. No, nah. nah, I'm good now. Yeah, I'm good now. Okay. There's some good, like, uh, I've been seeing spawns on these crates, too. Yeah, the uh, boxes I mean, are great. Uh, it seems, seem pretty random, but. Yeah, like this right here. Like in the pallets flashlight. Yeah. Uh, do you have a compass? Um. I do not know, but I know, so if that way's Took over that way, then we should be going down this way then. That's south. Yeah, let me bust out the map in here. Okay. Is, um, is this place even on the map yet? No. Uh. So, we gotta go southeast to get to Lug, or we gotta go like dead east to get to Maximilian or the mill base. Where do you want to start? Okay. Let's go to... I like Lug. Lug's cool. And then from there we go to, um... What's it called? Uh... Resort? Neptune, I think it's called. Neptune Resort. Shit. Let's do it. What the fuck? I think that bush was absorbing it. Have you seen this shit? What the hell do you think this means? Oh, what the fuck? No, I haven't seen this. Chair facing um. away, bucket on the head. It's like they're looking away from their religion. Yeah, that or some sick fuck who thinks he rules this town and just wants to sit here and like... I don't know. Idolize right. himself. Oh, I got some more shoddy shells, dude, if you want the real deal. Oh yeah, yeah, for sure. I fucked up the other night. I shot some dude twice and I thought he was dead and then he got up and killed my ass. Well, yeah. I was looting. Oh, the Uncon, yeah. Gotta make sure they're fucking dead now. Hey, I'll follow you out, man. You wanna loot that house on the other side of the river? Uh, yeah, wait. Or is it not yeah. really in our... Okay. Just load up this pistol while you loot that. This room. Okay. Uh, what kind of, what is that, an IJ? Yep, IJ and I got a 9mm too. Okay, I found some more 9mm if you need it. No, keep that for your MP5. I don't have a mag for my pistol. Okay. Right. This guy seems chill. is the only damn guy in the town. 
I'm really kind of I'm bummed out that people aren't consistently spawning here, because I think out of all the spawns, like Borush and this place should be like two of the most, maybe the most popular spawns because they're the farthest away from everything else. And uh, people, you know, some people suicide if they're not where they want to be. I like when people are like as far away from the good shit as possible. Shots of 357. I don't know if you need. Go ahead and keep it, bro. I got some. Yeah. Alright. Um, I think that's the road. Is that the road that we're supposed to take? Hmm. I don't know. I've only been here like twice. I just know that we're on the far west side of the map. If we get back on that road, we'll be in Tuk, or we can take a shortcut east. Oh, no. Wait, I think this might be it down here because I remember I know there's a bus stop that we're supposed yeah. to, like there's a road with a bus stop. Right up here. Yeah, you're, yeah, you're that, on the right oh, way. No. Okay, cool. So, yeah, the reason why I've been walking around with no weapons is because I've just been getting killed on site. Um, actually over on number one, so, wait, no, that's a zombie. I've been getting just killed straight up the bat, so I've been trying to, I don't know. I got you, bro. At least find a partner, because the no. whole uncon thing, I, I was yeah. solo, and every time I get into a fight, I get, I just get uncon, not killed. I get uncon, and I can't continue the fight, so it's like, if you don't have a buddy, it's kind of fucked. Yeah, yeah, the uncon thing is cool, but it definitely favors the groups. Hey, you know in the next update, like, your uncon time depends on the caliber or, like, the protection, so... Sometimes you'll wake up after, like, a few seconds. If it's, like, a really low caliber and you have a helmet on, it's kind of crazy. You just, like, wake yeah, right back that. up. Um, yeah, I saw that when trying out experimental. Yeah. It was, like, I thought, uh, because I was with the buddy, I thought he had, re um, what is it called? Resuscitated me. Mm -hmm. But it was just, I got shot in the head with a 22, and then I woke up, like, not even three seconds. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I no, got it's, so much food. I know, so do I, dude. Just fucking throw it. it. Just throw it in your bag, please. Or just save, leave it for the next guy. I don't know. I'm gonna open this up. Yeah. No, no, you did the right thing, man. I was just over here shooting zombies, honestly hoping that someone would hear the shots and come over here. So, I was just giving you a hard time. You did good to uh, oh, make yeah, me yeah. not want to kill you, to be honest, so it's all good. Well, I've been trying to, I don't know, I feel like less and, I mean, with this game on sale, I feel like I've been seeing a lot of different players that don't really, like, grasp the side of, inter like, interaction, and just to, like, talk to people and shit, like, regardless if I'm going to die, if you're going to mm -hmm. kill me, like, interact with, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, for sure. That's my favorite part of the if, like if I see you with your axe out, I'm not gonna shoot you on sight. I'm at least gonna say something to you, but yeah, you know. I'm glad I didn't shoot you, man. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's go. I'm really bummed that nobody else is here, though. I want this to be like one of the new most popular spawn towns. I've been going this every time I spawn close to this place. I've been making this route. There's some um, there's some little warehouses over here and like a little village. That I find some good shit at. So I found a blaze twice at this little village oh, yeah. on a hill. Up Let's here. do it. Or yeah, if you think it's a new thing they just added, I might not have seen it. Show me. Yeah, dude. Um, it's like right up here, and it's like completely random. But sometimes there's CRs and shotguns and shit. So it's definitely a good route that nobody goes to. Okay. Let's do it. I've gotten to a fight here like once. Other than that, I never seen it. Okay. Well, you got a little bit of range with that BK, right? I don't really have much range, so it's all on you. I got the shoddy and I got a pistol. Yeah. Oh. Yo, AK, thank you so much for the three, dude. Generous bandit. <laughs> oh, there's a place up there. What is that? Yo, Blue Mongrel, thanks for the resub, man. We got Marine. One damage. Thanks for the three-year sub. Uh, Jack Real, thanks to the five. Moved out to the West Coast just so I could watch smoke at a reasonable time, Kappa. <laughs> uh, thank you so much for the sub, dude. I'm sorry about the super late night stream sometimes, but I enjoy it. Uh, and uh, yo, Kron, thanks for the seven. The way I find it is there's like this water tower that looks like a big ass, like the Kula, the Kula tower, the white, um, it's like a big ass orb. Oh, that's the, the right side somewhere. That's the Kula tower down there. We're that far down the map already. 
no, no, no. It's just the same one that's at, um... Oh, okay, Uba. okay. Got you. I was gonna say, I thought I knew where this spawn town was, but maybe it's farther south than I thought. Yeah, Vox, so now I'm on the SM7B. I was on the RE20. And the problem was, we were almost 100%, or Gustav said he was 100% sure that one of our old audio parts was slightly damaged. Like, he just knew. And I trust him, he's really good with audio. And um, we started going down, figuring out which one was which, but we thought it was a good idea to just replace my whole audio setup. Because I'm totally down to have, like, extras. If I need to replace the preamp, or if I need to replace some cords, it's good to have two of everything. Even an extra mic, if it is 10% damage, is still good to have as like a backup. So yeah, we swapped everything out. Got a new DBX. Hey, got do a new. You get like a weird um, new mic. Uh, like do your frames drop when you middle mouse button out here? When I zoom in, uh, I know what you're talking about, but yeah. no, I haven't felt it yet today. I think it's like certain parts of the map, oh. since it's like unfinished, maybe. I get it in Essaker a little bit, like after yeah. the recent update. I think the water, the sunken part of Essaker, I had really shit FPS the other night. Yeah. It was like 50 for a little bit. Which is odd, but yeah. I got a real bad, like, uh, when I spawned over in uh, Kula, like out in the field. It was, yeah, I thought I was lagging, but the frames just dropped down really bad. Yeah, yeah. I'll let you know if I feel it. Hopefully the next patch clears it up. Oh, this is a new place? Just like a little tiny one? Yeah, it's like, just like a little set of buildings and stuff. Nice, dude. I've never been here. Yeah, there's no, like, town sign or anything, but it's, it's just here. <laughs> I wonder if people can spawn around here. Well, there... Well, actually, if you... Like, you can kind of see Lug from here, sort of. Like, you go past this. There's actually two more sets of buildings. Like, little utility sheds past this. Okay. Yeah, I'm down to hit anything on the way down to Lug and then, or Lug, Lug, whatever, and then Esker. What was your plan before I met you? Where do you want to go? Uh, I take that, so I was going to go this way, Lug, Goulash, Neptune, and then Esker or Airfield, depending on what kind of weapon. Gotcha. She likes you. Damage. Oh, Miko, that's awesome, dude. You woke up from Uncon, spun around, and wasted three dudes. It's dangerous, man. Like, if you get knocked Uncon in the grass like this, and it's like a three versus three, a bunch of people are around, and you can't get finished right away, just the fact that you can wake up and just sit here like this is so dangerous. Um, to the point where they might walk up and, like, loot you, or those crazy moments where they're about to wake up, you guys went unconscious at the same time, and then you're just like, you fucking, doosh, doosh, and then you're just like fucking James Bond. It's so crazy. That's why I love the new Uncon system. Sometimes it sucks, but we gotta see it with the new update how like each Uncon is gonna last a different amount of time, depending on how you got messed up. Not this checkered one. Yeah. Yo. Find anything? 
There's like mm. some, usually some good shit in these barns. I haven't found a ton yet, but I'm pretty loaded. I got a um found a weapon cleaning kit if you need one. Okay, I'll let you know. Man, I feel so yeah, fucking so there, bad. There's these sheds up here, right up on the hill, and then right past it, there's a couple more, and then lugs to the left over there. Okay, let me see this barrel real quick. Oh, don't sweat it, dude. I don't even know the right pronunciations. I'm just trying to get them. I feel like yeah, for Chinaris, I, I would always just say what it sounded like. I was never right, probably to this day. I feel bad because I robbed his fucking weapon repair kit and I think he didn't realize and now he, he found a new one and he's offering it to me. <laughs> I'm just here like, yeah, yeah, I'll take that, dude. He's a good guy though. I kind of want to make it up to him. Give him his shit back somehow. Picking here. More bullets for my piece. Do you need me? Uh, do you not have room for it? I'll, I'll carry it. I already got one. Um, I was gonna ask I you: cool. Is your MP5 suppressor damaged? No, but the the uh, gun itself is damaged. Okay, go ahead and repair oh, that shit up. IG. Yeah. IG. Okay, sweet. Go ahead and repair that up because I got a weapon repair kit. And I, I'll give it to All you. Right, cool, cool. I'll give you your shit, dude. So use it up. I'm just gonna pack this back. It was this map where I had the uh, lockpick hand bug. It could be something with the map or the server, or it might just be a daisy bug. I don't know. It could, I don't know, I think of crazy shit. Like, what if you're raising your arm? Like, what if you're doing this? Let's say that this gun in my hands is modded, okay? I'm raising- I'm opening the door as I'm pressing right click to raise my gun. And the gun is either modded or it has some modded attachments and you go... And like, when you start doing two animations at once and Daisy has to like multitask and think about all the shit that you're doing. I feel like something... Maybe like a mod creates like a little extra space in the fucking synchronization, like a gap. And if you get caught in that gap doing too many things, I don't know how to describe it, but I'm trying to. Um... I, I hate to say it, but probably, you know, you keep stacking on mods and players in the server and uh, it might extrapolate some of the daisy bugs and just make them more noticeable or make them worse. I didn't have a modded gun though, I had a modded scope. Good. Yeah, let's roll. Yeah, this is the other s set of uh, buildings is through these trees here. Straight ahead. And uh, uh, if you look to the left, there should be, uh, I think, lugs up on the hill. Okay. Uh, there's a road right there that goes uphill. That's where Lug is. Alright, let's do it. Yeah, I'm happy with my stuff. I don't really have much range, but I'm happy with the shoddy. At least we got a gun to kill zombies. Oh, boy, you're saying that you need tips on how to get into Daisy for the, the first time? Um, yeah, just find, add a bunch of servers that have good ping and a lot of players. And you might bump into a dude that will really, like, just take you under his wing, walk you through a run, show you everything, make sure you don't die of starvation or some shit. Um, or just watch, like, a streamer or a YouTuber start off a fresh character. Like, earlier in the stream, this character had nothing. Now we're capable of going down south and taking out a gear dude, you know. So, like, just watch somebody that start fresh and work their way through the map. That's probably the best way to get started. What the fuck? Yeah. Say what now? 
on here. Oh, right here. Fucking yeah, shed down there. Okay. Yeah, I thought I, I thought they took him out or something. No, you're good, bro. I mean, you're teaching, you're showing me new shit. I wonder if they're gonna like add more and piece all this stuff together and add road signs, or, or like if this is just, you know, if you want to get some free loot. It's really come random. Yeah. yeah. So I don't think we have any road signs for the new town, the Pakshu spawn town. I don't know. No. Oh, you know about this shit, right? The other day I found a blaze because of this. You press tab on that, like, what? raised oh. up grass, and the fucking, there's a sickle under there. You'll find, like, rifles and shit in the barns like that. Oh, what the fuck? Yeah, not in uh, what's it called? The houses in Kula are like that. There's always shit like underneath the floorboards. Yeah. Oh, is that the right, place? So up that windy road is yeah, that's lug over there. Shit, yeah, let's do it, man. Luke's that might have some geared players. Yep. Let's just park in like the first house. Um, if you don't or like, let's get to a safe spot. I gotta take like 60 seconds, and then I'm ready to roll. Yo, Jander, what's up? I think I'm gonna skip talk of this wipe and uh, not a lot of new content, so I'll probably be back to Daisy checking out Esker. Do it, man. I'm gonna try my best to go back and forth, either one Daisy stream, one Tarkov stream for a little bit, or a few hours of Tarkov at the end of each stream for a little bit, something like that, just to give it a chance. Um, I don't know. I'm just not in the mindset right now, but I, I might get in the mindset if we have like a couple of fun raids and I like start noticing some of the changes actually making an impact. You know, everybody's hyping up the new Scav Karma system, but there are some pretty bad loops in it right now. Like an example of it is you, if you're getting shot at by a fucking player skev, you literally have to wait until he makes, he draws blood and makes contact before you can shoot back or else you'll take the penalty hit of karma and then your fucking scav cooldown is going to be even longer. So like, I, I, I like what they're doing but it's not all there yet, you know? So, I could easily skip this patch or I might play some of it. I just, I don't know yet. And like, I'm not gonna sit and ask you guys, but like, you know, how long are the queue times? Did they fix those extracts where we literally couldn't leave Shoreline? I had to throw away like my best gun or whatever. Like, I'm, it, it might be good to wait a few days. You love the flea market changes. The flea market changes are good. Uh, that's that's one of the steps in the right direction, but it doesn't change the fact that you can just power level up to 20 in, in the first day and unlock the flea market. So it's good. And no matter what changes they make, there's always going to be diehard gamers that just fucking play the game and love the game so much. Whether it's Tarkov or, you know, Path of Exile, whatever it is. And they're going to fucking grind and farm and progress. They play it, you know, they play it 24 hours a day sometimes. <laughs> so, like, no matter what change the devs make, it's never going to be so hard, I feel, that they can't, like, just power through it. So, and if they did, then all the other people would be bitching that it's too much. So, I don't know. I don't think we're ever gonna. Be careful, because this is actually a spawn. Oh, area. with the water pump. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There could be freshies. Okay. Yeah. I'll be quick. Let's just get up in this basement and fucking get our shotties out. Or I mean the uh, the ah. fucking upstairs, not the basement. I don't think Tarkov's ever gonna be the way that I want it to be perfectly, but it's still gonna be fun, man. Certain updates are really gonna change it more than we even know yet. Oh, dude, come here, look. In this fucking spawn area. Oh my god, what? dude. What the hell? Like, some freshie just comes here and it's like, Oh, please! Well, I'm not gonna lie, dude. I took your bullets earlier. I'll give them back to you. <laughs> Five bullets hey. on, on the house. No problem, dude. I also took this from you. Ah, oh, you're so gracious. Thank you. Just fix up the... Oh, you already fixed up the MP5 and the blaze? Yeah. Okay, here. Let me just use this yeah. once and then you I take it back. I still got half. I, I'm still holding one, though. I still have half of mine. I okay, don't okay. have room for that one. Okay, I'll hold this. Yeah. I was just doing you a favor from the get-go, you know? Just holding on to your things. Oh, no, I know. I was getting heavy, right? You are just trying to yeah, um, you, lighten my load. You were looking pretty, I'm not encumbered over pretty thick, yeah. With, like, four Cs? Yeah. Nah, probably like three C's, but yeah. 
screen. Got another. Do you need another IJ mag? I got. I found another. One. Yeah, yeah. I'll take that. Okay. All right. Here, you help yourself to this tater. I'll be right back. All right. All right. Give me two seconds, guys. I gotta run to the bathroom. Tater. Grab a drink. Gustav, what are you doing awake, man? You just got done hooking up my audio like a few hours ago, and now you're back awake? You gotta get some sleep, dude. Thank you so much for the 10 subs, man. I couldn't, we only got through about 35 minutes before everybody uh, called me out for having a new mic, so I couldn't do the one hour test like you wanted, dude. But uh, yeah, thank you so much for helping us with the mic settings earlier, dude. Um, I think it sounds really good. I'll be right back, guys. Thanks for all the gifts, man. Um, Antsy Pants, thanks for the 30 months. Smoke's voice changer. What? Thanks for the 38 months, dude. I wish I had a... Wait, here's the 38 more months of voice changers. Now I need a voice changer. Thank you, dude. Gustav, that's your next mission, dude. Thanks for the audio, but now you got to get us a good voice changer. <sighs> he thinks it's impossible. Yo, D-Mark, we got Space, Pale Vision, uh, Mr. Just, Jack. I think I got you earlier. Thank you guys so much for all the support. I'll be right back. Did you see that impatient look on his face? He looked over at me like, where the fuck is this guy? I'm back. Did you hear anything? Welcome back. No, uh, no. Uh, my, I thought I heard something behind this, but... <clears throat> I don't think it was anything. Yo, so hold on. Since you're packing so much long-range heat with that, uh, snipe, do you want me to take your BK so I can back you up? Yeah. Wait, what's on your back? Oh, I have a BK. Uh, can you give me the bullets for it? Sorry. I already have one. Yeah, yeah. Or at least just one bullet or, or two bullets, whatever. How many do you have? There you go. That's all I had. I just had one. Oh, well, shit. Okay. From, from that mag. Alright, well, like I said, I think you'll be using the blaze instead, right? So. Yeah. Oh, yeah, for sure. Alright man, I'll I'm good. Toss this somewhere. Stay. I got an idea. Maybe we die in spawn oh, here. Up. Maybe just drop it in like a bush. Uh dude, you know there's a good like right here. If you get on top. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, that looks good. That's a good idea. It goes. Well, <laughs> ah. there you go. Nice, dude. That's sneaky as fuck. All right, some lugs down the road here. Lug is a pretty rare spawn too. I was finding good shit at lug. Shoddy, the uh, um, the police car and the little uh, what's the little shooting game stand? Yeah, yeah. Has like three awaiting it. Yeah, like the little hunting loot, hunting shacks. 
Yep. Yeah, I remember in the early days of Esker, people were spawning there, and it was kind of fun. Like, every spawn zone was a different type of chaos, but, you know, I guess it is too close to Esker to be a main spawn point, so it makes sense. Oh, man, I remember spawning, like, smack, like right there in front of the water at Lower Esker. Oh, like, yeah. Hobo fights in the in the water. Yeah, like, I, we were all confused in the beginning, right? Because we thought, like, okay, Esker City, this is, like, Electro, it makes sense. We just spawn a big city, this is kind of fun, but then we realized, like, oh, shit. Then the whole the map is just obsolete, so they had to do something. Yeah, I was so confused, man. Like I was like, okay, we go north, and there has to be shit up north, and then uh, we go all the way up to like Igmin, and then like Gregada or whatever. It's yeah. Called. And I'm like, why the hell? Why did we come over here? There's nothing. There's nothing over here. Yeah. I was so confused, man. I was like, this progression in the beginning was like, it was like head spinning. Like, what the hell am I doing here? Yeah, it looks like they're still thinking about how they're gonna space out, or maybe like add some new locations, or new more spawn towns, maybe. We'll see what they do. Yeah. I think they need to go west more. Yeah. Expand the area west. That's where Pikachu is, I guess. Pikachu? Yeah. Somebody was calling it Tupac Shakur the other night. Oh, uh, okay. What's it actually Pakshu. called? Pakshu? Pakshu, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna put on this skater helmet, dude. I think it's better protection. Okay. <clears throat> Tupac shoe. Alright. We're getting... We're getting too complacent. We gotta get in the zone here. There's gotta be some bad guys afoot. So shit like this, you gotta press tab and like scan it, because there could be a tin of beans or rifle or some shit. Ah, this is arguably the best zombie killer. Maybe we should take it. Enjoy the final days of this melee system. Where you can immediately pull out stuff from your backpack like this. They're getting rid of all the quick pull-outs. Yo, uh, Joe. <laughs> oh, that was weird. Yo, dude. We might have to go back to that building back there. Why? Come in here. Ground. There you go. Take that. Yeah, I already. I'm gonna use the blaze. So you yeah, can yeah. I brought the oh, mag just to show it. you. you yeah. <laughs> Thanks, dude. <Sweet. laughs> yep. Uh, you don't have an extra scope, do you? Uh, nope. I uh, will check that uh hunting tower or uh, hunting shack. Okay. Uh, smoke's not lying, you felt the same way today. What do we feel the same way about, T-Bone? You talking about Tarko or are you talking about, uh... I don't even know. You talking about Pikachu? New spawn town? Damn, this mic is legit. Yeah, I don't think I found the perfect position. It's still kind of coming in from the left side. And that's extra bad when I'm looking over at the right side at chat. But, uh, we'll figure something out. Oh man, so you know that like, how we start digging the garden plot there? How the fuck are you supposed to do a running attack when you're digging garden plots? Is that you? Yeah, that's me. You good? Alright. Yeah, 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 I'm good. Cool. My coat's not, I'm good. Yeah. I'm gonna check that hunting shit and then I'm gonna kill these zombies, see if there's some loot in there. Okay. 
Nice. PU scope. Oh my fucking god, that scared me. Come on, Daisy, now. Give me that, give me that good shit. This is where you get shot in the side of the head and then quit out. Oh well, I'm too full for this shit. I'm, I do not need food right now. Kinda wanna dip those salty chips into the tuna fish, but it's alright. Ooh, wait a minute, that is a scout mag, isn't it? I knew it saw something. I'm just gonna let him check that just in case. Found another place, dude. No way. Where is it? Yeah. Oh, I got it right here. I'll be damaged. Huh? <clears throat> Alright. I'm gonna chill on this. I'm gonna. Thank you. Are you sure you can spare those men? I can just hold on to this. I got two loaded and then I got uh, one. Okay. Well, if we're in a sniping position, I'll give you these back if you use yours, you know. But thank you. Okay. Let me chill here for mm -hmm. a sec. Stuff that I kind of want to do here. I thought there was a bear trap going on for a second. Is Trinar the only map that's kind of the others? Uh, Livonia has a somewhat similar feeling of Trinaris. feel like arenas to you. Man, I would try to go play some day one to Malsk while you still can. I don't want to say while you still can. It, it's still, all four servers still fill up during like certain days on the primetime hours. But, um, Namalsk is not an arena if you have, I mean, some days you're going to run into some people that are just fucking in the spawn zone with AKs killing people. And I always have thought it's a little bit too easy to get military guns in Namalsk. I would like to see a hard or harder core in a mosque even, but um play that map dude, it's magical. It's one of the best days of experiences. And uh it might not always have a good population. It feels like it might eventually turn into like a winter seasonal map unless they consistently pump out updates. Cause like I love the map, but I know some people are getting a little sick of the um sitting near fires. But the problem is what they're doing is they're literally sitting at fires outside. All you have to do is sprint until you can make an indoor fire, and your life is so much easier. Um, sometimes it still takes a while, but half of the encounters come because somebody saw your fire, or you saw their fire. And it's so exciting creeping up on somebody that's like chilling, cooking their food, or warming up. Um, it really is, so. I'd play a bunch in a mosk if I were you. Yeah, I'm almost done. Change my shirt. But if you're new to the game, you know, the mosk isn't the easiest. You can still manage, though. Anybody can make a fucking fire and get the heat buff, and then... You can survive if you choose your next moves wisely. How do you do that juke when you fight zombies? Oh, I can show you real quick because I want to go kill these zombies. So basically, you just raise your hands while you're blocking or while you're like holding down S going backwards, you just hit Q or E. Now remember though, you want to force them to do the long range attack on you. So he's all the way over there. He's probably going to do it. But I want to get... Jesus Christ. See how he did it. Oh 
Oh, shit. And the best part about it... Yeah, go for it. The best part about it is once you get really good at just, like, watching them from long range and be like, Oh yeah, they're so far away that they're probably gonna do that long range attack. Sometimes you'll even catch them up close doing it. Like, they started far away, but now they're right in your face. They might still do it to you. You just gotta be quick. And if you do it too soon, sometimes it's not the end of the world. You know, you'd rather be too soon than too late. Do you have a 22 pistol? No, I got a... I got M... Oh, let me see, I got 26 rounds of 22 and MK uh, mag if you need it. Mm. Just hold on to it until I could find one. Wait, wait, so do you have two good zombie killers you just said? No, 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 I'm, I'm uh, looking for MK, but I have a mag. Oh, one. okay, no, no, so no. Just, yeah, yeah, it's all good. I just have the fucking loud macro off. I was gonna say, if you, have, if you find an MK, maybe you keep the MP5 and I'll take the MK if that's cool. I'll give you all my 9 mil yeah, at that yeah. point. Alright. Yep, it's good. Um, I don't think we checked the uh, house on the lower side of the town, did we? Pass, let's pass let's do it. No, no, I didn't. Shit, okay, so I gotta get this ready. I can also fix up this blaze. It's this type of run that like, if somebody got shot in the back right now, or like if I died right now, some people might think like, oh fuck, you just looted up for so long and nothing happened. But um, that is the thing with Esker, is like, we didn't have to do any of this. Esker is a very sped up experience where, if I would have just taken a right turn instead of a left turn, we'd probably be in Esker right now in the big city. Um, but I don't mind this. I'm, I'm in chill mode tonight. He already showed me a new location. We got a cool teammate. I don't really have a... Ooh, that sucks. I don't really have a ton to lose. But we got enough gear that we got a pretty good chance, so... It always just sucks when people look at, like, two hours wasted just because they got killed. You know. Not a whole lot's happened, but it's still been enjoyable. That's, that's what adds to the intensity, is like, you gotta stay sharp or else, you know, you are gonna lose all your fucking shit. Yeah, I saw what you said, Kestrel. I don't know, man. I think if oh, I think if you just get good at mastering the early game on the mall, so you're not constantly dying of starvation or cold, you're gonna love it. Like just spawn in, sprint to the closest good spot to make a fire, get the heat buff, jog until you right, get so enough food. You know. Possession's that way, and then so we got options. We got possession that way, or uh, goulash and Neptune that way. Hmm. Well, could dude, I mean, your, yeah, your call. You I got mean, the snipe, right. so. Let's, yeah, let's go to goulash. Okay. Yeah, we could snipe it out from the hills. Goulash and Neptune. Yeah. yeah. Those, dude, those rocks, though. It gets crazy near those, uh, you know, where those rocks are at, near Neptune. Yeah, yeah. I know what you're talking about. They used to, like, double damage your shoes, right? In the cave? Yeah. And there's this really crazy spot spot like uh, uh, on the Kula side where the rocks are it's um like where the cave is but it, it bases Neptune and there's a few bushes and people just sit there and snipe from there yeah we can avoid whatever you want man I'm down to go from Goulash to Esker or we can take a peek at Neptune I'm happy with my guns I just need to get a scope and yep. some more bullets yeah I mean if we don't find a, a scope at a uh, Goulash I'm down to check out Neptune that the hunting shacks usually always have either like a what is it a P lab, P lab? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'd be sweet right now. 
Um, yeah, we don't have to repeat, uh, repair the blades. I don't think it actually jams, and we might find like a pristine sniper rifle at the next place. So, I only got two bullets. No worries. Yo, hold up. Is that- that's just a zombie, right? All the way where I'm looking? In the, uh, up in the field to the left? Or is that a dude? You see what I'm talking about? That fucking figure walking up the hill? Uh, yeah, that's a zombie. That's a zombie okay, okay, yeah. cool, 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 cool. Let's see. Damn, that scared me, dude. He, like, crept and then stood still. Hey, dude, it's like- it's like- yeah, it's like- it looks like it's crouch walking if you just look- yeah. look at it. <laughs> dude, Ace, I was thinking that the other day. Where the hell are the Mosins on Essaker? I almost think something's wrong with them. I think this server chose to put the Mosins at a higher tier, because they are extremely good. But it, there might be, like, a glitch in the system. Oh, shit. Ooh, that's close. Because, like, I've never found my own fucking Mosin on this map. I might have killed somebody for it, like, twice. That's it. It's, uh, sounds like Neptune. Oh, they're on the apartments. Maybe that's what it is, because I don't even loot apartments. I need to. Wait, wait. You said Neptune, right? Neptune's all the way across that way. I thought the shots were like all the way down here. Really? Maybe, um... Oh, I don't know. The direction I heard it come from was straight past these buildings. Oh, okay. Well, there's probably you somebody at Neptune. Left, yeah. Ah. Uh, yeah. Maybe down that road was one of the shooters, but who knows. Okay. I'm down to check out PD. Try to get like some chest protection. Yeah, yeah. Let's do it, man. I'll follow you. That was definitely over there. Oh yeah, that's like the left side of Neptune, for sure. It's foggy for you right now, right? Pretty foggy, yeah. I can see Neptune. Okay. <sighs> Blaze Iron Sights are actually really good. You found a Mosin and Possestra? Uh... Yo, what's up, Nassim? Thanks for the 500, man. I do the fast, a quick vault, instead of the slow jump. Look out the front fucking door, dude. Yep. Look out the front door. Mm, okay. What do you think? You wanna you wanna scope it out from the opposite hill that we came from, or do you wanna just like creep around like this? Maybe we'll hear him in PD. Yeah, I mean, I'm down to move through, and then uh, go to that opposite hill, like up on where the barn is, and then kind of look down, and then Let's do it's it. clear. Let's do it, because the zombie just fucked us. Ah, shit. Ah, shit. Let's definitely reposition. Another zombie this way, it could be in here. I'm opening it for you. I'm gonna open this door for you.
Maybe he is. Maybe he's heading down this way. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh shit, you're lagging, bro. I know hopefully. those warehouses have good loot. Okay, hopefully, hopefully it's just the fucking server having a hiccup shit. lag. Yeah, you froze for a bit too. Holy shit, they're underwater. What the fuck? I came up the lake. Yeah. Swamp creatures. Can they please go for me? Do you have some kind of like fucking zombie cologne on or something? Been, Might be this open can of lunch meat. You need to take a fucking take a bath in the lake or something, dude. It would fucking keep him away from me, but it turns out it's doing off. Yeah, yeah. All right, we go up the hill or we clear these buildings. Oh, it's up here too. Fuck it. Oh, dead one here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one's locked up. Alright, we're probably just just behind him then, huh? I'm getting off a whisper, fuck all that. Warehouse. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that these warehouses done. Wasn't it you, was it? The shot, no. It's like directly where I'm looking. Over by Neptune, huh? Directly that way. Uh, to the, like the left side or the right side on the hill? Right where I'm looking, you see, I see like a building over there. Okay. Yeah, yeah, so whatever the fuck that is, left side of Neptune, like the, the left row of houses. But, I don't know, I mean, it's not our guy, though, so... Yeah, it's definitely not him. He's moving this way. There's only... Yeah. Uh, there's only these warehouses, or... Or he went up the hill to Possession, but... I don't... Well, what if he's cutting over to swim to Neptune? Yeah, that could be it. Is that what we want to do? Do you have, like, a nice spot that you want to snipe out Neptune from, since we know there's some people over there? Straight ahead. There is, there is, there is. Look where I'm looking. Hill. I, I got eyes on the guy. Uh, look over my shoulder, there's some rocks touching the trees. He just went left to right past the rocks going up to Neptune. Pretty much where the shots were. It could be our guy if he just okay. swam immediately. It really could be. Yeah. I didn't I didn't catch the guy though. So. It was just a shimmer. It was just a little shiny. He's got like a bright jacket on. I, I mean, it could be the guy that shot. Or it's a dude that's going towards the shot. Yeah, he could be chasing. I it might be the our our guy though. Well, hey, if you park I don't see right here, yeah. If you park right here, you might see him. I don't know where he went. You see the rock I was talking about though, right below Neptune. He was there, and then he was going up. Like right below these these hunting shacks here. Mhm. Mm yeah, yeah. He's probably on that edge, creeping in. And he went right to left. Maybe he's trying to hop yep. over this fence here. Or left to right. He's going up to it. Yep. Oh, left to right. Okay. Yeah. I mean, we could swim over and just get the better snipe angle on the high ground. Yeah, let's go. Let's go up on the hill on the left side here. Okay, I'll follow you. Thank you. Are we fucking doing? Oh, okay. Yep. That was close, dude. The fucking <laughs> the land is right there. <laughs>
Oh, fuck. Me. I've been shot. It's like in the middle of the uh, hunting shack. Alright, that's a new shoddy. Maybe they're distracted. <clears throat> like I said, to use all three of those blaze rounds, I'll give you the other two. See a dude? He's on the uh, the railing on the road. Eyes on. He looks fresh. He has a sledge. All right, let's he's not blow sledge. it. He's all running right. away. All right, all right. Yeah, he's, he's just running away. Do we want to wrap up and get distance? Maybe up to where he is? I don't know if we want to ask. Him? Yeah, do you want to go up? Left way. Yeah, let's, go, let's Maybe. go on the left, yeah. He might have a geared buddy. I don't know if we should question him, though. Yeah, uh, I think he's running away towards uh, towards the left side. He went right to left. I don't trust these little fuckers, dude, in their blue shirts. Probably just died here and they're on their way back. Yeah. Did you want to get to these rocks? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna creep up on top of this one here. I think I've seen them going through the front, front gate. Okay. Saw like a glimpse of like blue. <laughs> oh shit, I don't even know what I'm doing right now, but here we are. Dude, this spot's pretty crazy actually. Oh, come up here, come up here. I got eyes on him. You can take him from here. I went around the other side to hop up. Oh, nice. Okay, uh, green shack, green police shack on the right side of the front gate. Once you go down, he's in there. I saw his little head. Uh, beyond the umbrella. He's looting. Oh, wait a minute. What the fuck? Is there a dead guy on top of the green shack? Yeah, there's there's a dead... No, there's, there's, there's. there's. Shoddy. That's not our main guy, but it's somebody. You don't yeah. have to kill him if you don't want to. If we it got looks bigger like guys. He, it looks like he saw us. Yeah, there's some other guys here. Maybe by the barracks. Well, we could go far left, or we can chill. Um, I kind of just want to scope it out for a little bit, and then move up on the rock on the left side. Take your time, yeah, yeah. Sounds good. I don't know if he saw us. This, uh, this guy here. I'll watch our surroundings. He's running out. He's on the right side. He's in the bush. Like, to the right side. He's in the bush. Looks like he's looting somebody. Tug it down? Down. Nice, nice. Alright, I'm on. I'll follow you. We don't have he, to loot he, him. He was looting somebody. Okay. Right side bush. To the right of the... He's dead, he's dead, he's dead. Are you alive? I killed one. There might be another one by the truck. Yeah, I'm good. I'm might be another one by the truck. Yeah. That guy was kidded, bro. We gotta yeah, fall back. Good, Let's wrap up. Let's wrap up. That guy was coming back for his dead. Maybe.
Alright, it's up to you. We can, oh, we yeah, can stay in loot or we can... Dead body, he looked kinda, kinda geared. I just wanted his ammo, really. But, um, okay. let's check it out from this left side here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just make sure that there's a... I'll, I'll check this way. You can watch, like, the hills, maybe. Got you. Check if that guy had any 308 on him, but it might be a little risky. Let's fucking do it. Just try to locate that loud ass shotgun that we heard. Make sure that guy's dead. <laughs> or I mean, the guy's dead, but I wonder if there's another guy. This is me, this is me. Yeah, there's a take some yeah. shit here. Oh, this guy's the MP5 one. Like, oh my fuck, dude. This guy's got some shit. DMR mags, yo. I left you a DMR mag in his pants. Take that shit. I got one. Okay. An F scope. Dragged it out for you. Check that for your place. I got 308 too. Thanks, brother. Look at this little fucking loot goblin. <laughs> you can tell him his voice there, I love it. Ah, yeah. Loot. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, Ooh. this guy had a shotgun, but it wasn't the shotgun. Oh, we still got a shotgun fuck around here then. Oh, wait, this guy. This was him, this was him. Oh shit, he had a blaze too. Oh dude, take his helmet. Oh yeah. Holy shit. Yeah, he has this 308 on him too. Yo, check this out. Um, oh my god. Just grab all the good shit and bring it. Bring it here so they don't come back and immediately get it. Just a little bit further down right here. Oh my god, that sounded like two different people. What the hell? I just want to grab one of these grenades before some shit hits a fan. Shit. Take a nade. What are you, what are you? <laughs> oh my god, these Winchester rounds are damaged. I think I might have to fix those up. Still a flashlight? Yeah, I do still a flashlight. I got a lot of shit that I can drop. Thank you. Got an AK off this guy. I need a 74 mag. Give you a 74 meg. Oh, sweet. Thank you. I'm dropping the 22 and stuff right now. 
Okay. Oh. Be prepared. I think we're, we're probably gonna hear somebody run up on us any second. So I'm gonna go grab a few more of those guns and bring them down here. Good call, bro. The hunting scope. Some space. I gotta drop some shit soon. I do like the new shotgun, but I'm wondering if the default double barrel is still better. And I'm also thinking how fucking loud this thing is late night. Scorpion. Oh, I think you already grabbed it off the scorpion. I'll go see though. Good, we're good. <sighs> Scarecrow guy. How you feeling? So, do you have multiple suppressed guns now? Could I bum maybe a suppressor off you if you have two or no? I don't have a suppressor at all. Um... Just the one in your MP5. Yeah, these are. Yeah, that's it. No worries. Pistol suppressor on the Scorpion. We'll go to airfield now that we have um snipers and stuff. Where the fuck is the, the Scorpion? Uh, parking lot should have suppressors. Okay. The Scorpion right here. I think you took it, guys. You might not realize it. It's all good. It's all good. I'm not worried about it. I'm down to go loud tonight, man. Fuck it. Let's make some noise. Oh, this other body. Oh, okay, okay, okay. You guys have your way. Just have your way with me. Just fucking... Just get it over with. Alright, dude. Let's fucking bounce out of here. Let's go. I don't even care for the other stuff. What I do care about though is getting this box of ammo out in the open. Cut the bodies. Uh, we're not trying to be that secretive. I hate to say it. I don't want to be the Debbie Downer, but if you're on if you're on your A game or if you're just having a good day, the loot on Essaker is constantly coming to you. So almost like running back to a stash is more of a chore. Whereas like the pro progression getting new loot is more fun for me, so we might come back and get that shit later, we might not. Sort of saved his ass. Oh yeah, well. That's how it goes, man. I've been saved by my teammates all the time. That was awesome though, how that guy was so focused on my teammate running up. I was a little worried that my teammate was gonna die there. But I think we got him just in time. I'm not worried about the other scope. I feel like I'm actually kind of bad at the other scope because I don't really practice with it. Whoa, that's the fucking... That's the cave, dude. Are that's like the... That's on oh. the rock. Oh shit, I was whispering. Get off a of whisper too. Yeah, it's up on the cave rock. How do we want to do this if we do want to do something? Well, to be honest, it sounds like where he's sniping... It sounds like he's sniping at Kula. It doesn't sound like he's sniping this way. It, it sounds almost like hmm. it's on the left side of the the hill like uh facing cooler that's that, where i heard it from that gun doesn't sound that good oh 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 oh, oh dude oh, shit. three I guys three him. guys top, yeah, top, yeah, yeah, yeah 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 three guys out in the field let's get close let's get close come here you see him in the field right looting a dead body 
Or do you see someone up top? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. No, I've seen somebody up top poking their head. Dude, there's the three guys in the field looting a body, bro. You saw someone up top, too? Right? Look over oh, my shoulder. Shit. Look over my shoulder. Yeah, I see him. I see you got him. a rangefinder? No, but that's gotta be like... Uh, Let's zero for three? 250. You wanna do this? Oh, fuck, they're, they're moving, they're moving. Yeah. I saw three, bro. Oh, all three, all three. Okay, yeah, there's yeah. one. There's one on the body cell. One on the body cell. Yeah, but do we want to get a free fucking schmuck kill? Let's get the good kills. No, 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 no. Let's get closer. No, let's no. get closer. <laughs> He's like, well, well, the, no, no. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, okay. You want to take the guy that's laying? You see him laying? No, 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 no. That's the that's the last yeah, guy. I don't see him anymore. It's okay, it's okay. Take whoever you can kill, man. Let's just try to get the most geared one if, you, if we can. Let's wait till they get- they're gonna come up right here. Wait, so you saw a fucking dude on the- on the hill though, man? What if they're like working with that guy? On the peak, on the crest. So, you see the- the- the tallest rock? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, um, okay, to the- to the tree, right? To the right of it, there's one that juts up more than the rest of them. Yeah, the yeah, yeah. The guy peaked his head up. Well, fuck, as dude. As I was like, looking over there. Well, shit. We're gonna be in his eyes if we push up anymore. Yeah, so let's try to get, let's get two of let's try to knock two of these guys out, and then uh, I don't want to like push in there for a kill because we're gonna get sniped from that guy. So I'd rather mm -hmm. just pick these dudes off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's what I mean. Do we want to push up to where we were in that tree line? That'd be easy pickings for them, but then we might get seen. You want to wait here? Or you want to push up? Yeah, this guy's this guy's gonna let me look at this fucking rock because he's he was like peeking that he was like. Peeking over the edge of it. I'm glad we didn't shoot, because if we did, at most we would have killed one guy, and then we'll still have four guys in the area on us. Not there anymore. Um, the tree line that we were, back there, like, moved back? Yeah, I mean, they're looting the resort, right? So if we just get up in the top tree line of the resort, look down, pick off two, maybe come back here. I just don't know if this guy on the rock's gonna yeah, see yeah, us. Down. Right. Where did these guys go? They went under the bridge and went over? They're just looting the Neptune, fuck? I think, dude. Yeah. Uh, to be honest, the guy didn't... Yeah, I just I didn't see a gun at all. He wasn't peeking with a gun. I just seen a guy's head poke out. Okay, I'm gonna assume it was either these guys or that guy up there's got a shit gun. Let's just get this. Really be seen right now from the hill. Where the fuck are these guys? I think they're under the bridge, dude. Maybe. You don't think these guys came to Neptune? I didn't see him walk up. No, no, there, there, there. Second barrack, second barrack. Out of the four row. I saw a red bag. First barrack, closest to us. Left side. Second window. Last window. Barracks, barracks. Yo, yo, barracks, 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 first barracks. Barrack, first barrack. <sighs> Two of them are in the first barrack. Fuck, I don't get eyes. Yeah, left side. <laughs> oh, I guess I just missed. There's three of them in the first barrack. I just fucking missed. I don't know if I hit one or not, but I missed. Or, I mean, I, I shot. Yeah, they all ran out. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay, I'm sticking on double shot, dude. Let's go for one more shot and then fucking fall back. Dude, that guy like warped away. Holy shit. I'm gonna risk it, dude. If they peek me, I'm, I'm gonna hit him. Let me reload for a double shot, though. In the grocery, in the grocery, in the grocery. I don't have an angle. 
Well, we should move, but I'm so tempted to get one shot here. If you get a shot, I don't see these guys. One's in grocery, um, one's surely back barracks. Back at brick. One's, one's back okay. at brick. Okay, okay. You start thinking about where you want to fall back to. I'm down whenever. This is getting hairy. Brick. Yeah. We either go up on the fucking cliffs or we go far right. What do you think? Uh, not the cliffs. Let's go far right. I want to check out that rock again. Remember the rock where we uh, looked down at the entrance? Okay, okay. Let's do it. Lead the way. Oh, man. I hate that shit, dude. The problem is, like, people just move so fucking fast. That's why I wait so often because of that type of shit right there. It looks like the easiest shot in the world and then they just literally are just like, yeah. Alright, so you got your zeroing back down to 200. I'm gonna put my gun on double shot, man. Yeah, yeah. I got it at 200 now. Mine, it's mine, it's mine. It's mine, mine, mine. I blew, I blew my load, I blew my load. Ooh, nice fucking kill, brother. I dropped the, dropped his ass. Let's go, let's go. Just one. Let's, go. let's yeah, fall back, let's, fall back. back. let's get up above him. Yeah, yeah. Dude, I heard that SK crack and I got a little intimidated. That shit fucking slams you. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, shit. You think he's dead or uncon? I didn't get a good look. Uh, it looked like he's dead, but let's push up like past these bushes. We could look down. Got you, got you. A little bit of zombie, I got the gate. Shots at us, shots at us, shots at us. Yep, 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 yep. Is that above or is that back at Neptune? Ah, oh, fuck, dude, I have no idea. Do you have an epi? Yeah. Do we have a fucking epi pens or something? We just gotta bounce, dude. Let's fucking bounce. That's, yeah. I got no epi pens. They're gonna see us through these bushes, though. Let's go rotate right up the hill. Yeah, I just don't have much stam. Just going bush to bush. Yeah. I think it was probably a snap from the back of Neptune, because I did peek. Okay. Well, from here, we can circle up to the cliff or that spot that you were talking about. It's your call. We get eyes on the body that you killed, or just say fuck that guy. I want to confirm it. Okay, I'll follow you. This is the point, though, where like you know, might be best to disengage. But I want to do whatever he I'm wants to do. Sight right here. I'm, I'm net. Wish we had a range finder for shit like this. See that last kill, that's when I'm going to take it off a of double now, you know, because it's like, if you miss on double, then you got to reload. If you miss on single, you got that second chance that's probably going to hit. Shit, dude. No, what? Yeah, he's dead as fuck, yeah. Good, good. Good kill, bro. He's dead. Yeah, yeah confirm. Alright. He's got SK and then uh, AK. Dude, he's got an AK on his back, man. Where are you seeing him at? Right, right where I'm looking. AK on his back. The dead guy. Oh, the dead guy. Fuck. Yeah. I mean, if what he chose, I got an AK. Already. Yeah. If he chose to use his SKS, then I got. I don't know. Maybe that says something about his AK. But his AK's got a suppressor, and I got yeah. mags for like various AKs. So. I got a shitload of say, yeah, seven six two. So I don't know. We can go. I'll cover you. Okay. And then, uh, uh, I don't know. If you want to, like, uh, we can circle around. Yeah, let's so get to the... Like, get some cover from the bushes. Yeah, let's get to the closest point to the body where you can cover me and I'll just run down and grab the gun. I don't have an EpiPen, though. That's the problem. 
This is kind of sketch, bro. I don't know. Sketch is stuck. Uh, I'm gonna get to the bushes here, and then if you want to make a run for it, dude. It'd be kind of cool if somebody shot us at least. Well, maybe not cool. Oh, this is where the grass fucks us, and then I forget where the body is. There it is. I should really give this to him. Nah, fuck it, I'll take it. I'm gonna be, gonna be selfish. We'll both go with the AK. I took it, I took it. Yeah, he's got, is it a 74? Take, take the, yeah, I took a 70. We both got 74s, but he has multiple mags, so we, we're gonna have to share. I'm back to you. Taking everything. Yo, take the suppressed gun. No, 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 I'm good, I'm, I'm taking good. taking it in my hands for you. Are you good? Alright, up the hill. <laughs> I want to help him so bad. I gotta dance like a fucking. Bro, when you get up, if you get up. Bro, bro, bro. Brother. Dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, get up, get up, get up. Go, exit, exit towards Esker. Exit towards Esker. Come on, let's go. We got, I killed the guy up in the hill, above us where we came from. Don't go up to your right. There's two guys up to your oh right with a ghillie suit. God. Two guys up to your right with a ghillie suit. Dude, keep going straight. Right keep right going straight. Yes, keep going straight towards Esker. Okay, okay, okay. I killed one. There's two more. They seem confused. We got this. There might be a guy fucking from the hills, too. Come on, come on, come on, we got a bell. Are you bleeding? Banj in this no. tree if you are. Okay. No, 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 I'm not bleeding. We gotta go, we gotta go. So, up on this hill on the right side of it, they're up They there. could literally be running down on us from my right shoulder right now. Okay. Look out. But I killed their friends, so they might be like more worried about their loot and shit. Our teammate got knocked out, but the dude up top died. I'm almost 100% he died. The way that his body fell. I mean, if he's uncon, then that means that those guys are going to be more preoccupied with getting him back up. Shot that got me, right? Oh, dude, it made no noise. That guy's got a scout, yeah. probably. I didn't hear shit, yeah. How hurt are you? Are you still pretty good? I'm white, half white. Oh, well, fucking, what do you want to do? You want to get up on the peak of this hill and... and... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's uh, try to, like, um, wide flank him to the left. Mm-hmm. So that line, remember where we started? We were up there where they were. They just took our old position at the peak when I spotted the, the uh, AK on the body. That's where they are. That's where they were. Yeah. Okay. So you think it's the guys from the resort that over-rotated and got bombed? No. New guys. New guys. There's a full-blown ghillie suit, fully geared guy okay. with these guys. The other guys were a little bit lower. Yeah, they're chasing, they're chasing our shots. Then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One of these guys is colorful. The other one is ghillie. He hit me in my head, and my he uh, my helmet's only worn. Yeah. Welcome to a fucking current patch. <laughs> we should probably reload our AKs. Yeah. I, I need to. Cool. I'll cover you. Let's get a thick bush. I'm like, oh, dude, there's a suppressed gun here. Bah! Didn't <laughs> shit. Dude, I out. watched. Your body fell over it right in my face. I could have fucking caught you. How many loose five five six round or five four five rounds do you have? I'm dropping them. You're dropping some mags too. Make sure you can afford one that, dude. Mag. Okay. Yeah, I have one extra. So if you have one extra, we're even. Let's pack this up.
Alright. Let's do this shit. I got a nade too. Are you dropping all those bullets? Yep. Yeah, I got so that dude had so much. So I have four boxes after dropping that. Alright, let's rumble. I'm gonna be a little confused here though. Like, we're up here, but now we gotta get back in that right line. So your guess is just as good as okay. mine, to the right a bit. Or they could be anywhere, I mean. Excuse me. So their teammate's body would have been on the edge of the tree line, he was the one blasting at us. And uh, they might be dealing with that loot. Or they might have been while I was reloading those mags. Uh, Alright, so the, the hill, the hill of Kula is like straight ahead. Head, straight ahead here, so we're coming up on it. Yeah, I can't imagine they stayed right where they were unless their teammate was holding them up with all that loot. <laughs> hey, let's break down so we can start seeing Neptune. Then I'll be able to guide us to the body area. Yeah, this guy's really chill. I don't know if I ever play with him. Maybe. Alright, so in between this valley, that's that's cooler here. So we're like behind them on the left side now. So they would be over this if, way. If they're like, in, yeah. Dude I killed had a Gorka helmet on and like a brown winter parka I think. Shit, so this is the road. How's your HP going? You're almost back up to full. Uh, I'm like 60%. 70% white. It was about here, right? Would have been up to the right a bit. This is so sketchy, they could be anywhere. And this dude in the ghillie is spooking me out. Okay, I see your kill down there. And then when I looked up, they were like right in this edge of this tree line somewhere. They might have actually been a little bit higher up than I thought. I could say I remember they almost broke through the crest up here. I'm not really too concerned about the body. More concerned about these guys. Yeah. They may be chasing us uh, down that way. They probably didn't expect us to wrap around. 
Yeah, I mean, we've made so much noise that anybody could be onto us right now. Mm -hmm. I don't know, it's your call. Stick around or bounce for a completely different scenario. Fuck, man. Um, well... I wanna get some chest protection. But, uh, sticking around here is just a death wish. We could do police stations in Essica or some shit. Yeah, let's go for it. I think we gotta take this as a win. You know what, I bet, I bet one of them at least saw us running towards Essica, so they're probably thinking that we're out of here, maybe. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Maybe they were on our trail and they went straight instead of like, yeah. laughing around like we did. True, true. Oh, fuck. Oh, What's up, bro? Fucking bitch. Uh, just, you know, slingshot it off. Of oh, a little, little fall. It's a little, <laughs> yeah. little something. Yellow it's all man. good. All right, well, hey, I gotta take a whiz. Let's get up in a hill, let you get back to white, and we'll just, like, overlook. Let's, like, get to a nice sni uh, snipe spot overlooking the cross from uh, Neptune Desker, and we'll just chill until you're back to white. All right. Airfield would be a good bet for play carriers. Yeah, but you kind of want to roll up to the airfield with protection. Like, we could at least get a police rig before we commit to the end game zone, you know? But that's a good call, I guess. I'm still waiting for this next patch, though, where it's going to rework the armor. Where you can't just find the plates, you have to get them off of zombies. And I think that's going to be a scary balancing phase where there's, like, too many zombies with armor. Or maybe you get to the point where there's not enough, but... I'd be happy if Daisy just had... Press vest, stab vest, and then the occasional plate carrier. Because on Esker right now, it's almost guaranteed that like every fully geared player has a plate right now. And uh, hopefully that's about to change a bit. Or make the plates just a little little less good, and then I don't care, everybody can have them. Because I remember back in the day, or not even too long ago, you would just shoot a guy. And if you had like a, a Mosin, you snipe him in the plate. You still really fucked him up. But now you can take about three Mosin shots to the plate in this patch. Or maybe it's three 308 shots, I don't know. But yeah, they're making changes. Maybe they're at construction, or maybe you can scope it out. I think looking back, if we would go up to the cliff overlooking Neptune, we probably would have saw those guys, but it's very risky. And I'm kind of down to get out of there after we succeeded. Somewhat succeeded. Alright man, I'm gonna lay down on this bush. If you wanna watch this little cross, I'll be right back, okay? Okay. Oh, my boots are kinda fucked up. I really gotta do some inventory management too. I'll be right back, guys. I'm gonna run to the bathroom. Oh, thanks for reminding me. I'll run quick, Ed. Yo, Sensor, thanks for the 12 month sub. Um, Dude, Reptar, thanks for subbing for two years, man. We got Unforsaken with the five gifted subs. Thank you so much, man. Um, we also had Spherically. Thanks for the four months. Love everything you do. I was getting home from work. I uh, love seeing you streaming. Much love. Aw, dude. Let me get to the rest of these in just a moment. I'll be right back. Thank you so much for the support.
Oh my god, dude. Somebody's literally fucking walking up on us right now. I could hear it. Yo, yo, it's me, it's me, it's me. I just heard somebody walk past this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where'd he go, where'd he go? I'm whispering. He's going towards, uh, construction? Left side, left side, towards the construction. Where, where, where? Let's get the high ground. You see him? I think he went up the hill. No, 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 I think he walked up here. Might be in a bush, doing what we were just doing. say anything because I didn't know if you were back or not. You know, I before I went to the bathroom, I worried about that. I thought, you know, we were right in the line of somebody to travel the same thing we were doing, so it's my bad. It could easily be the same guys, and we just heard the edge of them as they passed. There's an aggro, a zombie aggro, uh, right at the front gate, right here, closest to us. Oh, awesome, dude. Let's get this. sure i see I'm oh I, I see a little bum yeah, dude I, I see a little bum he's got a red uh motorcycle helmet he's got a blaze should i take him or should we have mercy uh, take him? Nah, I mean, he's not fine. he's probably not the bush runner dude right like he's not the guy that just passed us is he i feel like maybe i feel like it is i mean because oh, he looks lost bro he's like standing still and shit no. he's got a full one yeah. fucking snipe on his back though doesn't he Hey, let's let's rotate. See who's got a buddy. It does. You said you heard two, guaranteed or what? No, no, no. I I heard I heard one, and okay. it sounded like, I mean, from the time I heard it to where we see this guy now, it seems like he just made it a beeline to this place. Gotcha, gotcha. And I didn't hear any um, weird. I didn't hear any weapons like clinking around. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. Well, we don't know if he's got bullets, but I think he has what a blaze and a shotgun. Could be fairly deadly. Yeah. I mean, I'm probably not trying to add anybody to the well, squad unless you are. No, no, no. I mean, stick them up if anything, but we yeah. don't really need shit. Yeah. I'm down to shoot. I just don't want to shoot if that squad of three is right behind us. Or squad of two, whatever. Yeah, I'd rather... I'd rather uh, conceal our position so we can fight those guys. Yep. Because wherever they're at right now, we shoot. They're just going to beeline it here. Uh, okay. Well, you take this guy with your suppress gun. I got my suppress pistol or we rob his ass. Oh, he's up ahead. He's up ahead. Yeah, we can rob him. He has his melee weapon out. You want to do the talking, bro? I'll cover you. Uh, yeah. Such a free spirit. It's a fishing rod and a something. Uh, yo. Hey, put your hands up, man. Take your helmet off, put your hands up. Go, put your hands up. What's the key walk, that? walk towards the walk up the hill. Walk up the hill. Walk up the hill first. Just walk up the hill. Walk up the hill. Walk up the hill. Go in the go in the tree with the little fucking Christmas tree behind there. Keep going, keep going. Uh, where your buddy is? Or what? Come on, man. Walk faster, <laughs> shit, dude. We're gonna get yeah, shot out here. said walk, I'm walking. This guy's giving a shit, dude. Go, just go, go. Try to get out of the line of sight. Yeah, get up here. Get up in the bush. Alright, Mr. Fisher, man. Drop your stuff, get naked. Right here is about fine. There you go. Gun, drop the gun. Nice. Alright, well, I want you to go over there near my buddy, real quick, while I check what you got. I'm not gonna kill you. Ah, you're a hunter. Alright man, I'm not gonna take your shit, go ahead. Take your shit up. 
don't got anything on you. Oh, let my friend yeah. check. It's right here, right? It's right here. Uh, if you want to check, man. Hold on, let me, let me buddy. Back, good, back good. up, back up, back up. Good, good, good. Good. All right. All right, all right. Hey, man. Um, we're going this way. Uh, there's some good shit in the apartment across the water over there. Uh, just don't right. follow us, right? All right. Yeah, for a little bit I was thinking about maybe asking about those dudes, but I doubt he knows shit. Yeah, he seems pretty <laughs> clueless. <laughs> he was he was giving you a little bit of lip. I mean, I, I guess I would too if I'm getting robbed and being told what to do. But he was yeah. like, he was like, oh yeah, up there by your friend is what you meant to say. It's like, mm. at that point <laughs> maybe I'll fucking shoot you, buddy. But I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Well, I think he was just uh, just kind of clueless. He was like, how do I? How do I put my hands true, up? True, true. Like, fuck it, just, just go up. Just go up. <laughs> yeah, when they start asking like a basic control, I do feel a little bad. But then you got these yeah. cheeky bastards that are like, it's my first day, bro, and they're like fucking 5,000 no, hours dude, deep. I, there was this guy that just fucking, I couldn't even be angry at him because he like lulled me into a sense of like security so bad with the whole like fake fresh or fake uh, new player thing. Yeah. Oh my god, dude, and I took him on a, like, I was like, oh, let's go ahead, I'll take you to this heli crash, let me, like, gear you up, man, and then he fucking, I was like, look, here's a Viga, bam! He got killed me. you? <laughs> yeah. Wow. Here, man, take this, and here, here's one shot. Dude, people that, pre people that pretend to be new players are fucking low, because, like, I love, uh, playing with new people, but if they're faking love, it, it's so yeah, weird. Yeah, too. Yeah. Yeah, I love, he, this guy was like, yeah, I've never found a plate carrier before in my life, blah, 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 blah. I had one, I was like, dude, let's get you one. Yeah. He fucking killed me for it. You did the right thing. He's probably his fucking second kill on DayZ. It's all good. Um, yo, let's park here for yeah. a second. This is a crazy view that I don't really get to take in much. Dude, there's an even crazier one of the zoo over on that hill, past this uh, train track um, bridge. Do you know the range for that, though? I don't have a range finder. Six, uh, six to seven, depending where you're aiming. Okay. If you're aiming at the HQ in the barracks, it's six. If you're aiming past that at ATC or uh, school at seven. All right, cool. Let's go there, man. Travel time is crazy, though, dude. Uh, oh, like, yeah, they gotta be standing still for a while. Yeah, or you just have to like really lead it. Let's go check it out. So the rocks are in line with the bridge, deep. Over, yeah. Rocks over here. A lot of people travel these rocks. You get into a lot of fights, like right here at the bottom. It's right. like a A3, a uh, what is it? A3 tunnel looking type thing. Oh, yeah, yeah, I've been through here. Here, let's park again because that dude just shot an AK. If I get shot in the head, so be it. Dude, I remember last time I was walking through here with a buddy to the right in these woods. I thought no one was going to be here. Sure enough, some dude with an AK fucking sprays us both down immediately. Blasted you. Yeah, so we got to be careful up here. Yep. Where do you think that shot was? Would you argue it's like the farthest apartment that we can see right now? I, I didn't get a good uh, listen to the shot, but... um. It's yeah. It sounds like uh, it sounds like maybe that. Okay, so you see the like candy cane type uh, tower thing, not the first apartment. But yeah, yeah, the yeah. Second one. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what it sounds like it was at. Those apartments on the yeah, where the the uh, wires combine or connect them on the right side. That's where I kind of yeah. think it is. Yep, on the right side though. Yeah. <sighs> hmm. Well, if you think we'll get better eyes, we can keep pushing, or we can wait here for a minute. It's your call. Let's go it up for a second, dude. I'm just watching behind us, so these guys don't come behind. Us. Gotcha. There should be no way I'm alive right now, dude. That guy fucking nailed me in the head. Well, what do you you got the assault helmet? Did it go from pristine down to worn? Yeah. Yeah, man. Ugh. Like that's it. Like you know, like that. Like with five, what was it? What's the scout? Five five uh, five five six. Five five right? six, dude. I was that's bitching about it. It. What well, you know? What people are saying is that a suppressed five five six scout does less damage. So maybe that's has something to do with why you're alive. I don't know. I think it's just that helmet, dude. Okay. I think that helmet takes like two five five six in this patch, which makes sense that it saves you from one, I guess.
It's the best helmet in the game, but it shouldn't shouldn't save you from two, I don't think. Mm. Oh, like the suppressor like does something to the yeah. velocity or the damage or whatever? That's what somebody tried to tell me, but it's mainly the damage drop-off. I think if you're like really far away and you have a suppressor, it's extra bad damage-wise. Yeah, oh, I could see that, though. But yeah, let's give it. Let's just give it another thirty right, well, seconds. I'm ready then, to yeah, just just give me one. Yeah, just give me like thirty seconds, and then we'll fucking head out. I'm just gonna watch this right side now. Okay. I'm surprised we're not seeing any zombies over there where the shots were. Oh, is that back in Neptune? Yeah. You know what, I would bet that uh, it's the same two guys. I bet the Gilly guy and his buddy are around there trying to get revenge since we I killed that dude while you're on con. But, um, I'm, I mean, we don't have to go back to We've been there for a while. We can go play around with the city. You want to show me that Snipe's bottom game? Yeah. Yep, yep. I bet it's the same guys because, I mean, they sound like they got big guns and... I, N Neptune is like a pretty big hot spot, but it's also so close to the spawn zone that I almost feel bad going back there with big guns, like after I leave it the first time. So I just don't want to go back. We have seen a couple of kind of freshies around the area because of the coolest spawns. Yeah, I got the new mic going, Muzzik. We got the SM7B. We did have an RE20, the Electro Voice, which was really good. But we were convinced that one of my audio parts was like slightly damaged. And uh, I got new everything, so I hope it sounds good for you. Yo, Toby, what's up, dude? Yo, thanks, guys. Good luck damage in the 7B. <laughs> yeah. I mean, they're both made, like just hunk some metal, the RE20 and the, and the SM7B, so good. Yours is 15 years old, Mandy, oh my god. So do you use it when you're gaming? Or do you just like bust it oh, out fuck. for big stuff? Ooh. Leather kit, that's it. Ah, I don't even have a basic chest rig yet, damn it. Mm -hmm. Dude. Uh you know, uh, at the zoo, I don't know if you've ever climbed up, like, uh, the back side of it. You know where the, the underside, there's, like, a little opening? And then the secret like spot. A... Secret spot, yeah, but then there's that, that, like, ledge that, um, that juts out, and then there's the rocks, and you can climb from the rocks up on the ledge. Oh, I don't know about that. Yeah, I'm, you know, been on the... so you yeah. drop down from the barracks to the secret spot, and then you can drop down to that little room. But you're saying the rocks across from the secret spot entrance? Yeah, yeah, and yeah, then yeah, there's yeah. like a little like awning or whatever that that comes out. Well, me and a couple buddies were jumping on top of there, and then we just started taking uh, suppressed shots. And then um, my buddy just drops and hits the floor, and I guess uh, the dude's bottle suppressor runs out, and he's shooting at M24 from way over here. Like I see tracer rounds from way the spot I'm about to show you right here. Um, okay. And like you can see the whole fucking zoo. Oh, actually. Uh, we're coming up on it. Okay, okay. It might be right here, is it? You guys are right. I should have fixed my shoes, but it's all good. No, it's a little bit further down. It's like down it'll, here. it'll give us a reason to push in. I forgot to look at my boots. You were considered a shit Right if. here. Ish. Okay. Like you gotta look through the tree, like right here. Ooh, dude, this is awesome. Like right where I'm standing, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that's perfect. All right, let's check this out. So you think this is about 657? Yeah, definitely 657. Okay. It's it's not. I mean, when you the range. So like I said, the closest you're at six, the further buildings you're at seven. It's the the bullet drop that you uh and the timing that you got to get right. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we'll chill here for a sec. 
this is crazy good. All right, so we're gonna zero to. Actually, I don't want st to change my zero just in case somebody runs up on us. Um, Claude, yeah, you said have you considered doing something with like a filter to get a, a really bad sounding mic? Oh, dude, we get a dead zombie at the stairway in the middle leading up to the mill base. So somebody's around in between the school and the camel building. Dead zombie. Um, my best bet is the only the main thing we could do, all right, is let's say you go to Walmart and buy like a $10 headset and then I hook it up to a certain jack and then every time I cue my in-game mic, I'm queuing up the Walmart mic. Every time I cue my, or every time I just talk in general, it's going through the mic to you guys, the good one. So, I think that's the best solution to avoid a voice changer. Just have like a really shitty sounding mic and then a really good one. But the only problem is, what if I fucking bump into like one of my best friends in game or just somebody that I really like? And I'm treating them with this awful sounding mic, even though they know it's me. I think that's going to be the worst part. The absolute worst part. Because you're not going to be able to just toggle that in-game. You're stuck with that shit mic for in-game. So, I don't know. But that's a, it's a neat idea. Okay, yeah, I see what you're talking about. I'm not trying to sound like Mr. Popular, but I hate when we're having an epic adventure. And then somebody doesn't realize that, like, calling out my stream name or saying certain things could ruin, like, the randomness of, you know, the people around us. So... Yeah, it doesn't. It does, you don't have to be super popular to kind of want to have a little bit of a masked voice every once in a while in Daisy. You, you know, it doesn't matter if you have 50 viewers, 100 viewers, 1,000 viewers. Like, some people bring in the stream thing, and it's kind of nice to be incognito sometimes. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm cracking my fingers. My my new mic might pick up some stuff. We're trying to fine tune it. It's almost perfect though. Foot pedal. <laughs> yeah, let's get the foot pedals out. Nah, we've retired the Aussie voice. I need to take some fucking voice acting lessons before I can bust out the Aussie again. <laughs> nah, maybe I just need this new mic. Now I can actually whisper. And be like, yo, there's some fucking bad dudes so bad. Be careful. I noticed, my, oh, I noticed in my previous mic, every time I whispered, you guys didn't hear anything, basically. Oh, 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 there is, there is. In the school. In the school. How far do you think the left side school windows are? Second floor. Big ass green backpack. Uh, it's gotta be at least seven, seven He's standing six. still, dude. You wanna take him? <laughs> oh, okay, go for seven and aim above his head. Like a head length above his head. It was so close. There might be two in there. They're going to the right side windows, right side windows. What is this fucking zoom shit, Daisy? Come on. Can I shoot myself in the boot there? <laughs> I don't see this guy. He said school. So you look at the school, front door, bottom door, like, and then you go up a level. He's second floor, right side windows. The ones that you can barely see in, they're like tiles. Yeah, like the the four windows on the right. Which windows in? I, don't, I can't. I don't see him now in the windows. Yeah. I went out the back side. I couldn't resist. He was standing there for like a full 10 seconds. But, uh... Fuck. If I would've aimed a little bit Did higher... Hit a little bit too low? Yeah, if I would've aimed a little bit higher, it would've been a headshot. It was so fucking close. I got tracers too, so it was perfect. I don't see any movement anymore. I think people are holding down that school, because really it is the best building to hold down, I think, out of all of those. You can be really sneaky in there. Yeah, and like you said, you can't really see through the damn windows. Yep. He's got a plate carrier on, dude. We need that thing. Oh, fuck, yeah. You just saw one, yeah? I really couldn't tell. I know I saw one, obviously, but I don't know if there was a second guy that, like, ran to the right with him. It could have been two. Okay. <laughs> well, what do you think, dude? We probably got people coming our way now. Yeah, people are thinking um, about us. I was hoping he's going to give us another chance, but he's not, so... 
I'm down to push to a different area. Yeah, we uh, check out airfield, and then if uh, nothing goes down there, we can push across and then make a play on the zoo. Sure. Yeah, yeah, I'm done, man. I feel like zoo is my final stop too. I hate going to the zoo like right away. Yeah, yeah. I also hate going to the apartments right away. It's like yeah. so anticlimactic. Fuck that. I mean, if you got a good gun or a good squad, and you go to the airfield, you got so much space to actually make good choices, you know. So I'm down. Uh, would it be smart to drop your clothes right now? Uh, I'm not going to go as far as drop my clothes for sniping right now. If anything, the best way to do it, and I should go back to doing it, is like, as you're optimizing your inventory, you put all the heavy, kind of like, excess luxury items in your backpack, and only keep your essentials, like medical, um, bandages. I mean, not bandages, like, yeah, medical bandages, um, bullets, all the essentials, repair kits. Just stuff that, like, you don't want to lose. And then anytime you're in a snipe spot, you just drag the bag to the ground, gain like an extra block of stamina, do your sniping, and then put it back on. But I don't want to sit there like dropping my armor, because then you might get shot while you're sniping. And uh, I don't want to be sitting there as a fucking naked dude sniping either, like getting super cold. Because you will actually lose health from being too cold. But yeah, just turn your bag into like the, you know, I'm willing to lose this shit backpack. And uh... If you don't fucking pick it back up because you're in a gunfight, then it's all good. Or, the alternative is you just risk it and you drop your armor, because that's super heavy. If you feel like you're in a really good snipe spot, you just want to drop it for like 20 seconds, you'll probably get away with it. But if you get counter sniped in that 20 seconds, you'll be kicking yourself. I don't really do it enough. I was really doing it on Namalsk when we had the Gauss rifle and had and like 10% stamina because the Gauss is so heavy. I gotta go back to doing it more often on this map too. And I'm finally uh, back to full health. Well, arrow still going up, but full white. All right, cool. Yeah, I'm good as well. Speaking of that, I'm just gonna eat everything I have on the way. You don't need any food, do you? Uh, you hungry? No, but I should probably eat something in it. Okay. Uh, yeah, I got a jam and a... Lunch. Okay. Alright. Oh, wow. I love your little, uh... Holy shit, dude. I've never done this. You just fucking walk over that hill to the back of the airfield. I always take the, like, stupid basic route. That's good shit. Oh, shit. Yeah, this, so this... This way it's cool, because you got an option, so if you see somebody at the warehouse, you push over there, but... I ri there's a long play on this, uh, right tree line there, that, uh... You know how the heli spawns, like, in the back corner by HQ? Yeah, I mean, I see a heli right now. It's in the middle. But, yeah. That far yeah, right tree line you're yeah, saying, you can, like, we like, could... rotate around it. Yeah, yeah, if we see some geared guys, I'm down to hit that tree line and get up on, like, the snipe spot, you know? Behind the mill base and all that. Yeah. Um... Yeah. Okay, so you know how the wind like blows the heli smoke? I think it's just blowing it the wrong direction right now. That's why you can't. Okay, there it is. It's above the industrial, like 100 meters down. By the barracks. Probably like the main spot, you know? Right over the tree line. Yeah, holy shit. Yeah, I don't see anything. Oh, bro, do you have the fog bug? I fixed my fog bug the other day. I could do it for you real quick. Okay. Sure. Um. Wait, is it not foggy right now? Well, if okay, if you're right I, for here, for me it's pretty damn foggy. Like look, if I'm looking 200, it's mm -hmm. pretty damn foggy. So you don't see the fucking yellow tower over the trees in the distance, like the tallest tower beyond industrial. You don't see that tower. Barely. Like I see the silhouette. Oh, okay. Of it. I don't see do the you, color. Do you see the smoke of the heli to the left of it, above the trees? No, I don't see that. Okay, so I think Rick. the fix. I think the fix for the fog bug is you just go into your video settings and t put it to like high pre- like pay attention, maybe take a screenshot, pay attention to what your settings are and then you have to take it off a custom preset and put your graphic setting preset on like high or extreme and then customize it all back out to where you want it to be. Okay. But okay. take a screenshot shot. just so I don't fuck you over. Yeah, try to remember all your settings. Am I saying that wrong? Gustav, are you still in here? Do you remember how to fix the fog bug? Did I tell him that to do that right?
You know what? I'm, a, I'm actually, I'll probably try to try to fuck with it another time because I have a really uh, bad, ex I'm bad experience with. Uh, <coughs> Oh, with with in -game settings. yeah, sometimes you fuck with an in-game setting and then your screen's just black or something. I got you, bro. Don't worry about it. Yeah. Or you have it too. Well, uh... That's right. You know where the hell he is. So I can see a little bit farther than he can right now, though. He's right, though. Like, if this dude is... even, I mean, I'm not... Yeah. If he's streaming, even, he could actually black screen his stream to the point where you'd have to rejoin the server and if there's a queue then that's kind of a shitty thing so so which way do you usually come like from the road or like how do you, i'm i'm how do you almost really always get? like I, I like to do essica first like give the city a chance to like roam through there see if i can find some people or some loot and then i just usually swim like i pop an epi pen and just swim across but uh i got i'm gonna oh, start okay. taking this route more often Um, shit, maybe I should have stayed up higher longer, but once I knew that you couldn't see as far as me, I guess I figured let's just go down. Okay. I mean, I don't know. I don't know, because I could see, like, uh, straight across the river now. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Maybe I just got to turn it up to high. Alright. You want to wrap around the right edge? Get eyes on that heli? Yeah. You want to go far, far right, or you want to kind of get right up in this shit? Um, yeah, let's just stay in the middle. I kind of like, okay. like want some action now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we'll fall out to that that right edge if we need to. I don't know why, but everyone I ever team up with I can't see the heli and stuff in the distance. Yeah, it's this nasty fog bug going around, or it's their settings, or who knows? Maybe it's something to do with the view distance on Essaker that's like triggering the bug more often I don't know I swear there's something going on with Daisy that like nobody even knows about not even the fucking devs especially when it comes to how players spawn in there's like this spawn system that tries to spawn people next to other people and the devs themselves can't like wrap their head around how to completely randomize the spawns like they're constantly trying to spawn you in certain places instead of just completely random through like trust me there's some fucking shit that we don't even understand man oh what's this No, I mean, Mandy, like, they, they should code the random spawns, right? But, like, it's, it's, uh, that's how it is in DayZ, right? Like, it's a broken system. I'm not sure why we don't have true random spawns. Right, right. It's like a little mystery system that we don't know about. <laughs> Dude, have you seen the tree stump that's, like, all fucking flopping oh, yeah. and shit? The flaccid tree, yep. <laughs> I saw that. Yeah. I saw that early on and I did a double take. I thought it was a dude. <laughs> yep, me too. thought it was oh. a dude, uh, Q, uh, like, leaning with Q. Yeah, it's actually pretty stable right now. He's having a good day. Oh, no, no, he's fucking flopping around. Alright, never mind. Yeah, so I like this little corner here, because you can look down at the barracks, and it's kind of safe with all these trees. Just chill here for a sec. Yeah, See if the zombies are dead, too. Maybe get a... Yeah, yeah, oh, dead oh. zombie in the parking lot. Oh, you see dead zombie in the parking lot? Okay, let's get these trees. Is the close bear closed? I think it's open. It looks open. I think those doors open inward. Yeah, yep, open. yep.
Yeah, let's just chill and I think watch this very for a little bit. They could just be ahead, maybe like H. Yep, yep, front, front. Fuck, he went in. He's super low, dude. He's like a fucking speedrunner maniac by trying to meet his buddy or get his loot. I looked away at the wrong time. Uh, I was still zeroed at fucking seven. Fucking bitch. Peeking, peeking, peeking. Oh my god. I'm gonna check my zero too, just in case. No, I think mine's on. He ran out. He ran out back. He ran out back. He's got a gun out too. Literally fucking shot when my mouse wasn't even ready to shoot. He's he went far left. He went far left. Trying to get up on the hill. On the hill. I'm just falling back. The, the I'm gonna fall back a little bit. Watch that backside bunker hill. He's probably trying to get an angle on it. Did you see him go up there? No, but that's where I would go if I rotated out back left. Okay. I think I might have just killed him. He did the, him. exactly what you said. Yeah, okay, yeah. you hit him? Nice. Yeah, I hit him. I hope we both did then. Fuck. You wanna fall back, go left or right? Or do you wanna push? Fall back, uh, fall back and we could, uh, we can actually see the, um, the bunker from, uh, well, that side's pretty open. Let's just fall back this way. I'll take care of the zombie, I'll meet you there. Is that the flaccid fucking tree looking at me funny again? It is! That fucking flaccid tree! Looks like it's strapped with all kinds of mill gear. He's got a fucking gun on his sling or something. What do we say we wrap, uh... Go like, straight ahead? On the, uh... Other side? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, it's like... When I see somebody like this, I don't even want to like fucking give him anything, because he clearly just... Ran here with minimal gear, but... I guess that's how it goes. Yeah. Be able to see his body from the backside if we knock him. Yeah, I mean, you said you hit him, and I don't see how my shot could have missed, so I feel like that guy should be dead. I unzoomed right as I shot, dead. though. He's oh, dead good as shit. Fuck. He's dead as fuck. Good yeah. shit, bro. He caught some rounds. Nice shit. Alright, we'll loot him later. Or, like, whenever. Not, not was a that rush. The Was that the guy, though? Was that the guy that ran out of. I don't know. He was, That guy was wearing, uh, like, a burgundy. Mm -hmm. Shirt or some shit. Like nah, that, that was seen. Eh, that was him, bro. Blue pants. I mean, there could be. Let's assume there's another. Okay. But that was him. Never mind. That's him. Yeah, he has a yeah. sledge on his back. That's him. Yep, yep, yep. It's probably another though. Let's um, let's get straight ahead in the hills. There's a there's a snipe spot that looks straight down on the runway and ATC. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, dude, I forgot to mention. I got like four stashes in Essaker. I've been trying to do that build a gun thing. And all I need is the body part. Oh, fuck, man. All I need is the body piece. Dude, I've never found the body I find everything but... Well, everything if... Everything but the yeah. body part I found. If we get it, I'll take it to the stash. I don't even know if it's still there. Okay. Maybe we can, uh, scope in on the heli, see if there's any loot there, at least. Okay. <laughs> Sin, I did not mean to say it like that. Uh... No, this guy's chill. He's not suspect at all. I gave him a hard time in the beginning because it was just like our first encounter. It, you know, sometimes if somebody's being like super friendly and you're not really, I don't know, maybe you were looking to get into a gunfight and you're like, all right, well, I'm not going to kill this guy, but I'm at least going to rob him and give him a hard time and try to make things kind of interesting. But uh, he's been a cool dude the whole time. He handled the robbery really well. He fucking blasted a dude and saved my ass earlier. It, he's been good. Oh, what's up, Begby? Oh, the, the reunion was so good, man. It was so nice to see all my buddies again. Thanks for asking. Probably gonna do it again for one of the big UFC fights. What are you guys doing for the 4th, though? I asked earlier, but um, I'm not sure if I'm going out tomorrow night for the 4th of July or if I'm just gonna stay in. What do you guys got planned? Give me some good ideas.
Should we go out, or should we just sit on the porch and try to watch the local fireworks? Or should we just play some games? I don't know. I kind of feel like I should do something. I don't really give a shit about. I'm like the most anti-holiday person these days. Unless my buddies are around or whatever. I got some cool people to hang out with. You know, I love that. <laughs> are you enjoying that, bro? Do that again. Do that again. <laughs> you gotta see that, dude. Look at this. Oh, yeah, do it again. Do it again. Zoom in. Have you seen that shit, bro? It's fucking broken as hell. Look at this. So, I'm about to... Yo, I'm like, yo, dude, we got eyes it's on. like you laying then, on your side, right? Well, watch when I scope in. Look at my head right now. I got eyes on the fucking target. Two down. Like it's here, you do it again. Just yeah, like dude, rapid rapid him. zoom. Straight on the runway. Yeah, rapid zoom. In and out. Yeah. He's right there, I see him. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, I see him, bro. Dude, that saves you. Him, that ATC? That's so broken, bro, because you're laying and they're trying to snipe you, but your head is behind your body and, and they your shoot head you in the snaps back. Yeah, they shoot you in like the knee or something, dude. And it and not only that, but how shitty does it feel? Like I'm okay, so look, I'm trying to zoom in at ATC, but when you zoom my fucking cursor is on my oh, boot. Fuck. I could shoot myself in like the yeah. dick almost. And then I'm like, Ugh. and by the time I get up there, he fucking shot me in the head. I'm like, well, not in the head, but in the Well, no, because crotch. your head's like in the ground. Yeah, he yeah, shot me in the fucking, the give us a busted leg or something by then, you know? It's so weird. It, it never used to be like this. Like, you used to be able to lay prone really nice. And another thing, too, is even if you lay normal, you can't fucking do it because the grass is in your way. So it's like, they completely fucked yeah, yeah. the prone, but I don't know. Uh, I couldn't get eyes on the, the heli at all, man, so I don't know what's there. Uh, I'm down to... There's a break in the, uh... Yeah. Push up through the break yeah. here. I'm down to push in. Let's fucking get this shit, man. We've had a good run. The rest is a bonus. Yeah. I mean, god damn. If anything, we gotta just bring some attention to it, because that prone mechanic is fucking broken as hell. Open. And I'm sure they could fix that. Yo, what's up, bomb? How you doing, man? You know what we were thinking the other day? So you know the DMR has the bipod? And apparently the bipod works. That's why I want to get this thing going so bad. What if the devs or a mod just implemented, like, pretending that you had a bipod on all your guns so it would just get you over the grass? I feel like that's what we need. It's like the prone needs to be a little bit lifted up. Grass being in your face prone is realistic. Sure it is, it is. And it, you know what? And it's good. Because think of all the deadly prone snipers. They would be invincible. But it just needs a little something. So back in the day, I think what you could do is like lay on your grass. And you'd be able to keep a little bit of grass pushed down just so you could have your little spot. But it would grow back as soon as you moved. These days I think it grows back like immediately. That's true too. If you put the vision above the grass, you're basically like... you are It's so hard to hit somebody that's like this, but then you can see. So that would be broken, yeah. See some shit at the heli, but uh. Well, I don't know. the answer to that, <laughs> dude, is. Like, uh, stuff on the closest side to us. Just okay. Pushing the building here. The answer to that, dude, is people laying in the grass, they're almost invisible if they don't have a backpack. They should just make people more noticeable when they're laying prone. And then also let the prone guys see a little bit more. So it's like you're more vulnerable, but you can also see a little bit. Because right now it's almost like you're lower than the grass. Someone ATC? Nah, it's like that flickering graphic. Kinda sucks. There might be somebody in there though. It's like a triangle that keeps flickering. Oh, damn. The fuck? Yo. 338 mag over here. You had one of these yet? The crazy snipe? Yeah, yeah, I had it once. Nice, dude. Yeah, M14 is nice as hell, too. Only had it once, zombie coming. Jesus. Scared me. Sorry. Ooh, come in here. Not that you need this, but I do have a 101 mag, and I have a shit ton of 556. 
So if you want that, it's your call. Oh shit, okay. <laughs> nah, no, I'm good. I got so wow. much ammo for this thing. That Freshie has a scope tundra, dude. He was a second away from clicking one of us. doing here? Is there some shit that we can drop? I need a chest rig. There's definitely some shit that we could drop. Oh, the boots, the boots. Okay, where are these boots that you guys saw? Hold up, hold up. Let me get some new shoes if they're in here. Boots right there. Oh, one nice mech. Yeah. Do you want this for a future plate or should I fill it up? Oh, there's gloves out here in the left corner. Oh, nice. There's guns at the heli. Dude, I see a couple guns. I don't know what they are though. Okay. See, it's that stupid flag in there. It's just, it's stupid because it keeps make, like changing the color of it. Every When you look, it's moving. See? This looks kind of glitchy. Alright, well, I'm gonna peek out here and then we can try that heli. Fuck okay, it, let's, yeah. I'm gonna move over to the headquarters. Crazy shotgun down here, the mariner. I hate that thing, dude. It's so fucking loud. Fucking landmine. Yeah, late night. It's not the best. Yo, I, uh... I'm about to put this landmine somewhere. Oh, is the server restart coming in like 10 minutes? Uh, something like that, yeah. You coming back in? Yeah, I'll be back in. Okay, some camel pants back here. So these fucking camel pants were three kilos. I'll pass. Holy shit. Dude, how nice is the Spectre on an AK? Scope is fucking high definition, bro. Love it. I'm not trying to ruin your day, but apparently it's like a little bit crooked on some guns. Is it crooked on that one? Um, yes. Like little cockeyed? Yeah. Hopefully the modder fixes that shit. Thing. Yeah, sorry dude. Ruined. <laughs> it's gotta go. I know some people they are like, I don't use that shit because it's fucking crooked. I just got one too. Fuck that. Yo, if you, yeah, if you get an AK rail, let me know. I think there's one at the heli. I think I scoped in on it. It's on the uh, far side of the heli. Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna get on the roof real quick and then we'll hit that heli before the restart. Zombie down there. I haven't heard too many shots. I still think there's a lot of suppressors in rotation, especially on this map. So, I'm certain there's some people in Essex are blasting zombies and we just don't know about it. 
think suppressors were reduced, but you still gotta remember there's a bunch of suppressors like in the server before that happened. At least on players and stashes. I think the stashes recently got wiped though, which is cool. Alright dude, let's hit this heli. And then we gotta hit the body before the restart too. Boo -boo. I got the KM though. Dope. We got an AK for us. Extra. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, fucking SKS and VSS. Damn. You always gotta take a second thought about that SK. Fucking black SK? Oh shit, dude. Yeah, that's just good, man. Sweet. I don't stash often, but I would stash that. Fucking grab a bunch of weapons, gladiator oh, stuff. Yeah, yeah, I dragged this shit over. Let's get to a safe. You want? Are you gonna go with the AKM? Yeah. Word. Do you? Uh, all right. You want this mag for? Uh, I and mean, I only got one mag for the AKM, but. The um, there's a bunch of ammo and a couple mags down here. I dropped one earlier. All right, I, here. I got a KM mag. I just, I just got one. All right, well, hear me out, dude. Before the restart hits, I'm putting a bunch of 762 stuff up here. Just come grab it when I oh. move down. 60 rounds for you and a scope that you might want. I don't know. Probably doesn't want that scope, does he? Uh. There's so many AK mags. The thing about this scope is you can kind of just use the 1x and pretend it's a red dot. I think we'll get away with it. Oh yeah, let's go check that guy. Just come up here and get these three uh, fucking boxes. What was that noise I just heard? Holy shit, dude, you were hooking me up. Bro, so many fucking mags. I'm dropping so some much 9 ammo. Okay, yeah, I can use that. Dude, you just gave me fucking infinite ammo. I'm dropping all my 5.56. Five, Fuck it. You just hooked me up. Alright, I dropped some 9 mil and 5.56 five, in there. Yeah, let's hit, get a little start to that body before it's too late. I might want to get those pouches, but it's all good. Drop them, get you stuff. I'm thinking about it. What's yeah? I guess we'll stick with the uh, macro as our zombie killer. We don't really need anything else. Oh, that NATO suppressor's ruined. I took a snipe, I'm just gonna drop over here. You're not whispering anymore, are you? No, no, no. Okay. He didn't have one in the chamber, so he did fire right as we killed him. Somewhere, or yeah. You want to get out of here so we can yeah. walk in uh, somewhere like outside? Sounds good, man. Have you noticed that priority system they got going on with items that get ruined? Like if you get shot in the chest and you have a suppressor, for example, it'll target the suppressor over everything else. 
Yeah, and scopes too. Like if you have any yeah. scopes. Yeah, and like, like sailing bags. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. yeah. oh fuck, let's just... Let's have food on him. If you want it, I'm full. Nah, I've got food. There's a the target batteries too. Yep, batteries, another one. I think one day the devs went in, they were like, alright, these are all Never the items. have been this far along without e at least, like, just, like, basic chest protection. Well, hey, scoping on all these police cars, can you get a stab vest on the hood? I think, yeah, dude, I see a fucking stab vest on the you hood. Can. Yo, oh, you can. Yo, you just said something, bro, you get that first one, man. It's on the far left car. I'll, I'll loot this. Yeah. Damn, that armor's big. Nice, dude. But yeah, instead of having like your whole backpack just get ruined in one shot that hit you in the stomach, now they're like, alright, the good items have a higher chance of getting damaged, and eh, that makes sense. Sometimes it sucks, though, when it's like yeah, guaranteed. It to the, yeah. I don't know, like the, the tree line? Yeah, let's reset Actually, back. Actually, we should probably yeah. go. What do you want to do? Yeah, yeah reset back to uh, the tree line where we uh, kind of were. Yeah, where we were thinking about fucking with the settings. Yeah. Because we'll easily see like a fresh heli crash. I, I, never, I can't remember how that works. Like if a reset indefinitely moves the heli crashes and gets a fresh one, or if the one that just spawned in is going to stay after the reset. I can't remember. Uh, I, I think I think like after reset, uh, the helis despawn and like move. I, th yeah. I mean, that's what I've noticed. Like, I think I've so. I've been here at the airfield, restart happened, and then a heli that was right in front of me moved uh. right on Ooh, so that after the reset we'll come back and that's in line with the, what the fuck is that is it oh it's a deer yeah it's a it's a little deer oh, any shopkeeper mini games nah we're gonna make a big youtube video of the whole shop thing though On one hand, the shop shenanigans were good. On the other hand, the only reason I did it is because Borish was a shit show with non-stop, like, 20 players at a time, just always there. So, some of the recent updates with the spawns and the map have been, I think, leading to less people in Borosh. But some some days, people are still just like, oh, just nothing but Borosh spawns all day long. I haven't really been there lately, though. I've been, I've been somehow avoiding it. Uh, apartments. Yeah, let's, uh... Get as far as we can, we'll scope it on that after the reset. Should you build a PC or get a pre built? It's up to you, man. If you think building is going to be too much work and stress and you're just lost, maybe just go with a pre built, but everybody that's trying to have like a just buy a PC that you can build upon for the future and like make upgrades to whenever new game comes or new games come out and your specs get outdated you're gonna want to have like a custom built PC so you can take stuff out put new stuff in you know maybe like five things last you years but one thing needs replaced yada yada I feel like some pre-built PCs you can't really just like go in and easily yank something out and fix a problem I don't really know but uh yeah I always recommend uh custom built PCs Yet, I would, if I didn't have people that would help me, I probably would have broke down one day and just bought a pre-built. If I didn't have knowledgeable people around me. So, could go either way. And if you get a pre-built first, it's not the end of the world. You could just use that and then eventually get a custom-built PC, but depends on your budget. Maybe you could turn, like, your pre-built into your streaming computer in the future, or, like, give it to your brother or something, you know? Maybe. Yeah, PC Part Picker or Logical Increments, there's a bunch of good websites that'll help you build. 
is a reset on the hour. Uh, this one's a few minutes after the hour. This server goes back and forth with being on the hour and a few minutes after because of reasons that just, it's a good thing. Alright dude, it's gonna kick us any second, so I'll meet you in... I don't know, this bush right here I guess, and fucking sure. chill. I just don't want to get kicked in a random field. Yeah, I'll be over here. Alright dude. Seen a few. Seen like five. See ya. Man, so my guy is still in jeans, Pico, no chest rig, gotta come and fix up my jeans. We got an AK, we got a blaze. AK's just, it's just so sick. It's so sick. Oh, did he? I hope he got the suppressor. Yeah, I think he did. Oh, we got the landmine as well. We got this cra ooh, crazy Bravo scope. Uh... Alright, let me back out and see what I missed earlier. Dude, Sudcat, thanks for the 54 month reset, by the way. Thank you so much, dude. Let me see what I was missing. We had Unforsaken one with the five gifted subs. We had Censored, uh, Sergeant, Reptar. Might be repeating some names, but I'm gonna get through all these. Sudcats, that's four and a half years. Where does the time go? Dude, don't remind me, man. Thanks for the 54 months. You know I appreciate everything, dude. Uh, we got Desert. Thanks for the 27 months. It was really cool to say that, or to see you say the other night, you were like, oh, now that I saw that, I can go to bed happy. I can't remember what it was, but I'm glad you're enjoying the streams, dude. Uh, Bill Clinton, thanks for all the bits. We got Start, thanks for the six months. I'm pretty sure Start is that dude named, like, Garnish that we bumped into a couple of times in Daisy. Hope everything's going good, dude. Thanks for the support. Um, we had Solo Beard. Morning Star, thanks for the brand new Prime Sub. Uh, da -da -da. We had Trader hooking us up with the gifts. Thank you, Trader. Capitalist, Merkin, Bearded. Six months of pure enjoyment. Uh, love every stream. Smoke, thanks. Dude, my pleasure, man. Thank you so much. Um, one of the top Twitch streamers. Much love. Dude, Daddy, thanks for uh, supporting the stream and enjoying it, dude. We got Kestrel hooking up Real Talks with the gift. We got Evo, uh, House. Thanks for the gifts, dude. Uh, we got Silly Gilly, J Steady, Glockness Monster, uh, Van Raff. Thanks for the 40 months. And, uh, dude, Bad and Boozy. Thanks for the tier 2 9 months as well. It's going on Spook. We got Steez. Thanks for the, th dude, over three years sub in Steez. Thank you, dude. Stompy, thanks for the brand new sub. I feel like I'm just as excited to see new subs as I am to see three plus year subs. I appreciate it. Uh, why no face cam? Uh, cause I don't, that's not how I run my show, man. I didn't get into Twitch to, the reason I got into Twitch meet, or initially was to show my buddies how cool Daisy was. And then when I started enjoying the fact that people were like watching and getting something out of my experiences and my adventures, I realized that like Daisy is such a beautiful game that I just don't want to add anything to the screen. You know, I don't want you to get distracted by alerts popping up or, or my face cam or like my overlays if we're in the middle of some awesome immersive intense realistic situation okay and that's just the way i saw it in the beginning i really appreciate the, what daisy does for immersion and looks and i just want to keep that going i feel like it was the easy no-brainer and i was really surprised that nobody else was fucking doing it and um i just yeah i just love it man like through the eyes of the survivor if you're just one of those dudes like me that wants to just kind of chill and lurk to just some fucking gameplay or whatever that's what I wanted to provide for you. But, um, you know, it's everybody does something different, dude. Like Sequisha, all these dudes on Twitch with webcams, they do a great job. It's just a different style. Everybody's got a different thing that they're good at, that they got into Twitch for. And uh, I love that there's games like Tarkov and a few other, like, really immersive single-player games that I can rock the same thing, you know? Nothing on the screen because the game speaks for itself. You know what I mean? So, anyways, guys, I'll be right back. I gotta run to the bathroom. Yo, Jolly, thanks for the, th the uh, four months. Uh, S48, thanks for the 11 months, dude. You guys are nuts. If you guys haven't checked out Jolly, he also streams Daisy. Thank you very much, dude. Are you liking Tarkov? Um, I'm not really craving it right now, dude, but I think it's a good update that's making the game, putting the game in the right direction. Um, you know, the, the stuff that I want changed hasn't changed, but we're heading in the right direction. So we're going to play some more. I don't know if we're going to do it tonight, but definitely going to play some more, dude. I'll be right back.
All right, thanks for being patient, guys. We're loading back in. Oh, you want to see some OGR too? My bad. I could have given it to you sooner. Uh, we are going to do a playthrough of Resident Evil 8 soon, and I don't even know if there's any Resident Evil 8 music that's worth adding to like the Daisy waiting soundtrack, but I'm going to see. Let me try to get back in here, guys. So it is getting late. It's 4 a.m. We're going to play with this guy until the run ends, and then we're going to decide if we want to do one more run or if we want to do just a few hours of Tarkov, but we'll see how it goes. Yo, Daddy, thanks for the four months, and... uh. Dude, you said you were the guy with the VSS from the ATC tower the other night. You sniped one, I came in, killed the other three, and you were involved. Oh, dude, that was a really fun engagement. So, if you watch my perspective back, which maybe you did, maybe you didn't, I had a nasty hand bug. And we were kind of wondering, I don't think you guys cleared out the room that I was relogging in, but if you cleared out that room and then I relogged and shot you, that would have been so cheap. But I think I logged back in in perfect timing to still fight you guys, like, legitimately, so... Yeah, if you could tell me, you know, maybe what happened from your end, that was badass, dude. Thanks for the cool fight. And, yo, Nick, thanks for the three months, dude. Love the streams. First one you played playing Tarkov, you totally sold me on the game uh, with your play style. Now you're convincing me more and more to play DayZ. Dude, definitely check it out, man. <clears throat> That's fucking awesome to hear, dude. I'm glad I could get you into these games. Um, we got Wide Party, thanks for the two months. I'm kind of stuck on the loading screen right now, dudes. I've been here for a minute now. Yo, Wide Party says, absolutely love the content. Hope you keep it up as long as you can. Dude, thank you, man. We got Mellow Wolf, thanks for the brand new Tier 3 sub. We just got back in. Let me see if my buddy's here or not. Uh, dude? Did oh, I got the cursor bug, so we gotta do... Fuck. Alt, enter, escape, alt, enter. Yo, you out there, bro? I'm in the bush. Yo, yo. Yo, dude. What's up? Just give me one more second. Hold on. Yep. Sorry, sorry, man. I took a few extra oh. minutes. Nah, you're good. I was in the tree down there. Alright, my bad. I almost fucking... I almost spilled my water all over the place here. Yeah, dude, do you always get that, um, alt-enter bug? With your, when you gotta do fucking... when your cursor stuck on the screen? Um, not always. Uh, it happens when I'm like first loading into a, to the game, though. But if Dude. I like keep the game open, um, oh, it happens. so you leave it open and hit play the second time through. I close it every time. That's why I get it every time. Ah, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. When you're yeah, it's when it's a fresh launch, you'll get it. That makes sense. All right. Glad we talked about this. Hold on. You hear any shots? No. I don't hear anything. Got that it does, fairly quickly. That does make sense, though. Been laying there for, uh, I don't know, maybe five minutes. Alright. Hey, you got any 380 auto? Um, no, I do not. Got another box of 545 for you, though. <laughs> you trying to give me infinite ammo, or what? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How many bullets you got for your AK? I know it's 762. Uh, I've got, I've got a decent amount. I just need another mag. I've got, um, three boxes and three stacks, three full stacks. You got that extra AK suppressor from earlier, right? Yeah, I threw it on the, uh, on the AK. Alright, cool. The KM. I forgot to take the pouches like a dummy, but it's all good. Don't even have a plate carrier. Get a cup holder for your desk. That would be kind of cool. Oh, yeah, okay, dude. Okay. That would be fucking cool. Because then the, the spill the rate is she's zero. Okay. Zero spill rate. I'm going to do that. I'm going to order. What do you get off Amazon? Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, dude. Do you have any stashes? Like, you got a little barrel we could go to so I could dump all this shit off? I think all my barrels are full. I don't. I I never even. Uh, I don't really sash. Like at most, I'll do like a bag sash, but I've never done a barrel sash. Yeah, let's see if we can start with like a bag stash. That'd be kind of cool. Well, hey, there's that purple one back there. I don't know if it's still there. Sorry, dude. It's been real. 
Hey, is that a fl so those flashes? Those are so. Those don't even fucking work, man. I feel like you got. You, the, it has to like land in front of you, and you have to be right. looking at it for it to do anything. Right, dude. I saw this one server. They had this effect that like when you sh you know what I'm talking about when you shoot the gas canister, it like has this crazy effect. I think they just need to fucking yeah. add that to the flashbang and give it some more radius. I don't know. I don't know what's going on with them. They're like useless. They do a little bit of damage though if you're like right on it. It's like a shitty frag grenade. Oh yeah, do you need anything? I have a, an absurd amount of random shit, like bullets. <laughs> no, I have like way too many 308 and way too many 762, so I think I'm good. Alright, I'm trying to keep all my Mosin ammo for the, uh, for the DMR. You got a bunch of like 762? Ooh. Yeah. I've got a good amount, yeah. Okay. And you got that Three DMR stack. mag? No, forced. I do, yeah, I have it in my pouch, in the pouches. Alright, dude, we gotta do a quick beard check. See who's on top. Oh, I'm, I mean, I'm definitely winning, dude. I think it might have something to do with jeans, but you turn a little bit. Yeah. All right, maybe we're tied. We'll, we'll call it a tie because we got a little bit of a different, you know. How's, what, how's my neck beard? Nah, your cheeks are a little patchy, bro. Your neck beard stops at a good spot, though. Like, you get away with going on on the weekends without having to shave that shit. <laughs> yeah, I am a little bit patchy. Yeah, I think it's the jeans, man, you know. Yeah. My character goes, doesn't, dude. doesn't get too much, too much uh, hair. Yeah, I used to have the fullest beard compared to my buddy in high school, and now these days, it's, his beard is full as fuck. I was asking him, I was like, dude, you start, you know, he's rubbing some some of that fucking cream into his beard. There, these guys are cheating these days. I need some of that oh. fucking cream, dude. I can't grow a beard for the, for the fucking if I prayed on it for 24 hours, it just doesn't go. Now, there's nothing wrong with a patchy beard. The best beards are the natural I actually, beards. Actually, I resemble my my character. It's like the patchiness. Yeah. I, no, no, I, I it looks. With him. It it looks good, man. I mean, everybody's got their own unique beard. That's the best part. All right, these guys are shooting right up ahead, dude. Let's scope in these apartments. kind of a uh, scope you got on yours? Is that a hunter scope? Yeah, I got the hunter. I was going to offer the other one to you. That like crazy 35x from earlier, but I dropped it at uh, uh, Neptune. The, I, yeah. yeah the NF. I don't like that one because sometimes it does this weird thing where it's just like, even if you unzoom it, when you zoom in, it's just like super, like it's just all the way zoomed in. Yeah, the one with the like red, all the red plus signs connected to each other. I always miss my shots with that thing. Yeah. Well, shit, we can see the, the zoo military a little bit from here, too, and the apartments. This is dope. Oh, yeah, like right here, dude. Fucking prime view. Wouldn't be bad to get a rangefinder. We could either get the hunting spots in the zoo for the rangefinder, or we could do deer stands outside the city. I just don't really know where they are. Deer maybe, stand, uh, I know where a bunch of them are by, like, uh... That's kind of far though, like the Zetra mm -hmm. area. You know like the shanty? Stands over there, but I think the shanty town here has uh, oh, range yeah, finders. Yeah. We could go there. It does. Yeah, I'm down. I'm just trying to make give us a goal, you know? Like are we in sniper mode or do we want to go and like try to get something specific? Like make a backpack stash or get a range finder? I don't know. Get the DMR parts. Let's, um, let's, let's hunt some, yeah, let's hunt some helis, man, if we really want the DMR body. Yeah, 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 that's the main thing. All right. Well, you probably know where the heli crash is spawned. Check, uh, well, down here they're pretty much all around airbase, and other than that, it's like lower Essaker, like a sunken city. All right. Like, we um, yeah. We set a fresh right, restart, let's see, let's so let's, yeah, let's try to get one of the fresh ones, dude. Let's go. Um, want to backtrack to where we were uh, last time and maybe cross the bridge? I don't. I don't know about swimming right now. We don't have stam. We're just gonna shot in the water. Yeah, yeah, I'll follow you. I'm in no rush to do anything. <clears throat> can you make a shot from here to the zoo? Oh yeah, from here, if you can see it, you can hit it. You just have to have the right range. You know, you either gotta zero your gun or you gotta aim high enough.
So Wilco, I used to have this perfect system back in the day. I know Sudcat and a few of the old school guys are in here right now, but you used to like look, zoom in and measure it. So like if that's the length of his body, you would say, how many times can I fit that sign into the scope space from the center to the, the thick uh, line where it goes from thin to thick? So we used to do, okay, one, two, three or something. It would be like, it was something like that. And we would just, I would just measure it out real quick and we'd hit almost every shot or be close. But then they changed something. And I, and then, you know, I went for more interactions than sniping. And I, I stopped, you know, I wasn't as sharp or as uh, practiced at it. So um, these days, I just try to get a rangefinder or I try to engage within like 300 meters or within 500 meters to be safe. I don't really think you can do that measurement anymore. Okay, I'm sorry guys. We might have... It's all good. Um, I got some awesome moderators, but you can't expect people to be like always sitting there staring at the chat. And honestly, um, that spot again. we have awesome moderators, but I could afford to probably add a couple of more for like the late, late night stuff. Again. I think, you know, I haven't really added moderators since the channel the has grown a little bit more, so... It's smart to do, and I know plenty of good people. I mean, I see plenty of good people in the chat. Let me just patch up my pants real quick. You were able to find some new shoes, right? Yeah, I got some mill boots. You? Need anything? No, no, no. I found some at the uh, crash. No, that's real. Oh, and shit. <laughs> when I start doing it, though, I, um, I just hit the fucking ban button. I don't do, like, the, well, sometimes I don't look into, like, as if it's worth the five, I don't have time to look and be like, well, this ban is worth a five second, or no, it's worth a ten minute, no, it's worth a thirty minute. It's like, nah, I'm streaming, dude. Fucking ban this guy. If he sends me, if some, if he does something to let us know it was unjust, then we'll deal with it then. But if I see, like, a big fucking assy dick in the chat and I'm gonna hit the ban, I'm not gonna feel bad about it. But dude, my early channel days, I went the longest time I feel without having too many mods. It was awesome. I think we got up to like, you know, 100 consistent viewers and we only had like two moderators. And uh, it's because we didn't really have many problems in chat and we really don't have many problems in chat, you know, hardly ever. So, I appreciate you guys. Uh, we'll cross at the um, railroad uh, bridge, or the train track bridge, and then uh, that hospital right on the other side has a bunch of epis usually. Yeah, we could do with some epis. Maybe some pain meds. Yep. You got some buddies you usually play with, or usually go solo? I usually go solo, it's just whoever I really meet here. Gotcha. My buddy's like, you know, here on the server, but usually just, uh, you know, meet him here. Don't really set anything up. I gotcha. Oh, I don't know even how to say it. It's like A-S-C-I or something. It's when they, like, draw a dick out of, like, a bunch of different characters and... <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. You know what? Don't fucking worry about it, alright? We don't, we don't need to fucking tell anybody what it is. I've never made one, I just, I see like moderators talking about it and I'm like, oh, that's what, that's what that is, okay, cool. Oh, ASCII? Well, you just go through the tunnel, dude, on the ASCII? left side here, and then just... Okay, okay, put it I'm learning. The bridge. I mean, dude, I just learned what fucking Kappa meant like two years ago, alright, just give me a break. Or not Kappa, but like, you know, I don't fucking... Know if any, I've never really Pog explored champ. like over there, but I don't really think there's anything. Okay, okay. Yeah, dude, fuck it. Let's just go to the city, man. I mean, it has, it's been a good day. Oh, what is this thing? I was going to say it's been kind of quiet. You see that, like, gl graphical fucking line coming out of the rocks? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go here. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Yeah, like, right here. 
Yeah. A web or some shit. Oh, it's this tunnel. Yeah. I love this tunnel, but it's not gonna look good until they fix that line. <laughs> I see another one up there. Yeah. Yeah, there's a bunch of them. ADS bug on a different level. I feel like I got punched in the face as soon as I zoomed in. Police car. Can you get range funders from like police cars and police buildings? I can't remember. Well, I found them in a police car, yeah. Um, like at Novi, there's been a bunch of uh, police cars with uh, range finders and shit. Right. Holy, what? Oh, what the fuck? I'm what? looking for you. <laughs> Where did he go? <laughs> this ain't a bad spot. You, you could get that side if you want, real quick. Maybe we spot somebody. Give it like 30 I was seconds. Like talking and like turn it around. <laughs> Where did he go? It's a fucking dope spot. You ever do the radio thing? You ever get radios with a team and yeah. shit? We could try for that. Um, yeah, yeah, I've done radios. Uh to look for people usually, but uh, it seems like not that many people use them here. Yeah. No, I remember in the mall, it's like, dude, radios were the thing. Back in Livonia too, did you ever play that? Uh, no. I've played a few times recently, but uh, yeah. yeah, I was usually on just uh, Cherno or uh, Namalsk. Yeah, hopefully Livonia catches more attention soon. I feel like a lot of people would use radios there. And the helicopters are super sweet when you got like a heli pilot with a radio talking to his troops on the ground. They got radios. It's such a unique, oh yeah, daisy fucking opportunity. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah, yeah the, the uh, I played it three times recently, and I really uh, it was a really good change of scenery. Scenery, it just wasn't yeah. populated, so not enough people in there right now. Yeah, yeah. We should all try to fill it up on the weekends or something. Here, let's go. You want to cross a bridge, or you want to? Is there a safer route? I'm never really over here. Uh, this is the safest bridge, to be honest, because the windows of the apartment face don't right. face the bridge. So if you like stick on this right side, it's, it's uh, you know, yeah, yeah. We got a lot of rails of too. For the most part. Okay. And then uh, when worst comes to worst, jump off the side and swim, and they can't get your loot. That'd be badass. Or maybe even survive. Swim to cover, yeah. maybe. I understand, but it's not too bad. Oh shit. <laughs> Almost fell off the side. <laughs> A little bit of FPS drop. Yeah. You can go left and hit this police Sometimes guard. There's a heli right here, too. Yeah. yeah. Do you need water or anything? I know there's a pump to our right. Uh, I'm good right now. I should probably fill up a water bottle or something, so we All don't right. have to stop later. Yeah, let's hit it after the PD car. Reminds you of the Shroud heli thing? Yeah, dude, that was badass. The stars literally aligned when Shroud came to pick me up in the heli. It was so silly, though, because, like, Summit had to go, but he linked me up with Shroud, and then as soon as he linked us up, he jumped out of the heli to his death. But he... I mean, it was cool on him to do that, I guess. Like, he knew that it would be cool to link us all up, so... It just sucks that he had to go so soon. I really both of them had to go sooner than me and Sarah, or Sarah and I. We kept going for a little bit. That night, none of us died. I remember Sarah logged out hospital. before me too. I was the last man standing. None of us fucking died. Except for fucking Summit because he jumped out of the heli. Yeah, yeah, I'll follow you from here on out. It was like so early in the morning that Sarah was just like, yo, I gotta go to bed. <laughs> Yeah, the singer. And then something stupid happened. And I like walked 100 meters and got shot after I was solo. Something like that happened. Hey, don't come up here. What the fuck? You don't come down here. I won't. You won't? Alright. 
Well, you want to do this, buddy? You want to surrender? It's always an option. You I can like live. live. I like my stuff. Okay. I got a cool shamag. You got a cool shamag? Yeah, what color is it? It's red. Yeah. Nice. Oh fuck. oh, fuck. We're all dead. Yeah, yeah red. Yeah, I like it. Come on. Mm. Fuck. I'm just gonna let my buddy do his oh, thing. What are you wearing? <laughs> Peacoat. Cargo pants. Peacoat and cargo pants. What colors? What is he doing? What did you get all quiet for? Somebody call the fucking funeral home, dude. Are your peacoats ruined at all? Are your cargo Yo, pants? this dirty fuck is going down the ladder. You know he is, bro. He's gonna lock doors. He's gonna fucking get eyes on the door. We gotta go. Where's my lock? Ring? I'm gonna hit the fucking Michael Jordan right here. Ah oh, shit, not nah, ah oh, fuck. Alright, yo, that was just dude, that was just a threat. That was just a threat. Just I don't think he left. Where should I put the landmine? Should I put it under the fucking ladder? Is it? Where's the other ladder? Out back, right? The ladder's back here. Back here, yeah. Everybody uses this one. Yo, if you get close, you can hit the MJ, dude. Pocket, son. Nice. All right, let's go. I mean, it was decent. It was decent. All right. Is it ruined now? I got a flashbang. Let's locate him and then flash him. It from the hey, let's you go up and clear right and then open the door safe. Yo, is he up on the fucking tippity top? Okay, he either ran out immediately. I see a body under the fucking apartment that I'm looking at. Is that a dead zombie? Yeah, it is. It is. He might have went over there and killed that zombie towards the apartment. He might be getting up on the apartment to look at us. Um, he either left immediately and we didn't fucking hear the ladder because the ladder's dead silent and that's broken as shit, or he fucking combat logged. Yeah. But yeah, I'm gonna. I think he might have. Yeah, I think he might have left, dude. Because the did you see the the zombie aggro that way? Yeah, I kind of saw that. Over there when we were yeah, pushing. but then he turned on us though. I don't want to say he's a combat logger. I want to say Actually, that he left. No, he, no, uh, uh, mm. yeah, but his voice was still here when we came around the back. We came around the back and I still heard his voice. We didn't. We didn't Actually, hear him run. He's, he's in the second floor. Second floor. Did you clear the second floor? Uh, I thought I tried to flick open that other door. What are you talking about? Yeah, yeah. There's, we cleared everything. Okay, okay. Yeah, we we cleared it. Yeah. All right. Remember, just don't hit that fucking mine. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I see something. I see something under the bridge. Under the bridge. 
Oh my god, this poor fucking bastard. He, wait a minute. This is one of those speedrunners, dude. He's got an axe with a fuck. He's creeping up on somebody with an axe. He's probably got a busted leg. Should we go talk to him and ask him what his story is, or should I put one in his fucking dome? Put the fucking talk to him. What does he have to say? Yeah, let's go see what his fucking story is, dude. He's under the bridge. I want to know how the hell he's like that. <laughs> this guy better be on a fucking Metal Gear Solid mission right now to sneak up on a fucking geared guy and kill him. But it's probably just the fact that he has a broken leg because he was speedrunning and he fucking launched himself off the bridge or something. Trying to get back to his body. Which, again, I don't have no disrespect. Like, if my, honestly, if I'm in Disco with somebody, I'm, I'm going to turn into a speedrunner too. I really am. Or if I have, like, a really good stash, I'm going to speedrun. But I love when, like, speedrunners get fucked over. You know, that's just how it is. What does it mean by speedrun? It means like you grab a can of beans and you know exactly like the best route to travel to get back exactly where you want to be in like the tier 5 zone instead of taking it slow in like the first two tiers, you know? Oh, I thought he'd be over here by now. He's probably trying to get a branch. He's probably making a splint. Yo, don't pull out any fucking guns, dude. What the hell's your deal? I broke my leg. I just spawned in. Oh my god, I thought you were on I some fucking James Bond secret mission. But you got a busted <laughs> fucking leg. <laughs> nah, <light>. bro. What? <laughs> Damn, you guys are fully geared shit. Well, yeah, you're in, the shit you're in the fully geared zone looking like a fucking straight out of Borosh. Oh shit. <laughs> I was just fucking walking down the road from, I think, Kula or something. Dude, you, you just and crawled. I just ended up here. You crawled past like 18 I off bushes. The, Kula? Yeah, I just I jumped off the bridge. I mean, I kind of slid on my feet. So, um, yeah, from this one, from the other side though. You know how to fix that shit, right? Wait, what the fuck? Yeah, I don't have rags. <laughs> I only have two rags. Wait, what the fuck? All right, so dude, I'm yo. Gonna Let me. No, 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 dude. Hold on, hold on. This ain't adding up, dude. Let me talk to my associate. Oh, in the hey, yo, hey, come here. Okay, okay. Yeah. You're telling me this there, motherfucker there doesn't know how to grab a a fucking stick from a bush. On the way over to this point right here. I think he's trying mm -hmm. to play the victim. I think he's trying to play the fucking victim right now. Why don't you go run his pockets? Alright dude, why don't you... Stop, stop crawling man, stop crawling. Why don't you get... Uh, just, why don't you just drop your shit real quick. Let me see what you got. Alright. Uh... It's like, uh, hold control and you can click everything. There you go. You That's got, all I have? Okay, you got a stick? No, like, like, yeah. get, like, strip. <laughs> I'm always looking up at him. Trying to see I, his skin. I, I, like, dude! No, man! Yeah, yeah. I'll strip yeah. make it for you. He's like looking up like he's Ooh, some he fucking... Cool mag, it's nice. Like he's getting his ass whooped. Alright, yeah, well... Yeah, right, well. Got one stick. Right. You're gonna need some more sticks. Look, uh, dude, this ain't adding up. Why you down... I need more rags, why, to be honest. Yo, why you down here without a firearm, son? You meeting up with somebody? Ah, uh, no, bro. I'm just... I'm just wandering. All right, all right. I mean, ain't got nothing fuck? on me, bro. Alright, let's take Trust me. Dude, you know your way around, or do you even know where the fuck you are, or what? What's going on here? Uh, to be honest, I, I don't. Alright, alright. Get your. <laughs> I don't know right now. Put your trousers on. Do you know how to make a splint? Uh, I think so. She only right. had two rags. Let's, you're gonna learn today, man. Just fucking get over these bushes. You gonna learn today? Uh, oh, shit, you guys are veterans, huh? Say what? I said, I said, how how long you guys been playing? Like, fucking, we've been together for days, dude. Don't here? don't don't worry about it, dude. Get in the bush and uh, start chopping those sticks up. Okay. I see you got one stick, but that ain't enough. You got what do you got? Like two two sticks? Yeah, he needs two sticks. Just, uh, how many need sticks? Two, you what's said so I need? what's so funny, dude? I said you need two sticks. Oh, hold on. You keep an eye on him. I'm look for his buddies. This is fucking sketch. I don't even have buddies here. But if we see somebody, if I was, dude, if I if I call the word, you fucking execute him. Oh oh oh! I see something. Oh, it's a zombie! It's a zombie! It's like a lucky day. Yeah. I was about to end your life. <laughs> All right, so you got rags? Yeah. How many rags? You I only got? got two. All right. I only got two. Yeah. Oh. 
Oh, look, there, don't you need like look. three? Oh. Look, something Ooh, just thank appeared you. there. I don't... No. All right, now. Make sure so you combine those. Combine your sticks and the rag. Make sure you don't make like a torch or some shit. Gonna have the right recipe, man. All right. Yo, touch. Remember that beard check we did All earlier? Right. Yeah. Splint. Yeah. This motherfucker's okay, freshly right shaven. Mm. Must be those jeans. Mm. <laughs> maybe, maybe you just can't grow a beard. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pass it as that. I got the best jeans in the house. It's alright, man. I understand. I know how you feel. Don't, don't feel bad about it. It's, it's, right. gen there's nothing you can do about right, it. There we go. Genetics. All genetics. Oh, I can right, finally walk now. Thank God. You want to lead us to where your friends are so we can fucking rob them? Uh. Shit, I mean, I, to I told have you, you seen, guys uh, I don't even have friends. Have you seen anybody around here? Heard any shots or anything? I mean, I heard grenades from earlier. I wasn't sure if that was you guys. <coughs> yeah, that was this idiot. I don't know. Well, we threw a couple of grenades. Let's be honest with him. There was some dude in the hospital. We tried to kill him, and then we saw you out the window. Some guy just got away from us. Oh. Uh, yeah, oh, this guy okay. did something called like a Michael Jordan or some shit, but it didn't look like a Michael Jordan. I failed to. Like oh shit! I failed the slam dunk. Hey, let's get out of here. Come on, let's take this dude back to the uh, maybe a different hospital. Okay. There's two hospitals, right? Okay. I don't know. One in the zoo. I think. Oh yeah. Well, dude, gotta get a range finder. Y'all have like food. Uh, I'm like I'm on red. What? Red on food. Oh shit, dude. I need like food. I got like red. Yo, I I just lost my can That's of tactical bacon. Do you have any food? I got nothing. Dude, I where's my can of tack bacon? It, I seriously think it like vanished. Maybe I slammed it. What the? Wait a There's minute. There's a little restaurant right here. Dude, you're fucking red food and we have no food. Are you kidding me? What are you I doing do. coming all the way over here without food or without guns? You kind of, I don't know. Yeah, what are you trying to do? Food. He's in a fucking hurry, he isn't food, he? But... Get a stash. <laughs> I hate to fucking roast somebody for con like. I just wonder sometimes if shame, if somebody's in it overly, you, run, you know, rain, run. they're in a fucking hurry to do something. Wait, what now? Run, rain, run. That's my uh, Twitch account. Oh, I'm for not fuck's streaming, sake. but. What the hell are you talking about, man? <laughs> when apocalypse, you're talking about like, streams and shit. Uh, Alright, this guy's dying of food. This is actually good. This is a good thing. Um, yo, there's some cars on the bridge, man. Maybe we should check the cars on the bridge. That's probably our closest. Fucking... Dude, are you are you blinking? No, I just saw... Alright, you just red. tell me when you start blinking, bro. Blink, I'm gonna fucking old yeller this guy. We started passing Fucking up on our food earlier because we had so much. Yeah, and then now we don't got shit. There's some in the bus, dude. There's a there's a 60% rice in the bus. I can feel it. He's like, well, before I die, I'm gonna drop my Twitch. <laughs> He's like, well, let's make the most of this fucking little segment here, fuck it. He's like, I'm not on now, but I will be on tomorrow at noon. Um, I'm just getting gear for the stream. Nah, he's, he sounds like a nice kid. I'm not fucking flaming anybody that does that shit, but... No food, dude, no food. We gotta back it up. Damn. Alright, rain I'm down, still not sir. blinking. Uh, oh, oh, shit. Cause, well, I never know. If somebody is like purposely like flaunting their stream around, I'll fucking make fun of them all day. But if they're just if they're just a really nice dude and they don't really look at the whole what's kind of like bad Twitch etiquette and what's good etiquette, you can't blame them at first until somebody kind of tells them, or until they are around enough. Maybe they watch a certain stream and they're like, "Oh, okay." <gasps> do we want to do it? Did, did, did we find this or did we not find this? Somebody make the call quick. 
Yo, did I find oh, this food or go. did I not find it? Did, did I find it or did I not find it? Found it. Okay, okay, let's just fucking save him. Let's save him. Yo, dude, get in this bush, get in this bush. Oh, you Are you blinking? Him? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna feed you, bro. Actually, you, help yourself, help yourself. Alright, thank you, thank you, thank you. We're gonna hook him up, guys. Come on. Have a fucking heart, alright? He sounds like a nice kid. I wanted to old yell his ass so bad, though. Some? Nah, just uh, don't eat it all too soon, man. Just make sure you're not dying. Alright, I got like a little bit left to the right. Oh, you slam it, slam it. Did I eat my tacto bacon? I guess so. Alright, now, dude. Next, you gotta protect your dome. Going up. Slow down. Oh. Don't get desperate until you Thank protect you. your dome. Yeah. So, did you just get kind of like lost and just so wandered, like, wandered down here? Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. understandable. I mean, I heard like a couple of shots, like sniper shots, when I was on my way from here from Kula. Like, Some water over here. I was like in a mountain. Oh, you spawned in Kula. Yeah, yeah, that's where I spawned in. Yeah, yeah, that's like the best spawn to get over to the city. See, it's all coming out, alright? You said there was water? Yeah, yeah, maybe you should hit that water. It's right in the center here by the zombies. <clears throat> oh shit. Oh shit. Well, we're just gonna let Show fate fucking play out. Yo, block it up, dude. Block it up, block it up. Oh shit, dude. Oh, oh, oh. Oh god, you're so you're too hurt. So you you're too hurt. You. You're too hurt. I'm sorry, so you man. Gotta, you know yeah, how to I'm block, blinking, right, man? I'm blinking, uh, blinking red. Oh no. I think man. so. Yo, get in the tube, bro. Yeah, get in the fucking tube or something, man. Just to get some hard cover. You look like shit. Oh, Jesus, look at you. I think I might die, to Fuck, be honest. Fuck, bro, I should've killed that zombie. My bad, dude. Yo, get in the- get- just- here, let's get you in the building. I'll lock the doors. <laughs> the limp is so fucking good. Alright. Nah, hey, you remember this, dude. Oh, shit, I'm, I'm in the future, bro. If, if you die, I want you to learn this one lesson. In the future, if you break your leg like that again, okay, okay. hold down control, stand up. Hold on, control, stand up, and you can walk like that. Super slow. Oh, for real? Yeah, yeah, and you won't break your leg. Now, keep going. I, I'm not oh, gonna lie. Shit, I kinda man. wanna- I kinda wanna see that little strut you got going here. Keep going. I bet. Hold on, control. You got a little- You got a yeah. little swag in your walk, boy. <laughs> it's kinda, Damn. You're kinda swagged out, dude. So just like walk around, regen your oh, HP. Shit, I bet. But next time you bust a yeah, leg- don't play that shit. You yeah, just get up. No you shit. just get up and walk it out, dude. You fucking- you don't have to lay- I mean, you're probably safer in the dirt, land prone, oh, yeah. but, but that's your alternative, you know what I'm saying? If you got a gun, you're just ready to fucking oh, bang out. Yeah. Anyways, you alright? Oh, you you regen? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. I <laughs> <laughs> he learned today, dude. He learned something today. <laughs> I think it's for the best, dude. The two of us, we can fucking roll. This guy's like, I'm fucking blinking. Oh, I'm blinking. But... I'm fucking limping. Mm. Dude. <laughs> We got yeah. We gotta get to a safe spot and fucking chill out for a second. I gotta sort out some of this loot. Oh, dude, let's make a backpack stash out of him, and and we'll leave it nearby right. the site. Maybe you know, maybe he'll see it. I don't know. Let's stash all this extra bullshit we got. Yeah, yeah. Let's slam that. I'll go halves with you. Pour one out for the boys. What was his name? Uh. Fucking rain dancer, uh, run. I don't know, rain. Let's call him <laughs> Shut rain. the fuck up, dude. <laughs> you don't know this fuck. I don't know. No, I swear to God, he said he was like, My name's Dancing Rain or some shit. And uh. that's my. Yeah. <laughs> He's making it sound bad. Alright, so I got his back. Oh, oh, oh. Drop that back. Drop that back. I gotta put some shit in it. Yeah. You put all your excess bullshit in there. <laughs> He's like, it's a uh, fucking, uh, I think his name was, uh, you don't fucking remember his name. He's like, ah, uh, well, I think, uh, oh, genius. What? I had food the whole time. <laughs> What? You had food the whole no, time? Was, dude, you could have saved minimized. fucking Rain Dancer, dude. What? <laughs> Your pants were minimized? Yeah. I knew we one of us should have had some fucking food, dude. We've been out here looting for but. ages. Look at his face, dude. You fucking killed him. You're responsible for this shit. Look. 
fucking oh, don't kiss him on the lips with the rain. Fucking hey. All right. Did yeah. you put all your shit in there? Right. Uh, pretty much. Hold on. I got some other shit. Uh, I could put the. Uh, I'll keep that. <clears throat> yeah. Looks. Uh. Looks like that's it. I can't believe you fucking killed this poor guy. I was just starting to like him too. Or I was just warming Man, up to don't, him. Don't put that. That on me. Yeah. I mean, shit. He dances with the rain and shit. Are you over here minimizing your fucking jacket or whatever? I don't know what the hell happened? I remember when we were talking about oh, that guy. fucking running I, down the bridge for food. And dude, I, like I, I look. Fucking thing. I asked that guy something, and he says something, and I look, and I look over at you, and you're like, "What the fuck?" And I just start dying. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like, what the fuck is that guy doing, crawling across? He passes like five bushes. He's got one stick in his inventory. <laughs> C clearly, he knows about sticks, but he chooses to pass the next four bushes that would provide. I mean, I don't know what the fuck he even have back there. I'm just gonna assume he's like a uh, lost yeah. okay. mega noob. Yeah. I, I just don't see how he got that far being lost though. Like I ah yeah, he either got lost or he was in a hurry to do something. He's not letting on, but it's all good. All right, yo, I'm gonna put this outside. Let's find a sweet spot for this. Oh, actually, this is a really like dense area. We could just put it in between some. Uh, let's go bigger. Mm. Oh yeah. Nah, no, something like this. I'm probably looking for grass. Yeah. Nobody's going oh, up there tonight. Dude. Yeah, nobody's gonna go up there tonight. <laughs> I bet that's a loot spawn though in those crates. Looking right there. What? Yeah, there's loot up here too. It's a mask. I'm just gonna drop it here. This will be like our nighttime stash, or just for tonight. All right, cool. Let's pick up where we left off. What were we about to do? This up real quick. See, yeah, yeah, go for it. Uh, fucking shantytown range finder. Yeah, sure. Or heli, fresh heli crash. I'll chug out of that too what if you don't mind. Fucking dude, there's a whole honey thing right there. We'll draw our honey. There's right a second one here. right here. We each get one. What the fuck? I loved you, dude. I wonder if this bad guy dropped those two things of honey. I knew that shit was too good to be true, <laughs> but I didn't really think. I I don't know. I thought it was legit, but at the same time, I was like, wait, okay. <laughs> I feel like it's up there. Do I have a frag grenade left or do I just have a flash? We got a flash. Damn, the guy saw me. He didn't go for the second double shot though. Or did he use the double shot on my teammate? Sound like one bullet. Fuck, this is where he went. Gotta be upstairs, maybe.
Yeah, it's upstairs. I'm gonna blow him up. I'm gonna throw it. I'm gonna throw it. Fuck you. <laughs> if you can hear me, you killed my best friend, you piece of shit. Get fucking tricked out. Nah, he was my best friend for the night. <laughs> he became our good friend. The sad thing is, well, I don't know if it's sad, but some people, like, they can hear you in their death cam. I don't know if it's intended or not, but... I never want to talk shit, but sometimes I just want to be like, Hey, I fucking got you. I know what you did. It was him. It was fucking him. <clears throat> oh, look at this guy! He definitely dropped the food at the fucking pump, dude. This guy was like, you know what? I've been looting all fucking week. I'm just going to set up some bait. Look at this guy. Jesus. No, I was saying it earlier that food is so common. He's probably been playing for like three hours. That's just how this map is right now. Ugh. It could probably be lowered by like 50% and like people would still be okay, honestly. Yeah, our teammate's dead and this guy's dead too. Honestly, that almost didn't work. Dude, how badass would it have been? What I should have done, right, is you pull the pin on the flashbang, and I just hold down G, okay, and you drop it right there at the bottom of the stairs, okay? And he would have almost ran right into it. I didn't have to put the pin back in and pull out my gun. That's what almost got us killed, is the whole, like, putting the gun back in my hands and repinning the grenade. I could have just dropped that thing at the fucking stairs, like... But I guess I was thinking about maybe reusing it, so... That would have been cool, though. Is that a fronta? Phelps says I loved my red shemag. Phelps, was that you, man? You know, if, I don't think that was you, was it? <laughs> oh, what kind of blood did he have? Ooh, O positive. Wait a minute, isn't O positive blood the universal blood? Or am I wrong? Is it O negative or O positive? What is it? Oh, Ecla, thanks for watching the VODs, man. Oh, O negative is a universal, so I'd have, I can't use it. Okay, but I can test my blood. He's got a blood test kit. <laughs> Pop it. <laughs> oh, dude, this is the patch where it works. Oh, I shouldn't even say that, but guess what? This patch, it doesn't even fucking matter. The next patch, they're fixing it, so it does matter. I'm not going to abuse it, though. Oh, wait a minute, I'm O positive. Dude, yoink. I'm fucking O positive. This is my blood, son. Here we go. Look, right there. O positive. Honestly, that might be a first for me. Like, I don't fuck with the blood stuff. This might be a first. Oh, that was you, Phelps? Oh my god, I thought it was somebody else that has, like... Oh, I thought you were somebody else, dude, because somebody said you were streaming. Um, that was a really fun run, man. <laughs> Thank you so much for the good time, if that was you. I really appreciate the way that you handled the robbery, too. <laughs> you didn't, like, you know, some people get really fucking defensive when they're getting robbed. Yeah, no shame in dying like that, dude. If you get killed at a water pump, shit happens, you know? It just happens. Oh, yeah. It's, okay, here we go. Mm -mm. What was I saying? Oh yeah, yeah, the good band-aids. That's what we need the most is good band-aids. I'm full, man. I'm not even worried about this stuff. Essaker is just loot heaven. Let's just move on. Yet. 
probably somebody right here ready to shoot me too. Hmm. Alright, the mission continues. Let's find the body piece for the DMR. Here are the pickaxe load up on food. Mm, I agree but disagree. Pickaxe weighs one kilo. All that food is pretty heavy. And uh, the way the Essaker is, if you're like, you know, if you're a competent player and you get your stomach full on food and water, you're not going to hit yellow before you find more food. It's just how it is, right? So, I could get rid of the pickaxe though. I got a suppressed pistol. There's just so much food in this map if you're looking in the right places. It's kind of like water, okay, so when you're fully geared and you have no stamina, you don't want to be carrying around water weight in like a cooking pot and a canteen and a water bottle. Because it actually weighs quite a bit. And once you're full on water, you don't really need to be holding on to a shit ton on this map because it's all over the place. that armor. <clears throat> oh. Kill this one? Can't remember. Is your buddy? Yeah, I'm thinking about it. I'm just gonna drag his stuff to a little sweet spot just in case I want to come back for it. Let's do it right here. I just have so much stuff, man. There's no point. As SVD, I oh, just have an SVD. He has an AKM, which I have so much ammo for my AK-74 that there's just no point. I'll put it over here though. Should have a little funeral. <laughs> it's a shame, man. Touch was a good dude. I'm not sure if we've crossed paths in the past. Kinda had a familiar voice, maybe. I feel like the guy in the Tarkov video. I remember our last battle together. God, the Tarkov movie was so good. Or I thought it was very good until, uh... The American guy's voice came in. It was clearly fucking super dubbed. The American guy speaking in that movie. Oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay. 
The other guy's unconscious. See the double stun? <laughs> Imagine we get a DMR. This guy's gonna wake up and look like fucking rain dance. Oh, come on. You know you're gonna let me vault over that shit. Okay, how do we jump over? Let's just fucking jump right here. Oh <gasps> no, he shot me in the leg. I thought I killed him. Dude, that's so lame. I couldn't jump over. Oh my god, I shouldn't have jumped over like that. Dude, so on fucking... I can jump on like every bus except for that bus. Hopefully he went unconscious too, dude. Hopefully my last bullet got him, but I'm about to get executed. Dude. Okay, okay, we're gonna get up, we're gonna get up. Fuck, he shot me like one time in the kneecap after I lit his ass up with how many fucking shots? Dude, okay, what gun am I pulling out? What gun am I pulling out? I'm gonna press 4, and we're gonna fucking get up. He probably thinks that... I heard him banjo and I think he passed out. Nah, bro. I heard a fucking bandage go off for sure. He might have passed out and died, though. I think he bandaged and he's just laying there. It's like the worst thing that could happen. He's just waiting. <sighs> okay, we gotta go before somebody shows up. Yo, where was that dead guy with the splint? I could go back and yoink that splint off his body, couldn't I? No, 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 fuck that. I can't remember if you can yoink splints off of dead people's legs. Oof, what stings the most about that is that we put two 308 shots in that guy's spine.
Oh, yeah, yeah, I can use my blood bag, too. Good call. Let me just fix my leg first. I bet that guy's dead. Heard a sniper. Sniper coming from this way. What the fuck? That was bigger than a silenced pistol. Oh my god, I kinda just wanna chill for a sec. <sighs> we were just that way. Then we're just to our left, and then we got this possible guy that I was fighting. I'm just gonna do it. I'm gonna risk it. I need to get away from these crazy suppress shots over there. Okay, okay, okay. Let's get all of our EpiPens up here, so we got them ready to go. Oh, I don't think that was a suppressed pistol. At first, I, maybe it was a suppressed scout or something? It was like an assault rifle that was suppressed? I don't know. I'm almost positive this other guy's dead, though. We're white HP, we're white blood. I just gotta wait for this leg to f uh, fix up, but or heal up. Hmm. Try to get some high ground.
Dude, we had to throw the nade at the first guy because he went on con. It's this game we play where we got to go fucking get on his body and execute him before he wakes up with a plate carrier still. I think that was good, though. I think that got him. I got a pack of mag, dude. Should I give you guys some gamma? Is this dark as fuck? <laughs> oh. oh my god, look at this cheeky little spot. What if this guy's still alive? I've seen armor absorb a grenade. confirm this kill. Let's get a check. I know he's dead, I think, but I want to make sure. What if he has, like, a DMR or something? Oh, this was the guy that I heard shooting. He's got a Pioneer. Doesn't have, a, like, a real suppressor for it, though. This guy's got the good shit. Play care, play care, okay, okay, okay. up this armor immediately. that keep coming. <clears throat> oh my god, I see a light on over there. Let's just bounce for a second. These bodies aren't going anywhere right now. Oh, look at this cozy spot. Have you ever seen a more cozy spot than this? Jesus. Alright, let's get rid of that. We gotta wait for our leg to fix up here. I don't know, should we drop the blaze and take a, uh, a scout with an improvised suppressor? I think the blaze is still good, man. If you can get those two quick shots, that's the only reason we killed that geared guy right there. Was the two quick ones. If it had a real suppressor, I'd say take it. If it doesn't, eh, let's keep with what we got, maybe. Just want to get all this stuff kind of organized. Don't have any more 380 auto. I might want to get a better zombie killer. Maybe that guy's- or maybe just do the AK. Shoot all the zombies with my suppressed AK. Oh, nice catch. Let's repair the suppressor and the gun. Before this goes ruined. AK's so sick. Oh yeah, repair the plate too. Dude, I've seen badly damaged plates save people from like, ridiculous amounts of bullets. We'll be okay. Let me repair it right now though. 
AK so sick. Fonz, thank you so much for the six, dude. And uh, Dalton as well. Thanks for the five months, man. Alright, alright, alright. Here we go, here we go. Bag true. Did they have bags that weren't ruined? Maybe I could just go down there and throw it on my back. Um, okay, let's get a few things that I don't want to ditch out of the bag. Mm. Might be hearing somebody creeping around. I can't tell. But I'm probably cool with losing all this stuff if we absolutely had to. Except for my pistol. Maybe one more little item, like a bunch of snipe rounds. All this time we're wasting is good because we're just going to get our leg fixed up soon, hopefully. I drop it back here because uh, we go down there and all their bags are ruined then we can't come back here with loot but you're right we could do one run down there like that also I might want to disengage at any time and just say like oh fuck all this loot we got what we need Oh, that was the other guy that we shot earlier. I forgot that we shot like three dudes in the back over there, or two dudes. One guy pushed us, and then that guy in the field. Can you guys see anything? Alright, look, I'm gonna give you guys some gamma because I know a lot of you guys can see, but I feel bad for the people that are watching on, you know, other stuff. And as always, this is just for the viewers, I can't see the enhancements. So much loot. <laughs> What's up, MK? That AK, it's just so sick, man. It's just so sick. I could try to act like Ivan all day. I'll fucking laugh at myself because I love Ivan so much and I miss him. There you go, the other way.
Alright, fuck it. Maybe we just get this done. Mm. Okay. What are we doing with there? Ooh, my leg's fixed. Okay, cool. Let's get this guy's jeans. He's got a sweet bag, too. Ooh, beans. Beans and jeans. Uh, I'm, I'm thinking, fuck all the other guns. We're just gonna shoot everything with our AK. He's got that rangefinder that me and my buddy Touch set out for. Touch, I'm gonna finish the job, bro. Oh, his fucking mag is bugged. God damn it. Alright, we're not taking that then. See this? This guy was tainted by the Daisy demons. It's just so sick. I gotta keep my gun. I got way too many mags and bullets for it. I'm thinking about the belt, but I'm also getting into the low stamina mindset here. And that means we gotta drop almost everything except for the AK. I'm probably not coming back for this stuff tonight. Well, the belt would hold a water bottle and a knife. And if the knife is your melee, then it's good. But trust me, guys, when you're doing the knife out of sheath thing, it sometimes fucks you over. Because it, like, you're changing your hand slot with another item and it replaces the slot with another item. It's just, these days I really try to avoid it. Um, once you get super geared up, you don't want to be carrying around water weight, because water's too easy to get. I'm just like, that's what I'm trying to do. So sick. Yeah, the problem's not gone, though. I mean, occasionally, like, let's say you go from knife to MP5 to AK back to knife. Like, eventually the knife goes into a slot where, like, the MP5 was, and it doesn't go back to the sheath, okay? The sheath doesn't keep itself as a designated spot. It allows the inventory to overtake it and, like, throw the knife into some random fucking slot. And if that happens in combat, you're dead. So, until they fix that, fuck the sheath. Until the sheath says, hey, I own that knife every time, it's not worth it. Pouches, the pouches, the pouches. Another DMR mag, nice. It's the worst, it's the worst, yeah. If you're constantly just putting your knife away before you press another hotkey, it'll never happen, but in combat you can't think about that shit. I'm good, man. We're at the point where we're just good. We don't need all this loot.
So we could take an AK-101. But I still have so many mags. I hearing somebody? Sounds so calm after the kills. Why? How? Uh, I think one day you have to realize in Daisy that the only way you're going to get to the end of a situation like that is to stay cool. And it doesn't always work out. But sometimes I think I, I think I accepted death way before that happened. And once you're, once you're like, okay, this is all just a bonus, I think it's easier to stay chill. Like, we had a good run with that guy. I thought I was fucking dead, but I survived miraculously. Everything else is a pure bonus. It's a lot easier to stay chill once you feel like you've had a good day. I don't fucking know, dude. <laughs> Play a lot of Daisy, I guess. You get desensitized to a few of the players, or a few of the encounters, I guess. Dude, did I see a zombie? I don't always stay chill, man. It might sound like it, but sometimes my heart's fucking racing and you just don't know it. I'm not always chill. Okay, how about those other guys? Dude, when that guy peeked over and ran past the truck, I thought for sure he was going to get me. But it felt so good to headshot him. He just showed his little head over the truck. Alright, so what about this first guy that we never really confirmed? Like, I almost wondered, he just like, lo not log, but he just like, hide in this corner and then wait it out? No way. Dude, weird. We heard him- okay, so, if we watch that clip back later, we heard him bandage, like, right around here. We heard one bandage go off. And I watched it for a while, we listened for a while, nothing happened. So did he just like, lay prone and wait this shit out? He didn't finish me. I'd be hearing the flies. Hmm. That guy might have got away. Oh shit, and then the body that we killed at the the uh, hole in the walls despawned, huh? And I bet this one just despawned too. Oh, there it is. Oh shit, there's a fresh dead zombie in this fucking apartment. Zombie up there. This place is so sketchy. <laughs> hmm. 
Might be watching his buddy's corpse here too. I didn't pick up the rangefinder again. Where'd my rangefinder go? Let's take this one. Is your backpack? Oh, right there. Fuck. Not sure why I'm so fixated on checking loot. I guess because I really want that body piece for the DMR. Or just really didn't know what they got. Yo, you in there, dude? You want to work this out, since we're the last men standing? Two of us. I got all the leftover gear. I don't want the knife in the AK, it increases the barrel length. Nice. might not seem like a big deal on this server, but I think it does matter. You anybody around? Can you hear me, dude? Hmm. Okay. Oh, another mag for AK. Shit is stressful, man. I hated seeing my buddy die like that. We should have died in a fucking epic shootout. He didn't deserve that shit. in the backpack for a slot. So these are for the new 338 M24 sniper. Alright, I guess it's time to go. What's my stamina looking like? I don't know. This guy might have been lit up. Might have been the last man standing. Went to this apartment just bounced or maybe he's still in here lurking around for me. Might be up in one of these windows and he couldn't even hear me unless I shout. I'm not sure how that works. Like if you're on the roof can you hear somebody talking normal? I think I just want to get out of here. Get out of the predictable spot. We got good gear. Since we got so much ammo from our buddy might as well just use the AK. Don't have to stress over the MP5 or anything. Ooh, that'd be kind of neat. Flashlight on our AK. He's got to be on somewhere. Yeah, I don't know. I hate to call combat logger, so I'm not going to do it. That guy could be anywhere. We have no proof. But if you know that you killed like all of his teammates, you know that he's super lit up. And it seems like he kind of vanished when he could have actually like executed you. It's almost like I bet he just fucking he's in survival mode right now. Whether he logged or he's just somewhere else. I don't think he's trying to fight, so But you know, if if you want to log out, that's fine. If you completely disengage and there's enough downtime and distance between you and your last fight, that's fair game. I just don't recommend it if you're still in the heat of things.
you know, too, though, like, some people would be like, well, fuck it, my teammate's dead, but I got two guns. I'm gonna make sure I can get back to them with one of these guns. Or with the extra gun. Damn, I should pop an epi. This is all just dead space. Ugh. I got no stamina. What a good time it's been though, man. What a fucking run with that guy. It was so much fun to, like, immediately reve or, uh, get revenge for him. And then have, like, four... Like, a whole squad of, like, three or four dudes to fight. And it was just so perfect how it all worked out. Like, usually it doesn't all work out that way. I should have fucking died for sure. I, I think I should have killed him first. But when he knocked me out, he could have finished me and he didn't. So, shouldn't have even been possible. What a good run, though. I don't even think we're going to play Targup tonight because this run's been so good. We're probably just going to play in the, until this character dies, or uh, do another little half run after this. It's runs like this where I'm just reminded, like... Yeah. <laughs> That's why we fucking play this game. Bust open some of these rounds. Why does this map have good third person servers? Because third person isn't good. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding, dude. If you're a Daisy fan, I fucking love you. But, um, play some first person, bro. I don't know shit about third person these days. I personally do not think third person Daisy leads to good gameplay, so. Come on over, join the dark side, brother. Or join the, uh... We're like the fucking Jedis, trust me. for the AK optics wise. We got this. I want to make sure we got space for that up top so we can quickly just drag it over. <sighs> Let's rework our inventory a little bit for that. So we can just do a little douche. No, I'm kidding, man. Anybody that starts out, I always feel bad because there's always, like, somebody watching that's on console right now playing third person every day, just trying to learn Daisy. And we might make our little jokes about third person and stuff. Like, again, at the end of the day, if you're a Daisy fan, you're good in my book. I just have heavily one sided opinions on how third person ruins encounters and uh, ruins gunfights. But if you don't care, if you just enjoy the game and you don't really care about that, then okay, whatever. But once you start to get really deep into it, you you're going to start to care. Um,. It creates really fucking awkward encounters and awkward gunfights, weird combat, weird information gathering, you know, just weird metas. Weird ways to, you know, do do something the best way with your floating camera. But if you're just, like, fucking walking around and enjoying the shit, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Better for immersion, too, yeah. Like, if I'm gonna watch somebody play DayZ, it's like you're actually, like, in it in first. But if I'm watching third, I'm kind of, like, out of it. I'm kind of, like, reminded that I'm watching a video game. Whereas in Daisy, I'm almost like, holy shit, I'm fucking into this, dude. 
Like, this is real, bro. Let's go to the zoo. I need to check on my stashes because this one has all the DMR parts. Um, it's not in the zoo, but it's kind of in like a really sneaky spot outside of it. Let's just go and like clear out the zoo first, make sure nobody's here. I'm gonna kill the Gamma too, guys, because it's getting brighter out. And then if there's nobody around the zoo, I'll try to check on my stash, make sure that we're still working towards this DMR. kind of see the zoo and the military part of it. Are you winning? Dude, we need a new backpack. We gotta get this character looking better before I can say I'm winning. I still got a pea coat on and a fucking purple bit mountain backpack. Oh, the DMR race. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I actually have four stashes. Um, I could check one, like, really, really quick without putting the away screen up for too long. And the other one's got, like, a blaze and a fully decked out MP5. It's pretty much everything we need if we die. Someone dropped their military stuff for hunting stuff. Probably not too long ago. Yeah, why not? I'll take it. Take your leftovers. As long as they're not all bugged out. <gasps> they're bugged out! Oh no, it works now, it works now. It was acting like it was bugged for a second. How many people are on the servers? Oh, well this one caps out at 50. It's really up to the owners though. Um, speaking of that, holy shit, it's 6am. Let me see if this server's still full, just so I know. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay, so yeah. Yeah, yeah, this one's basically full. Maybe I should have two. One for the gun, one for the suppressor. I think you saw something moving inside the terminal.
There we go. There's the backpack that we needed. Ooh, a bunch of shit in here. Somebody's been through. Well, this one looks a little bit better. really want to feel the rush of being hunted in this game. Ooh. Shouldn't be too hard to get, man. I get hunted daily. You get hunted a lot more when you're, like, kind of new to it, too. Obviously. When everybody knows the map and knows the game better than you. Can be a lot of fun. See if we can hear somebody walking up on us while we do a little bit of inventory management. Mm -mm -mm. Get all that stuff in there. Alright, now we're looking good. Now we're pretty much cured out. Food and water are still full. I should probably drink soon. I doubt we're going to be full on water for much longer. Mm -hmm. Kind of feeling like maybe scoping out the city and then we could go back up to that new mill base up in the woods. Or go back down to the airfield. Alright, Guac, thanks for hanging out so long, dude. Have a good night, man. for a second. Yeah, Hatcher, I think it might be the ambience, but I can't really tell. Um, yo, Knight, thank you so much for the seven months up, dude. Steo, thanks for the four months of Prime. We had Gavin, uh, Cosmo, thanks for coming in. Nimoy, thanks for the six months up, dude. Let's take like a one minute break here, guys. Um, dude, E-Club, I can't remember if I missed you during all the action, but thanks for sending out the 10 gifted subs. That's insane support for the stream, bro. Uh, we had Des Viper, Patties, uh, Scent of a Man, thanks for the big resubs. KTM, thanks for the resub. Um, always a good time watching the stream, keep the great content. Thanks for saying that, dude. We had De La Croix, uh, Backup Magazine, thanks for all the support. And, um, dude, Felp, I'm pretty sure that Felp here, for those of you that were watching the, the team up today, I'm pretty sure that Felp was our buddy that we play with named Touch for pretty much the whole day. So dude, you didn't have to do that, man. Thank you so much for all the support. That was such a good run, man. It was honestly kind of epic to see you get wasted in front of me just to be able to see the, like I saw the shooter immediately and then we got to fight him and kill his group. So thanks for the awesome night, dude. Oh, if that, I don't know if that was you or not. It wasn't you. Oh, it wasn't you. It wasn't you. Oh my God. Who the fuck told me that that was Felp? Were you fucking trolling me the whole time? All right. Felp is not, uh, Felp is not the guy. Felp might have been one of the guys involved. Um, but if somebody knows who Touch is, they said that Touch was streaming. Uh, yeah. If you want to fucking shout him out, I don't mind. But I gotta run to the bathroom. Thank you so much for the 10 subs, dude. So what, is Felp the fucking guy that killed Touch? Is that it? Is Felp coming in here trying to get some fucking screen time? Listen, ban this fucking... Get, uh, refund the subs. I'm just kidding. I'll be right back. I gotta piss.
Alright, I'm back. <clears throat> so like I said, 6am. We just had a badass run. Um, let's go for a little bit longer. And I think I might... I just checked my phone. I might actually be doing something for the 4th of July. Or I might just stay in. Maybe we'll try to play some games. I don't know. But if I do hang out with my buddies, I might have to wake up kind of early. So let's try to go for like at least another hour or two. Whether we survive or whether we start a freshie, I don't really mind. But um, I promise we will do a little bit more Tarkov next time. I'm going to try to get into the mindset of, uh, you know, Craven doing like some big map, like slow loot runs in scab mode. Just fucking chilling, getting the controls and like the movement, the sensitivity back down. I'm just not feeling it tonight, man. Like these daisy runs, I'd rather just have a like one long ass adventure tonight instead of dabbling in a little bit of Tarkov. So let's do it up. Oh, Phelps, it's all good. You were involved in the big shootout. You realized what happened. It's all good, man. I was just joking. Thank you so much for all the, res the uh, gifted subs, bro. It's been a fun night. Could drop this blaze and just use the AK and go from like a red dot to a snipe scope, but obviously it's not going to have the same stopping power at long range. However, we can't suppress the blaze, so might just want to be shooting the suppressed AK the whole time, anyways. Try to get into a closer range position. Maybe like go out of our way to try to hit more headshots with it. Yeah, touch seemed really cool, man. I think we probably play with him, or at least heard his voice in the servers once in the past, but I just can't put my finger on it, like which run it was. Oh, thanks, Cody. Yeah, man, I don't even know how many Tarkov wipes I've been through now. How many has it been? <clears throat> I'm not gonna lie, I was getting to the point where I just get my vendors up to level 4 and then I stop questing. I think some of the quests are interesting, but some of the missions are like, what? Yeah, it's like a fucking chore, but the gameplay is fun as hell, and that's what carries it. I think this time around we're going to try to get all the vendors to level 2, and then we'll see if we want to keep going. Zoo looks so good. These little chicken gates are the best. thinking about follow remotes. I don't know what to do with them. Uh, it's a tough call, right? Like, you don't want your follow remotes to be... Like, you don't want to put all your best emotes as follow remotes, right? Because, like, I'm not trying to force people to sub, but, like, it just doesn't make sense for you to give, like, your best emotes for follow remotes, you know? But I would love to give the basic ones, like, the wave and the heart. But a few people are bringing up, like, really good points that, um... It's not smart to do the most commonly used emotes as follower emotes. I think what it should be is kind of like quirky emotes that they're cool, but they're kind of situational. They're not really like used nonstop, and those should be the follower ones. Like maybe even some of my least used ones that I like and like I, I want to keep them, but um, maybe almost like force the followers to use them because 
the subs are using like cooler ones if that makes sense like I don't know I don't want to have like a weird tiered system but Twitch is the one that's coming up with all this shit I'm just trying to fill some slots I'm not trying to like bait anybody into subscribing or anything but yeah if you guys have any cool ideas for emotes animated emotes uh, any type of artwork you know Man Over Mars is working on that stuff for us as we speak Or just brand new ones that I, you know we don't even have made yet. Oh yeah, dude, I played with Ben quite a few times. I actually had a really good run with Ben when I wasn't even streaming. I was messing around Livonia off stream. It was one of those nights where I just wanted to meet up with a few people from the community, like just random people that passed by. I was gonna fish and like feed them and give them a little bit of loot, set them off on their run. I was using a fake voice and everything. I was just like messing around with people. And uh, Ben rolls up to my little fishing spot and starts talking to me. And I'm like, ah, oh, fuck. And uh, we ended up going on like a three hour run. We ended up having a vehicle. At the end, fucking Ben got shot out of our moving car. And um, I was actually randomly teamed up with one of the admins that's now a server admin for day one. It was me, Ben Fruit, one of the current server admins, and this other random. And uh, Ben and this other dude got gunned down, and it was me and the server admin left in a fucking car in Livonia. And, like, I'm pretty sure Ben ended the stream afterwards, and I'm just sitting there looking over at his corpse, like, what a fucking run. So the highlight of the run with Ben, when I wasn't streaming, is uh, we were building this car in a barn in a spawn town. It was me, Ben, some other dude. And uh, this fucking sketchball rolls up on the barn with an unpinned grenade in his hand. And nobody sees it at first, but I see it, and I'm like, dude, that's a fucking nade in his hands. And, uh... We immediately blast him, and the nade falls on the ground and explodes and, like, does some damage to us. It was fucking nuts. Like, and I was honestly so disappointed that I didn't stream. Because it would have been sweet to see that from my perspective, the whole, like, grenade car thing. And, uh, it's so badass. Like, dude, I watched somebody, I don't know who it was, but they killed a dude right after he had pulled the pin on the grenade. He hadn't had a chance to throw it yet, and it fucking blew up, like, his teammate. And just, just crazy moments like that with like live grenades and those little op windows of opportunity that you get it's just it's so much fun I've only had like two experiences like that too shit are you gonna die? You were watching. <laughs> that was fun. But yeah, we've also teamed up with them on stream a few times too. It's random. How long ago was it? Uh, it was when Day One Livonia was like the hot spot to be. Like right in the prime Day One Livonia days. So probably about nine months ago was it? Ten months ago now? I don't know. Time flies. We've been having a nice string of events for Day Z. Like bringing uh, Livonia to life. Then we had Namal. So now we got Esker. It's been good. Yeah, let's just say about a year. Yeah. Ooh, bear trap set up. It's kind of a terrible bear trap, I must say. Hopefully they had that covered up at one point. Oh, I do, Adamos. I do. Touch was a streamer. I run into streamers all the time. It's not bad though. There's a shit ton of non-streamers in the server. So anybody that's like, oh, these are streamer servers, they're just fucking, they're just salty about waiting in queue or something. Just listen for a second. I know a lot of people like to camp this building now.
What do you see, Daisy in one year? I don't know. This was supposed to be the year of the Daisy revival. Like the devs, um, you know, they they promised some consistent updates, which they're doing. Um, but I think the only scary thing, which I don't even know if it's true, but I guess you can actually look online and see that you know Daisy does have some job openings right now. Like if you're qualified to work and be like a Daisy developer, there's a few openings. And I feel like a couple of those need to be filled for them to progress in certain areas. Like let's say if we want to get new animations or like something fixed or changed, like one of those jobs might need filled. And if it's still not filled, then if they expected this year to be insane, but they also expected to get like two more employees and it never happened, then uh, I don't know. I'm just happy to be where we're at and I think it's going to continuously get at least better. Um, I don't know if we're going to get big changes, but honestly, dude, if you haven't realized, Bohemia has been more active about Daisy on their Twitter lately than ever before. So I feel like they got something going on. Like, I don't know if it's going to be another map like Livonia, or if they're just going to, like, try to promote more stuff for console, but Bohemia finally has accepted that Daisy is, like, one of their children, and they're fucking posting, like, sex jokes and, on Twitter and stuff about Daisy. Like, I'm not even kidding. I thought it was kind of weird that they, like, never posted about Daisy until now. So, I don't know. I think if Bohemia is actually, like, talking about Daisy, I think it's a good thing. So, we'll see what happens. Yeah, just go check. It's like Bohemia Interactive on Twitter. They got, like, some weird fucking recent Daisy posts, jokes and shit. So, maybe they got something up their sleeve for us. I don't know. They're usually talking about Arma, and probably everybody thinks they're getting ready for Arma 4 and just like abandoning and DayZ, but there's people still working on it. Something, we're gonna get some updates. Some people like to be very negative and forget that we've got a lot of good improvements over the years. are worn. Let's go down this little secret spot. Just chill out for a few. Actually, wait. I can get this backpack and make like a secret spot stash. I think that'd be kind of neat. Smoke gave me my first crossbow kill with an awesome bait. Wait, you killed me with a crossbow? Or we were teamed up and I gave you like the alley-oop through the assist? I feel like I remember that. Did we like put something on the ground and you shot the guy when he came to loot it or something? Don't you miss Namalsk? I do? Yeah, yeah. I think that um, Namalsk deserves some more time from us for sure. But I was also thinking that we were going to get a new Namalsk update that was just going to naturally bring people back. Um, so I'm kind of waiting for that to happen, but any one of these streams I'm going to play some Namalsk. I'm definitely thinking about it, dude. You got to realize, like, it, it is tempting. To, it's so special that, like, we can play this early access map and, like, provide feedback to the map owners or the map developers and, like, this whole community thing going on with like a work in progress map that's being played and tested, it's kind of cool. It's like a once in a while opportunity, whether you like totally agree with Esker or not. Um, so that I'm always thinking about that too. I know that Namalsk is going to get another heat wave once it gets a patch, once it gets like a new area or something. I'm trying to think what the fuck am I even doing right now. I'm trying to make more stamina. Stuff that we're probably not going to use tonight. Yeah, fuck it. Let's put that there too. I'm not getting a DMR tonight, I don't think.
What if I get down there if I'll be able to get out? Oh yeah, there we go. That's like a little... Eh, uh, no, maybe a little bit more. Honestly, fuck it. I bet they missed that. I bet they'll miss that if they come here. That's fine with me. Oh wow, there's a bag here I could have used. Better durability too. Alright, this will be the fake stash. They're gonna come down here and be like, Yo, dude, fucking dope stash, bro. Binos. Fucking gloves. Soda. Yeah, they'll think they got their big shit. They'll see this through the gate. They'll do the whole secret thing. They'll be satisfied with that. Yeah, what's going on? Nameless. Slapex, what's up? Tornado. Yo, a D show. Thanks for the 10 months, dude. I always hate to see when you say you're waiting on me. <laughs> you're like, well, staying up all night waiting for the smoke stream. You got like a totally different time zone than me and everything. <laughs> Thanks for the support, dude. Yo, Jaded, thanks for the 10 months. Um, yo, Hero, thanks for the 16. We got Fire, thanks for the 2. Yo, Popper, thanks for the 32 months. Um, Justin as well with the $5 tip. In that fight a couple days ago, I was the sniper with the purple backpack. I uh, was stalking a squad of 3. I sniped 1. You got the other 2 plus me. Love, Daisy. Really appreciate what you do. Oh, man. Were you, so were you talking about when you were the guy with the uh, VSS? There was a altercation at the ATC tower with like four dudes. Somebody in chat was trying to tell me about that earlier, but I missed it. Either way, dude, Justin, thanks for the five spot, man. I'm glad that we had a good run, or, uh, oh, that was you. Yeah, yeah, that was an epic fucking battle, man. I'm sorry that you died, but you guys gave us a really good time. Or, uh, you were solo and that those guys were bad guys, but yeah. Thanks, dude. That was fucking awesome. Thanks for the tip. Um, if you watch my thing back, hopefully me relogging didn't fuck you guys, uh, or fuck you up in any way. I don't think it did, right? Didn't even notice, alright. Cool. I logged in like right as those bad dudes started to clear the downstairs. Oh. Okay, let's go check that out. Yeah, the new like two people going on con together and then racing to get back up to shoot each other is nuts. I love it. I think sometimes, though, somebody gets up like two seconds before the other guy. And in this new patch, everybody's gonna have a different timer, I think, depending on like what caliber they got hit by or what kind of protection they have. If it's like a AK-74 versus an AKM, I think it's gonna be a different knockout time, right? Maybe? Plans for the fourth. Yeah, so my, my buddies are going out on a boat uh, to do something. I don't know if I want to go yet, but we'll see what's going on. Or, uh, they're getting on a boat for the fireworks. I just don't know if I trust my buddies on a small boat. Maybe I need to go to watch over them and make sure that they're safe. <laughs> oh, dude, I can't remember where those last shots came from. Thought they were going to keep going for a little bit longer. Kit. Yeah, no worries about the kit. I got plenty. Or I got one full one. That's all I need right now. But I got plenty stash. Speaking of that, let me go check on one of my stashes on the way out of here. 
But yeah, good eyes, man. You gotta check all the tables, all the boxes, pallets. There's so many cool little custom loot spawns on this map. I even found a plate carrier on that same table where you saw the weapon repair kit once. Might not be bad to get some more EpiPens, but what do I got? Oh, I got no EpiPens. Eh. Then you become an accomplice, though, right? <laughs> Gotta be careful. this channel is anybody on this frequency hello radio nobody's on the fucking radios right now Dude, the blood bag did come in clutch. I'm so pleased that we found a blood bag on a guy that we killed. Used the same test kit. So the guy that killed our buddy had a blood bag that was O positive. He also had a test kit. I used the test kit, realized that I was also O positive. And after that whole altercation, getting revenge for our buddy, I fucking used the opponent's blood to get healed back up to kill some more bad dudes. Like, only in Daisy, man. And it hardly ever happens, you know? But yeah, in this next patch, it means a lot. Like, uh, if you give somebody the wrong blood in this next patch, they're gonna immediately pass out, and then eventually, maybe die. Okay, hold on. I don't- I'm gonna exit the zoo, but I'm gonna put up my away screen for a second here, guys. I'm gonna mute the PC. Um, because... I need to check on one of my stashes real quick. So yeah. You know, we're just going to sit here and chill, in dead silence. You're just going to listen to me talk about nothing. Actually, you can listen to the game audio, I don't mind. Oh yeah, and if you want to pick up this poster made by the talented man of Mars, you can do exclamation point poster. Oh my god, no. No, 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 this isn't happening. <clears throat> it's been a good day. It's been a real good day, but I got some bad news, guys. <laughs> I got some fucking bad news. Okay, the main stash with all the DMR parts, except for the body piece, is gone. I'm just gonna say it. It's fucking gone. The barrel, I'm not showing you guys because I don't want to show you where this spot is. I'm gonna, here, let me run out of here. So the barrel is gone. Okay, one of my other stashes, though, has, like, the, the buttstock, the mag, and the front grip. So, yeah, it's, I mean, it's all good. At the end of the day, we're two parts away from it at all times, right? If you get the barrel and the body piece, then you can walk around and, like, build it up in your hands. That's kind of cool. So, you know, we lost the fucking barrel. That sucks. But, you know, some people literally just farm heli crashes all day and they fucking get their shit back. Here, I'll take the away screen off in a second, guys. Once I get this zombie in my face, I'll take it off. I don't know. I'm sh I don't think it despawned. I think somebody just moved it. Because we already knew that somebody knew about my stash. And I was hoping that they were going to be cool. But I don't think they were going to be cool. I've been gone for a while, too. You gotta remember, I was like gone for the whole weekend. And then we came back and somebody had found it and taken a few things. And it's just like, at the end of my stream, my, I don't really want to log in and like move shit around off stream. Because you walk around like this with a barrel. This is how fast you walk. It's kind of, eh, it's kind of tedious. It's all good, it's all good. We seriously have like two or three more barrels that have goodies in them. We just don't have all the parts anymore. 
Hmm. It's alright. It's alright. We've had a good day. No, no. This server has some mods. Like, the whole building gun that we're talking about is a mod. Unless I'm on a different server, but no, this is probably, this is the right server. I'll check at the end, but it's probably gone. It's all good. The other stash I made has an extra set of night vision. He's going for where I missed. The zombie's gonna go for the uh, bullet that hit the wall. <laughs> I'll take it. Critical hit. I wonder if that counted as like a back smack. Or if he was just that weak. Oh, he was that weak because we headshotted him. That was weird. First headshot didn't kill him. Of course, his bag is ruined from a pistol whip. If I smacked your fucking Jansport with my pistol, I sure as hell am not ruining that thing. Ooh, hella crash over here. Beard check. Ooh, say less. Let me get in this red house. Last time we checked, it's pretty good looking, pretty thick. No, I'm just kidding. I would never do that. Yeah, you can shave it all off. phases are in the game. I don't know man. I think there's two characters that have the best looking beards or like the fullest gnarliest looking ones. And then a couple of the other guys you're thinking like they could go a little bit longer but they don't. Um what do you guys think? Has anybody tested it? What is it like 16 hours alive is the biggest beard or 24 hours? I don't know.
Oh my god, that zombie that's stuck in the heli. I thought it was a guy looting it. Oh, god. Don't do that. Wait a minute, why don't I have a lockpick? I could have sworn that we had lockpicks earlier. Do I have something minimized like Touch did? I do have something minimized like Touch did. Fuck. That's been like that for a while. Just fuck it. What? Alright, give me the barrel back. I lost the barrel today. <gasps> What's that? Uh, what? Uh, what? No. I had a bunch of mags for this. Where did I put them? Which stash did we put them in? The backpack stash, maybe? What's that? Oh, DMR mag, nice. Yeah, I think we just spent one day looting a bunch of heli crashes. We'd get the damn DMR. I just gotta do it. Oh, wait. Zombie aggro? Is it on me? Trying to get the twofer. What are you doing? Uh. I mean, at the end of the day, if we're gonna take an M4, like I got the AK, we've already got this. With tons of mags and ammo ready to go. So that's not a thing. Sadly. But the Fel. I mean. A Fel could replace the Blaze for sure. Did I stash a Fel mag or did we just drop them all? I know I had some. We're just going to do this. I might be a bad call. At the end of the day, we got a two-shot blaze. We're going to take a one-shot fell until we can get a mag, because we got a scope. We'll go with this scope. we we'll go with this scope. Which, what in the fuck? So, wait a minute. Actually, that looks good right there. But this has so much empty space. I'm not really down with that, actually. I think when 1.13 uh, hits, this, this thing should probably be taken out, because we're getting like a new uh, 6x ACOG. That has a red dot on top like this. So, I don't know. This thing might be temporary. Let's 
pistol's empty. You seen a real hammer? It's more open than that scope. Yeah, I've seen other hammers in other games. You know, someone's gonna find that. It's okay. I can at least put this M4 in my hands for a second. It's also got an interesting modded optic. You go from ACOG to red dot. Was it the uh, fell nerfed quite a bit? I don't really know. How badly was it nerfed? All I'm thinking about is like if you hit the first shot and then they get stunned, then it's easy to get the second and third shot. Did we put a fell mag in the secret room stash though? The last one that we made with the backpack. <laughs> He's like, I see you, bro. You think we did? Alright, let's go back there. I think it was an M14 mag, but it might, I might have had one fell mag. I feel like I would at least keep one. I want that soda. Are you so aware and mad at me? What have I done? <laughs> Is this where I like dust off my shoulder a little bit? So we'll go back to the secret spot, maybe see some people by the zoo. See if we can get a foul mag at least. Yo, Uncle Ray Ray, what's up, dude? Planning on uh, terrorizing the fucking server this evening by any chance? <laughs> Should I log the fuck out or you, are you hopping on or? So, we got the DM DMR mag. I got something to can fix that. <laughs> you, do, you do your part to help the queue go down. I appreciate that, dude. Everybody's got to get their chance to get fucking massacred. It's always good to have new customers, too, you know? Okay, so back to the zoo. Why am I so lost? This way. Uh. 
Oh, a little bit too much to jump. Let's see if we can free up enough stamina so we can jump a bit. Might have to be our last clock here. Yo, Cole, thanks for the five months, dude. You get me hooked on Daisy. Love the content. Dude, I love hearing that shit, man. Thank you so much for supporting. Can I jump now? Alright. Let's heat up the beans. Is that an SR25 mag? It looks like it. It's actually a DMR mag. So the same bullets that go into a Mosin will go into this magazine. And then you can put it into a semi-auto DMR, which... You know, usually, usually something like that's a little bit too far for me when it comes to Daisy. I look at this game like civilian basic weapons and shit, but uh... There's always been some military stuff, so it's gotta be like the upper tier of crazy good guns. At least a few of them. I think the neatest part about this is that you have to build the gun to actually use the crazy semi-auto. They look like 5.56 rounds there, but they're uh, 7.62 by 5.4. And if you build that shit, I mean, maybe you deserve to get a couple kills with it. There is a pretty good looking modded SR25 though. I remember using that in like one of the versions of the Daisy mod. Like a, a mod of the mod, so to say. It was such a good gun. Do you really need the pistol? Nah, you're fucking right. If I can't jump right here, let's drop the pistol. Oh, I just heard a crazy gun. Did you hear that? How can I still not jump? Oh, yeah. Hmm. When's the last time we made a fire on Esker? Oh, there we go. We barely got over it. Nice. NVGs. No, I just have the NVG strap and that's actually pretty good. The other day we had a bunch of kills just because of the night vision, really. At least I think it helped us a bit. Man, touch didn't make it. Touch got blasted at a water pump. Yeah, play carry sucks for stamina, but you know, if we have this AK and we just have two optics, one assault rifle, nothing else drop all the excess loot you can have pretty decent stamina with a plate carrier at least like 50 to 60 percent if you really drop almost everything i mean shit if we dropped everything except for like the gun and the armor i wonder how much we could really have that'd be kind of a neat test actually i'd be down to do that real quick If I can make it to the stash, we'll do it. My problem with the animals in the zoo here is they often get stuck on things and then they just start moaning like that endlessly. I gotta put them out of their misery. Drop a golden deagle and four mags for stamina. Dude, next time you got a drop for stamina, just find a backpack and make a little deagle backpack stash. And then if you die in the next like six hours, you're good. Or the next few hours, you gotta make it back to it. I think one of the best guns to stash would be a deagle because it's like really good, but you can fit it in a small stash.
Where the hell are you going? Oh, not actually stuck. Let's make some fucking noise here. Oh. Sorry. I thought they were stuck. Somebody hears a fell though, they might come running trying to get it. There's always a couple of zoo dwellers. What did I just say? A couple of fucking zoo dwellers. Something, something to time up, something to time up, something to time up. He's got no guns, let's see what happens when he wakes up. He's banging, he's banging. Don't fucking move, ass swipe. Walk in the fucking building. Are you fucking serious? You did it. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I guess when you wake up and you're fucking almost dead with no guns, maybe you'll just do it. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what the fuck? At that point, I mean, yeah. He realized he didn't have a fucking chance, I guess. I've just, no hesitation, dude. No hesitation. He didn't even, like, he didn't even try to talk to me. Like, why didn't you try to talk yourself out of that? I probably would have let him fucking talk himself out of that. I was just honestly, like, joking. Who the fuck would do that? I just want to grab the soda, and I, I heard his ass creeping in the bushes over there. <laughs> He's like, alright. Well, fuck it. You got me. <laughs> I was hoping he was just going to launch himself in there immediately trying to bandage. This guy's a fucking hero. Alright, beard check. Pathetic, dude. How long you been out? You got a plate carrier, you got all these fucking guns. You don't even got a beard, son. How fucking fast did you gear up? What the fuck? Oh, here's something. <laughs> Whoa, that was a double shot. Let's grab his shit, take- ooh, damn, good suppressor. That's for the build gun actually. It's for the scout and M4s, but also the build gun Even if you're shooting 7.62 by, uh, 54. Is that a fronta? Oh. He woke up and checked his back pocket for his trusty AK. It's so sick.
Damn, dude. Oh, this bag is fucking ruined. It's gonna despawn. Let's just drop all this shit. It'll last longer. Then in the bag, at least. Well, I don't even know why I'm dropping all of it. I'm not gonna use all this shit. Uh, F and X. I want to use this pistol more often. I feel like I just don't really get it when I need it. Got off for a while. What happened here, buddy? He got killed at a water pump, dude, but we immediately avenged him and, like, killed the whole squad that, that fought him, so it was fun. Oh, that was a snap. Kind of close. I'm not too worried about gear this late in the night. We're already super kitted out of our minds. I definitely think this guy's my cow keys, though. Is that a shot on you? Nah, no way. We never truly know, but I don't think get an angle on us. Yeah, his comms were great, man. <clears throat> I could play with someone like him all the time. Good comms. Seems like he really values his life in the game. When we were robbing him, it seemed like he really cared about not getting fucking killed. He was a good guy. He saved my ass once. Once or twice. Saved my ass. What were we doing here again? Oh yeah, I'm going to the secret stash. Reload. Uh, reload the AK. Oh god, man. Nice. Shit, dude. Take the sticks. It's too late for me. Haven't really had a good opportunity to use that 338 snipe except for once. We got a few kills with it, but really only heard the loud boom of it like once. So, the mission is the DMR, but the secret mission that I'd rather do right now is probably the 338 sniper. Try to get that in our hands. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, you can suppress a 338 with a bottle suppressor, but I don't know if I agree with it. I feel like you just shouldn't be able to. Because some people will make sure that they never fire that gun without one. I just think they need to let that shit loose. Let everybody know. But yeah, not me too. I was shooting it suppressed. I had a bottle suppressor on there. I think it should just be one shot only, if anything. Maybe it is. Is it only one shot for the water bottle? Is it Daisy Steam Pack with Livonia with Vine? So if you love Daisy, you might eventually try to join like a full good Livonia community server. But currently Livonia doesn't have much population. It's not very there's not many servers. However, I'm like on my to-do list is to try and populate day one Livonia, because it has helicopters. It's a really good fucking server. It's one of our servers. And uh, if you ever want to play there, you need Livonia. Yeah. So, you want to throw down the extra 10 bucks or whatever, it might be a good time. Or it might be, you know, you don't need it because you have all these other maps to play for now. And you can always buy it later. Felmag, Felmag, Felmag. Oh, we were all wrong, dude. I trusted you guys. You fucked me. It's not your fault, though. You thought this was a Felmag. It's an M14 mag. So this is the new modded M14. There's no Felmag in here. It's okay, though. It's my fault. 
a couple of you guys told me, but I wanted to check anyways. <clears throat> um, it's all good. I want to come here anyways. <laughs> you fucked me. You fucked us over. Stream's ruined. Alright, we got one full DMR mag on us. Let's just keep one full snipe mag on us too. You never know. We might get the gun. Sorry, we still got a single shot fell. And we really should just be using the suppressed AK anyways, so people don't know where we're at. Mm, stamina? Let's see. Stamina's right there. It's about the halfway point right there, so... Not the best, not the worst. Oh, sorry. Yeah, what's up, Mouth? Yeah, I got a new mic today, guys, so... I hooked up the new mic, so if I sound, if you hear a little like background noise, like my keyboard clicking or me like drinking my water or something, um, I'm gonna try to get that tightened up for you. Inventory management so quick and efficient. Kudos. Oh man, the one thing I can recommend for anybody doing the inventory stuff is like scopes, man. If you have like a red dot and a scope, it's so nice to be able to just like, let's say I had a red dot right here, I could just drag the scope on top of it, and then the red dot would fly on. That's like the one thing I'd want to recommend. Always have that easy transition up there. Any tips for a new streamer? Your mic sounds fantastic. Yeah, for a new streamer, don't fucking worry about your mic. Worry about all the other stuff first, and then if you start consistently streaming... Oh, I can't get through. I used a, uh, like a Logitech G430 for years, man. I never had any professional audio for the longest time. I got partnered and consistently streamed and got going with like the worst mic ever so or a decent mic I mean sorry I gotta run to the bathroom anyways let's see if this unbugs um, Logitech G430 was like a $70 headset mic built in together and it's all you need man just to get started and then if things are going well that's when you start making the crazy like the worst thing you can do is invest in like a full-blown professional streamer rig before you're even getting going you know, because you might figure out it's not the thing for you, or you might figure out that the journey is going to take a lot longer than you thought it was going to take. And uh, every, a lot of the other things matter a lot more. There's some people out there with like, I remember like Summit 1G is another one where he didn't have a professional mic until like a year ago or something. And you know how long he's been streaming and nobody even gave a shit. So just focus on the other stuff, but I'll be right back. Alright. Let's look at the time, and we probably got at least another... I'm trying to adjust my mic here. Um, probably got at least another hour in us until we gotta go, guys, so... Let's we'll get the fuck out of here and try to make the most of it. Let's go to somewhere we haven't been yet today. Oh yeah, listen to Gustav in chat. He's really good with the audio stuff. 
um, look up the Rode NT Mini USB for a cheaper starter type but still amazing quality. There you go. Mini. Rode NT Mini USB. There you go. What the fuck's going on here? Okay, there we go. God, imagine if a sniper's holding your position and you get stuck there. No Tarkov today? Nah, no Tarkov to this stream because we've had such a good Daisy run. I was gonna swap to Tarkov if we had like a reminder from Daisy. Like if Daisy said fuck you, then we were gonna swap over, but it's been a good day. My biggest grievance with Tarkov right now is um when you swap from playing so much Daisy to Tarkov, I swear the sensitivity and the movement feels so it's like I'm on ice skates and I'm like hurting my fucking arm sometimes to like readjust to different sensitivities with the gear. So I really need to just get on there off stream, go into like offline factory with no bots, and just like swing my mouse around and try to find try to like match it to Daisy. But then again, if we kill a geared guy in a raid and put on like level four armor, it's gonna change the sensitivity. <clears throat> so honestly that that's one of the things more than anything that's like driving me away right now, is I just like don't wanna deal with that right now. It's not like a big enough update for me to fucking throw my arm out of whack and my sensitivity muscle memory out of whack, but I'm gonna play some more regardless. I guess loot can spawn in this nice look. Oh, look at that. A bait potato in the cage. If you thought that last kill was good, we gotta get something in this cage. Nah, that's not gonna happen. Yeah, but apparently if you're in there, you can't get out. Am I hearing something? And yeah, one of the plans right now could be to get a second AK rail and then put a close range like red dot on there and then we can just easily drag and drop. Put the bait in the cage. I yeah, put like a full blown AK in there in the back corner and just wait. bring people towards us. I don't mind making some noise this late at night. After getting that rush of like five dudes in the same area, I just want it again. I want like fucking a swarm of fully geared bad dudes. Because we're so geared up. And I bet one of these guys out there has the DMR. It's probably just suppressed so we haven't heard it. Really don't even know what it sounds like. What the fuck is that? Oh, gloves. It's one of those items you gotta look real close and hold down F. Yoink that shit out of existence. Or out of the abyss. Yo, Monk, did you change your name and add an extra O? Or have you always had two O's in your name? How am I just realizing that now? Whoa. Why can I jump over this now? What did I pick up? Oh, we picked up that new magazine. I'm gonna drop the scope. Fuck that thing. There we go. You noticed? 
I got an extra. Oh, dude, how the fuck? <laughs> First of all, why'd you add an extra? Oh, second of all, how did I notice that? I don't know. Why not? I don't know, because it's just, just fucking... You just got the original name, man. I like it, though. I like it. Sorry, I shouldn't say that to people that changed their name because they wanted to. I'm sorry. I like it. I trust your decision. It's your name. You do what you want. Can you list your Marwan mod somewhere? Because I remember you had a nice setup. Oh, yeah, dude. So, GamerZack on YouTube, I followed his exact guide, mod for mod. It's uh, GamerZack. So, Z A. KH or Z A H K. It's like Gamer Zach's Marwind modding tutorial. And it was probably like 2019 or some shit. He might even have a new one by now. And uh, if you. We do have a command for it. I just don't remember what the command is. Maybe exclamation point Marwind. I want to say his video was like 20 minutes. It has you download a few things. I don't know, maybe we deleted the command, I'm not sure. There you go, there's the link. But, again, that's a year old, maybe you could find a better one. But that was, honestly, I want to go back and play those mods. It's so tricky because there could be a... A pack of mods that's really good, and then there's a completely different pack of mods that's really good, so... Maybe that means multiple playthroughs. Okay, we got some shots, finally. But just be careful, man. You know how it goes. Like, you don't want to get a corrupted save file with those mods. Make lots of saves. Make a save, like, before and after you mod shit. You might have to start a fresh character once you add the mods. You can't just, like, jump in with them, so... Be very careful. Always save your progress. And maybe even do your own research and see if there's like a newer set of mods out there in like a YouTube video. Son. Now let's just roam around the city and then we'll eventually either break off to the airfield or the mill base up in the hills. <laughs> well, it took the entire server a while to loot back up. <laughs> ah. We only killed like eight of them or something. Maybe they're at the police station. The heli's still there, probably baiting him over to it. Somebody's gotta be near that heli at the police station. That's probably where the shots are. Zombies. I died the other night. It's bringing back bad memories. Somebody was sitting right here, and they killed me right there in that little narrow hallway. That was the worst. I was trapping zombies. What's the server pop at? Oh, last time I checked, it was high 40s, but I'm literally getting off within the next 50 minutes. 
So I don't really care, man. We just heard shots. This map is so damn small, in, in a sense, that like, it could be fun with 20 players, so I don't really care. In the beginning, we were like, what? There, there should probably be like 30 players for this map until they expand it, but... I don't know. 50, it's a good amount. 50's good. But when we started experiencing all that mass amount of players and like Borish and all the spawn zones, we thought 50 was even too much at one point. Until the spawns got changed and the map got expanded like a little bit. Not even that, they just changed some stuff. Holy shit! It's behind us. I don't always really like chasing shots like this, but let's do it. Did you guys smell me? Nah, fuck this. Whoa, 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 what the hell was that? What? Are you still alive? Oh, I have to take care of all this guy's zombies because I'm right in their path. Well, I guess I don't have to. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't actually. Let's just go flank while they're fucking around with all these zombies. Okay, it's up top and fragging them. Frag out. Throw on the grenade.
Where'd this guy go? No, it's for when people are camping and they hear a fucking grenade pin get pulled. Chances are if somebody's camping and there's a window or a door next to them, they're gonna start making footstep noises after they hear that pin. But that's the type of shit I don't want to explain too much, you know? Because I don't want everybody fucking doing it. I don't want people doing it to me, I mean. <laughs> But it's pretty obvious. And it's already worked for us once today. I think we were right next to this guy at one point, but then I totally lost him and he could be anywhere now. Is that a dead snake? Oh, it's a knife. <laughs> Drop the clock. Now, nah, we were saying it the other day, the grenades really should make a sound when they get dropped, when they get thrown especially. Oh wow, that's kind of neat. You can see the bridge. I wonder if those little rails would block a shot though. Yo, Miriam. Thank you so much dude for the 5 month sub. Silly, thanks for the 7 months. We got Adel Scott, thanks for the 2. Uh, JPZ, thanks for the 9 months dude. Longest subscription to anyone. Thank you for countless hours of entertainment. I'm new to, P I'm new to the PC and uh, loving the servers. Can't wait to do... Um, can't wait to do some sets, get hype, and get j and jumped on. Oh, dude, enjoy the fucking workout, and thanks for playing the servers, dude. Getting fucking juiced up before your session. That's the key. You're gonna have an edge against your opponents in combat. Thank you so much, dude. And, um, alone as well, thanks for the three months. I appreciate you, man. Is this guy running after somebody? Is UMP any good? Uh, I mean, it's a good zombie killer. I heard this update put like 45 and 9 mil in about the exact same area, stats wise. But I feel like I'm never really using 45 guns. I'm not finding the bullets, I'm not really finding a need to use the guns. Because I always have something else. But yeah, the key right now is to get any pistol or submachine gun, slap a suppressor on there, and kill zombies with it. So, the UMP is great for that. Is it good for killing players? Eh. Probably not versus armor. No, I didn't save the Marwan playthrough because we didn't do a full playthrough. We just kind of dabbled around with it for a little bit. We planned on just like checking it out, seeing if the mods were stable and good, and then we're going to come back to it. 
and do like a fresh playthrough. Maybe even with like updated mods. Ooh, wait a second. Am I almost out of bullets? 100% we're gonna play more Mario Winter. I'm just waiting for like a significant amount of downtime with all the other games that I enjoy. Marwind is a time sink, in a good way. Marwind is not the type of game I just want to jump on for five hours. It would literally be like a month, or months and months of playtime, you know, if we really got into it. I miss him too, man. One of these days I'm going to be in like a really chill mode and we're just going to jump back on Marwind. It's going to take quite a bit of preparation though to get all those mods back installed and just make sure that we got good ones so we're not crashing. Yeah, Skywind, exactly, man. I was also kind of hoping for Skywind. But I think that maybe it would make sense to do just a modded Marwan playthrough before Skywind, because it's worth it. Super nostalgic. I think a lot of you guys that haven't played Marwan in years would like to see a little glimpse of, like, the modded, updated version of it, too. Whoa. Dude, wait a minute. I killed this zombie ages ago, and he fell on top of the helicopter, okay? Same with that other zombie ages ago and they haven't despawned that means somebody's here camping probably somebody is keeping them in play how long ago was it at least like 20 minutes they should have despawned but somebody's around killed by like a close range camper when I can go for those shots. Yo. Anybody up there? Let's just talk this out. something. I think they're in this building right here. I heard something. Yo, he's in police. Frag out. <laughs> Alright, I don't think that. No, 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 no. no. blow yourself up doing that? Nah, but my teammate the other day blew himself up by unpinning the grenade, trying to repin re it, and then he put it back on his chest rig, and he fucking blew up. Some random dude that we were playing with, having a good time. I'm going to sacred on somebody else, I think. <laughs> Look at this little setup, dude. You come into the fucking Esker PD, you get hooked up with the armor, the dope new shoddy. It's already strapped with a multitude of rounds, all three types. Look at this fucking thing. 
No, it'd be crazy if it did come with shells and like each time you found it, it had like a different maybe it just had like one buckshot or three buckshot. That'd be kind of neat. But yeah, that's just for looks. The side saddle, yeah. Dude, I almost think that Daisy could have a shotgun to customize. Like, it would be this, but with nothing. And then you find the side saddle, you find, you know, you mount the flashlight, you get the red dot. I don't know, that side saddle could be an attachment for all I care. Be like faster reloads, like a little perk. Just shoot it to attract the whole city. I don't even have any shells. Might be hearing somebody. A zombie. Hey. So many fucking zombies. Yeah, I'm inside, I'm inside, I'm inside. I'm throwing a frag at him. He's upstairs throwing it out in the window. No, I didn't get him. I missed. I'm throwing another one. Yeah, that one's in. That one's in. It's gonna get him. This guy's got some balls. Fucking did it, dude. There we go. Upstairs window, up on the roof.
Oh, he's probably on the fucking roof. I wasted my nades. Oh, I can't make that jump, that would have been so dope. Is this guy hiding on the roof? That shit is fucking trash. Oh, there's somebody's over on somebody else, I think. I came out of your little cave. Well, that was the guy in his cave. Never mind, this other guy's new. <laughs> Just get fucked. <laughs> uh, he looked at me like, well, it's about that time. Just fucking do it. He's like, well, you fucking got me, dude. Didn't even raise his gun. So that guy's probably in the back left corner by now. Reloading. Yeah, we got minus one bullet out of a 30 rounder. I think we're alright. Fuck, where'd this guy go? <sighs> Wait. I think we just heard him. Did he see me? Oh, you piece of fucking shit.
No, good GG, bro. GG, I had to die eventually, you fucking crazy juggernaut fuckers. I'll fucking pop your ass, dude, but you got me. <laughs> I have finished it, dude. I gotta go to bed anyways, you fuckers. Dude, that was so much fun to watch that fully geared dude drop in one little head tap, though. He's like, eh, just fucking hits the deck. Oh, I got too cocky, bro. All we had to do was fall back after we tapped that first guy. Just fall back and fucking, like, just play with their mind a little bit. Oh, it would have been dope. I couldn't resist, dude. I, could, I had to go for the fucking spray down, man. Oh, guys, it's good. That's a good fucking note to end it on, man. I gotta see if that dude that we're playing... I've been trying to end. I'm not even kidding. I've been trying to end because this dude that we played with earlier, his name's Touch. And uh, he streams on Twitch. We gotta see if we can still raid him. Uh, let's see if he's streaming right now, because th this whole run was pretty much, like, you know, put together with him. So, let's see if he's still online. I'm gonna pass you guys over immediately here. Ah, oh, okay, he's still on. Perfect, he's still on. Alright, let's get, let's go make this guy's night. He's only been on for fucking five hours. Dudes, before we go over there, um, thank you so much for the awesome stream. It's been a fucking blast. We've been on for, like, seven and a half hours. I usually want to go a little bit longer, but whenever you have these daisy runs where it's just, like, a good, uh, a good start and a good finish, let's just call it, man. Um... Be a widespread. Thank you so much for the 19 months. Um, we'll be on for some more games, guys. I don't know if I'm doing something uh, for this 4th of July weekend, Saturday and Sunday or not. Uh, depends, you know, if I go out with my buddies or how we're feeling and stuff. So I'll try to get back on as soon as possible. I'm fucking craving. I'm craving more Daisy, and I'm trying to crave a little bit of Tarkov. You know, we're going to do a mix of the two for a little bit. So, um, but yeah, reclusive. Thanks for the six months, dude. What's up, friendly? We got um, Smoke as well. Or uh, Hana, thanks for the three month prime sub, dude. We got Koala, thanks for the two months. Um,. Thank you guys so much for making this such a fun stream. Kippy as well. Thanks for the eight months of Prime, dude. Hang out for just a few minutes here, guys. Let me send the raid over. Um, yeah, follow me on Twitter. I'll make a post before we go live again. Check out the YouTube if you want to see some uh, Daisy highlights. And we'll be back with some more games soon. Let me find his channel, and I will talk to you guys on the next one. Um, check this guy out. We went on an awesome run with him earlier. If you guys are just coming in for the last few runs, or sorry, the last few hours, um, we played with this guy for... What was it, like four hours or something? The majority of the stream we were playing with this guy. And we had a really sweet run. He actually saved my ass. Um, and then I saved his ass. We just kept, like, you know, kind of bouncing back and forth off each other. So check this guy out, and uh, I'll see you guys soon.